are. I really, really hope. Really hope. That the audio is good. Which is what we're going to make sure of because the last time we did this, the audio always was a little bit tricky to the point where I have to actually have the volume mixer open at all times. <laughs> Let's see. Stream 4 star. Very nice. It has to be open at all times to make sure it doesn't go whack. Alright, so. Use Trish phone. <gasps> Wait, no, hold on. There we go. Alright, cool. Down, down, up, up, right, left, down, right, left, in, in. All right, seems good. Seems all sorts of good. No, who is massaging me? Let's see, nope, that's fine. I can ignore that. All right, cool. So, all sorts of good. So, let's be. Ah, oh God, it's so weird that like this is what I'm playing off of. So you guys can see, it has the same stuff. Well, okay, you can't really see, and I have to like pull a lot of wires. And the green screen doesn't <laughs> But um, yeah, I have to look down at this and make it a goal not to seem like I'm just like this the whole time, like ignoring you. And I need to make it a point to go to options. I cannot forget to do this. Battle scene is on. There we go. Oh, and before I want to begin, I want to give a shout out to a friend of mine. Dustner, thank you so much for following. I don't know if you'll see this, but I just want him to know I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, so. Yeah, so, let's begin. Hello everyone, my name is Max Zordak. Welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver. It, for some reason, I'm like half in the headspace of not even being here. That's why I'm like, Ooh. but um, it's been a while. It's been a while. I'm going to come clean. We stopped this series because I realized I was going to have to grind a bunch. And, um, hang on, I should pull up my OneNote that has my, who should we call it for the Nuzlocke? There we go. Yeah, this whole, let's switch, let's switch to desktop real quick. All right, this whole big ass list of different people who died, who straight up died. Yeah, Ice Path Delibird dead and I don't care. And, um... I'm gonna phone call in game. Mm, oh, hold on. I should probably actually turn so you guys can see it. Thank you for interrupting, Vance. Anyway, so we ha like we had to grind a whole bunch more Pokemon, and it just kind of drove me nuts. And I was just like, man, this sucks. I don't want to do it. So I took a break with the goal of wanting to rebuild the team and stuff. Except I hated grinding. So it took me forever and we started Final Fantasy 7 and we went through all of Final Fantasy 7 and now we're finally back So 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 I say all this we need to give everyone items first and foremost, but um Who do I call it? Uh, oh God, uh, I don't even know who to hmm We can probably give the mystic water to uh, oh yeah, I should also explain um my team and stuff first. But yeah, it is my goal today that we are going to beat the 8th gym, get through Victory Road or whatever it is, and beat the Elite Four. And then I recognize... <sighs> Max, you see my breath. Yeah. But, um... Alright, I recognize that this game... Because I played Crystal, but I never played Soul Silver until this. Um, there's a way that you can go into, like, the first generation area, Johto, whatever it's called. Johto? Kanto? I always forget. And, um, you can fight all those gym leaders in their lead four, and I think somewhere there's, like, the number of, like, you can fight red, and red's, like, level 80 or some insane shit. Hang on. Um, uh, 75. Yeah. 75. Re Wait, hold on. Let's see. Note, all the gyms can be battled any order in Kanto, save for Blue, who is the 8th leader, and, but only if you solve the power plant problem. Finishing the power plant allows access to Misty, Brock, and Blaine. 
Yeah, level 54, 4, 3, 6, 50, 55, 59, 60. Pokemon Trainer Red, level 88. We ain't doing that shit. We are going to walk our happy asses to the Elite Four in our region, beat them, and call it. Not to say this series wasn't fun. I just kind of got burned out from it, which is ironic because there's actually another Pokemon series I was thinking of doing, but it's going to have a much different air to it, and we'll address it when we get there. <gasps> our team. We should look at our team. Okay, so we're taking our party. Switch it. There we go, so we can see everyone. I got it. We remember I got a Sheldon. I was super excited. I trained it up. Uh, I hated Electro, but I have him. Polyworld is fun, but I never got a Water Stone. I discovered the only way to repeatedly get Water Stones on Heart Scales and shit like that is in Kanto or Johto, whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, I got a Tentacruel, who I was honestly pretty happy with. Tentacruel's... Okay. A lot of people shit on Zubat. A lot of people shit on Tentacruel. A lot of people shit on Raticate. I genuinely like all three of them, so... Yeah, uh, Kingler, which still doesn't have Crab Hammer. I don't know why it does not have a physical water move. I think they fixed that in later generations, but still. I uh, got a Crobat, got a Raticate, and got a Quagsire. Everyone's level 43, but this is the team I decided, even though I technically could have a team of entirely water types and get away with it, which I was tempted about, but I didn't want to do. Uh, with, um, let's see, Slowbro, still our mascot. Uh, which reminds me, I never changed over there that that um porygon and i do not care to so i won't uh typhlosion being our solid fire type tangrowth being our grass type with you know these are guys that we could use but i don't want to so there you go <gasps> we got tangrowth noctowl and wookton kind of overlap a little bit but i think they do so pretty well in different ways because um frit is all hang on let's see frit is all physical it's normal, you can see you know, up top, uh, it's normal dark fighting while it's all physical based. While we go to Noctowl, Hyper Beam, Air Slash, Extra Sensory, it's all special based. So I think they'll kind of fill their own nicks a little bit. There is some overlap with this team though, I will say that. Uh, we got Solar Beam and Sunny Day on Sudi Snoot. I'm going to be honest, okay, so for a while, Tangrowth was my main grass type. I was like, yeah, Tangrowth is great. And I never actually used them in a game. It's just on paper and like doing my research. I was like, this is dope. I'm kind of against him now. <laughs> Maybe he'll prove himself. Maybe he'll prove himself. But I was like, man, I should go back to using Leafeon. But um, yeah, then we got Lidilict, who is, yes, he is a water electric. Or she is a water electric, but also has Blizzard Signal Beam. Yeah, so there definitely is some repeat coverage, if you will, in our team focus. But, I think we're going to do just fine. Especially since... I have too much spit in my mouth. <gasps> Especially since... Um, hmm, we got to figure out items. Shell Bell, I'm kind of tempted to give... Wait, no, hold on. Don't I have a charcoal? I have a charcoal, don't I? Yeah, so we'll give we'll give a charcoal to Sudi Snoot. Which just, you know, seems bright in the world. Uh, we'll give the Twisted Spoon to Gisop. We'll give the Mystic Water. What does the Miracle Seed do again? Uh, it views the life with the, the powers of grass type moves. That's going there. These are all pretty straightforward. Just whatever is their main element plus 10% damage. You know, it's pretty dang good. Uh, Never Melt Ice. We don't have an electric one, so I'm going to give that to Lidilic so it has something. Um, Mystic Water, we're going to give that to Garnid, and then lastly for Wookton, because Wookton is like, to use D&D terminology, Wookton is like the fighter of the group. Can you hear that? That's Molly. Hey, Molly. But, um... So in D&D, a lot of people give the fighter class a lot of shit because, you know, everyone else gets magical powers and, like, rage of the gods and, like, super stealthy sneak damage. But the fighter is always just kind of crapped on because it's like, oh, you're going to swing your sword. Right. He's going to swing his sword better than anyone else. He is the best at swinging his sword. He is the best physical whatever. Okay, that's debatable. But. Can you hear? It's pretty cute. It's pretty dang cute. That's my sister's bulldog. <laughs> You're pretty cute. <laughs> ah. Hey, 
mommy. I can't play right now. Oop. Dog toy. Alright. Let's go. There. Hopefully I won't regret that decision. But, um... What was I saying? Yeah, he may be our physical who gives a shit a thon kind of a thing, but I think he's gonna be able to power through and just do really good stuff. Alright, so if we're gonna go up against ice. Or we're going up against dragon, we don't want to use fairies, because fairy types don't exist here, we need someone who can allow to Okay, let's start with Garnid. Just to get a good baseline. Mm. Oh yeah, that's right. What? Oh. oh yeah. That's right. Yeah, we fought this guy. We fought this guy, and he was like, oh my goodness, you are so much higher level than the rest of us. Holy shit. Let's see, um Yeah. Which is why we then were like, uh, we need to go train. Because these guys are high fucking level. 35, okay, we should be able to handle that. I mean, you're Jatini. I don't think you do anything too special. Let's just Zen headbutt you and see how far we can get in life. Yeah, actually, yeah, because I've been training against guys that are level 20. For the record, the champion is level 50. So, it's not like I'm mega far ahead of absolutely everyone else. But, we have trained up a bit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, let's see. Actually, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, how's how is Garanid faster than you? Okay, that's scary. That's... Drag Rage is one of those moves that's like, you know, at lower levels, it's devastating. At higher levels... Take a risk. There we go. I was going to say, what the fuck? Like, what in the world? <sighs> I'm going to go, 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 go heal. Max, you just started. Yeah. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> just in general. Oof. Yeah, I, I can just I can just feel the the countdown on that. Oh, it wasn't good. Oh, I didn't like it. Can you see my mouse? You can see my mouse. Do I have a silver Pokemon? I think you have a spell silver Pokemon. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Oof. Sacred Pokemon. Make sure now you gotta take him. Oof. Next time I'll just use Blizzard. Maybe. I don't know, is Lance the one that... Is it Lance? Because wasn't, wasn't Lance the champion in another region? That, that was the whole shtick. There we go. There we go. There we go. Alright, cool. Uh, just uh, don't mind me if you just, you, you just go this way. And then just go this way. Just gotta just say if you don't mind, I could just uh, do. Hmm. I suspect they want me to go. Oop. Wait. Yeah, I was gonna say like, hey, 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 hang on, I'm, I'm feeling kind of dumb. <laughs> so like we oh, all use dragon type Pokemon. One here, fun fact: what we all use dragon type, all of us. Oh, hey, hey! Oh wait, does that mean whoever the, is it, Lance? I don't remember. Does that mean he has a Kingdra? Kingdra's a water type I used to use a lot. I, gen I I think Kingdra's really cool, although something I don't like is that, um, 
Not a lot of money. Okay, it was fine. Yeah, Cedra. So Cedra, I think Cedra has a really cool design, like how his scales like puff out and how it's all spiky. And while I do like the grace and poise of Kingdra, it always bothered me that it had like one tiny fin on his back, you know what I mean? And that's it. Kind of felt like they could should should have been bigger and then like have like three of them, so it's like one, two, three, you know. Why is it bubble? Why? Why? Yeah, why? Why are you using Bubble Beam? I don't get it. Okay, okay. Alright. Let's see. Oh. Let's see. Oh, Claire, that's right. Lan yeah, because Lance is a champion in Gen 1 or something like that. Yeah, Claire. Okay. You only have the one Seedra, so something's gonna be up. No? Yeah, whatever. But, um, what's the other thing? Seedra has a lot of, like, weird poison abilities for no reason. Which I think is really fun. But, um, Kingdra doesn't. It all just goes straight into Dragon. And as much as I get it, they want to make Kingdra a Dragon, I felt like it kind of took away some of the fun. Like, Seedra had, you know? Mm, bloop. And bye bye. Garanid is still the best Pokemon. His hands down. Bloop. Let's see. Uh, all right. Uh, let's just real quick. I don't feel like going through it all again. Uh, super potions. I don't actually have as many super potions as I thought I did. Nope, come on. Come on. Yeah, I don't have as many super potions as I thought I did. I'll have to make sure to stock up by the end of this. Let's see. Oh no. Oh, 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 no. Not even 1%, you say. Oh no. I'm saving my blizzards. I'm, I am 100% saving my blizzards because I have a theory. How am I faster than you? How? I'm only five levels ahead. I should not be faster than you. I don't get it. It's so weird. All right, uh. All right, countdown timer. All right. Why is it missing? Agility doesn't raise your evasion. Why? Why is Garanid all of a sudden, or why, yeah, why is Garanid all of a sudden just not able to hit? It's freaky, I don't like it. Alright. Yeah. Yeah, level 44. <laughs> like, that's odd. Uh, huh, huh. Yeah, my shortcomings is we all have the literal exact same, I'm not even joking, strategy. Of just becoming faster than you and then throwing as many Hujima Callets at you as I can. So, huh, 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 huh. Alright, uh, 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 uh
Okay, switch him around. See, okay, so I made I made it a rule in the beginning that um, Garnet is the mascot. So if Garnet dies, it's fine. I get to keep her. But um, that doesn't mean I want to throw her into death on purpose. You know what I mean? This is Claire. I am Claire. Thank you, Claire. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to just throw him into danger as fodder because it's like he's gonna die. Today. I don't care. Because blah, blah, blah. no, I still want to treat it like it's real. I don't think he died or she died from anything. So. It works out. But, uh, let's see. My allergies are kicking in a little bit, so that might be why I'm like... <sighs> Alright, I can hold my own against even the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? Wait, no, actually, I don't. No, 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 wait, wait, no, I, ch I, I changed my... I don't want to. I don't want to. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. I chose right. I chose so right. Oh, you fucked up. Oh, you fucked up. Oh. Oh no, I fucked up. Oh no. What is with you all in Dragon Rage? Done. Just d done. Done. Times four effective. I was gonna say, if you live, I'm gonna be very impressed. Alright, fuck you. Alright, Dragonair, okay. This is the gym leader, so we're pulling out big guns. We're we're pulling out big guns. We don't give a shit. Just light him up. None of that none of that business. Not just nope. Get rid of it. <sighs> yep, none of that business. Kingdra. Yeah, this is the guy that I use. But see, he's very elegant and I like how he looks. I just wish he had three, but they probably were like, oh, it looked too crowded or whatever. And here's the hard part with him that I really like. So he is a water type and a dragon type, which means the ice problem goes away and the lightning problem goes away. He covers for himself beautifully. And as a result, I'm going to discharge him. Oh shit. That's not good. This probably isn't gonna kill him in one shot. Yeah. Fuck. Uh, I'm pretty beefy. Okay. But, um, I think I can take one more hit. Now nah, we're switching out. We're switching out. 100% we're switching out. Yep, yep. Take our, take our money and go. Take our money and go. We did it. We're probably going to have to. Oh, really? Okay, so here's the deal I would blizzard it, but. I've already been smokescreen. What if we send a Wook to me, just punch the shit out of it? Probably could. Um, it's not a water type. We could send in Suda Snoot, but his main things are fire and grass, both of which are resisted. Uh, could send in Napora. Let's we'll send in Wookton. I got, I got a good feeling about Wookton. Hopefully, Dragonair doesn't start doing anything weird. Come on, Wookton, you're pretty. Yeah, you're pretty buff. All right. Yeah. Lock him up. Just nice, simple. Perfect. Oh, yeah, that's right. You have the shell bell. Yep. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Alright. I'm supposed to win. I already decided. I decided that I'm going to win. That means I'm the winner. Done. Beautiful. Get that little bit of regeneration in. Yeah. Whew, okay. There must be some mistake. What do you mean? Like, I didn't cheat. I won't concede. Go there. If you can prove that you lost your lazy ideal. Yeah, fuck you, lady! What? I won! I won, fairzy squaresy. Alright, uh. 
I I won fair. I won fair. I won fairsy squaresy. Thank you very much. Oh my goodness, Arnie, what do you want? Okay, look, I, I think this is a really cool system they put in, and I think it's, like, really fun, especially when you get to rematch against people. But, man, the incessant, the incessant calls that just don't matter. And you can and you can never remember if it's, like, yo, is this the one that is, um, who'd you call it? Is this the person that gives you free shit, or is, it, is this the person who wants to give you a rematch, or is this person that's just going to say nothing? It's like, oh, I never, never remember. I never remember. Mm. All right. Uh, there we go. All right. So, can't believe she's making us do this, but sh whatever, we'll do it. Watch me give it. Have I got anyone in Black Thorn yet? Well, I've already seen one of you before, so I don't, I don't freaking care. Ah, yeah, okay, bye. Alright, um. Alright, up. Uh, oop. Shit. Gotta write this down. Dragon's dead. Gotta write this down. Yeah, we haven't got anyone in Blackthorn yet. Although, I did write down that I can headbutt a tree until I can get a hair cross, but I'm not gonna worry too hard about that. Uh, yeah, Dragon's dead. Maybe we'll find someone cool. Hmm. I'm gonna have to fight a bunch more trainers, aren't I? Yep. Yep. How dare you enter uninvited? Wait, you don't know my life. Oh, I just realized. So my water bottle that I normally use for soda is in the dishwasher, so I stole my sister's coffee cup. It's gotta be on the left hand. Yeah, Blizzard will be fine. Oh, shit. Makes you feel very professional and patriotic because she got this from Williamsburg. No oh, sick. No oh, sick. All right. Uh... Wait, hold on. Oh my goodness, I knew it. <laughs> Max, you having fun tapping it? Yes. Yes, I am. As a matter of fact, I am having a good time just tapping the shit out of it. Oh no. Alright. I really like Lantern. Lantern's just super cute. Oh, wait, there's a whirlpool over there. Do I. Do I have the ancient whirlpool? If not, I'm gonna. I'm gonna throw it on Gyarados, because fuck that. Yeah, fuck giving up whirlpool to one of the Pokemon I give a shit about. Here we go. Oh wait, hold on, I just realized. Isn't Sudi Snoot the other one that's in front? It's probably fine if they're you Yeah, see, they're just fucking Why who gives a shit? I can't use discharge because then I'll hit Sudi Snoot, but that's fine. Yeah, it's gonna hit everyone. Okay, well if I use surf, it's gonna hit everyone. If I use signal beam, it'll hit one of them. And then I'll use strength on the other. Bitch! See, see, uh, oh, perfect! Yeah. Just grab it, just like whip it against the wall. Yeah, this may not be super effective. It may not be stab, but single beam is a pretty good. Oh, oh, oh! Not bad strategy. All right, cool. Uh, single beam. Me. Strength you. This slayer. There you go. 
Nej. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. Ouchies, meanie. <laughs> like. Children. Yeah. Not as good as it is in Final Fantasy Seven, but I'll take it. It's great. Alright, let's go, buddy. If I can knew it. I'm so smart. Let's see. What are you doing here exactly? <laughs> like you shouldn't be in here. Fucking fight me. Fuck you gonna do about Oh. Ow. That's what you're gonna do about it. Oh. Bitch. Yeah. But no, I think I think Lantern is just a solid Pokemon, like. Sure I could look at it and be like, oh, it's more on the tanky side and not on the like speed side or whatever, but just solid stats, solid moveset. It's really good. <laughs> if I I was thinking about doing the water team and it was gonna be Yeah, if I have the Quagsire Quagsire for the ground aspect, lantern for the Lightning aspect, um, tentacle for the poison aspect. I would have shelter for the ice, or um, polyworld for the fighting. But since I don't have stones for either of them, then I'd have Garnet for the psychic, and that way it's like we're all water type, but also we all have different whatevers. Oh, that's great. Okay, just so you know, your master is a little bit of a crybaby when she loses. <laughs> Just straight up, it's like, yeah, sorry. <laughs> ah. Which is weird that she's a little bit of a crybaby when she loses, because isn't it her job to, like, not necessarily to be unbeatable, but to be, like, a test of our current strength? So she's probably, like, way stronger. Uh. Ow. Don't tell me. Hey, <sighs> some bitch. All right. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We got it. We gotta get someone with whirlpool. I think. I'm so glad. In future games, although I haven't played Sword and Shield yet, but like. Oh. In general, I am so glad that they got rid of this as a concept of like having to have HMs on Pokemon. Like, I get it, but also it's just, it's dumb. It'd be better if they had a way for it to be like. Well, no, even then, because it's like if it didn't take up a move slot, but you had to have certain Pokemon in your party. It, I think it would be better, but it would still be kind of frustrating, you know? Uh, this. Mm. Get rid of that. Bye. Right. Okay, I just gotta go heal everyone. Please be able to learn this. Please, please. Thank you, God. Oh my gosh, Wookton can learn it. I always forget about that. Wait, hold on. Ah, uh, 
Uh, I was gonna say, like, if Wookton could learn a waterfall, that would be honestly really cool. <laughs> Let's give her a splash. Because, yeah, just to have, like, since he's all physical and speed, right? So just to be able to, like, whip out a waterfall out of nowhere could... It would protect him against, like, the ground or rock types that would, like, try to mess with him. You know what I mean? All right, anyway. You stay open though, latch. All right. All right, let's go fuck up. Let's go fuck up the dragon den, cause how much you want back? Claire's gonna be like rematch, bitch. Yeah, you're so freaking cute. And Chin Chow is an adorable Pokemon, too. We're gonna have to dodge around an endless barrage of Magikarps, so mentally brace yourself for that nonsense. Shiny red hair does. Like, oh! oh shit! Hey, that reminds me. That was gonna be a cycle. Um, you know the wandering legendaries? I wanna kill them. I don't remember if we've already um I don't remember if we've already found and beaten uh Hujima call it. Uh, Suicune. But yeah, I want to hunt down the legendaries and kill them. Max, you're supposed to catch them. You're right. That's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. We don't do that shit here. We kill, <laughs> we kill legendaries. There is no god but me. <laughs> That's not true. I... Okay, there's always there's always a part of me that loves this this is kind of a sick admission. So I am a Christian. Um I yeah, you know, however you want to say, like professing or whatever Christian, right? I am I am a Christian, you know, professing, you know. I'm always bad at it, but like, you know, because I've confessed my sins for Jesus, that I'm going to heaven because he is the way, the truth, and life, the one way to heaven, you know, all that good stuff. But, um, I, there's always a part of me that giggles about jokes of like, your God is dead. <laughs> like, I don't see go any God up here but me. Especially when it's like, completely nonsensical. Dope. Uh, is it Dragon Fang? Is the dragon thing just for dragon type moves, or is that an item that I can use to evolve Kingdra? Or to, to Kingdra? Because that'd be dope. The powers of the. Ah, cool! I don't have any dragons! Don't even know if I really plan on it! What are the dragons in Gen 2? Uh. I mean, there's Dragonite, obviously. And, oh, there's Dragonite and Kingdra, but. Salamence was... No, wait, okay, hold on, hold on. Who are the pseudo-legendaries? There's Dragonite, and then... No, wait, hang on. No, I'm Googling this. No, hang on. Okay, Bulbapedia. Let's just go Dragon. Uh, uh Yeah, let's go Types. Yeah, Dratini. Really? Bagon? But Bagon's gen... Yeah, introduced in gen 3. So, there's Dragonite. Is it Altaria? No, Altaria was also introduced in gen 3. What the fuck? Kingdra is introduced in gen... 
four? Wait, seriously? Salamence is Gen three. Okay, who's the who's the other who's the pseudo legendary then? If it's not if it's not, if it's not you guys, because if I go down this list of Gen one, okay, sorry, I should probably switch. Down this list of Gen one, you got you know original. We're talking OG dragons, Jatini and Dragonite, and then. I asked her, of course, so I was gonna say, what the fuck? Kingdra? Huh. Really, then? Really, Tyranitar? I haven't seen a single fucking Larvitar. I'd love to. I, I probably have. Yeah, it's Final Four Horsey. Yeah, see, like that, and then you go to Seedra, and Seedra has, like, Poison Point. And the spikes, I think that's really cool, and it just doesn't quite have that, but... So fat. But... Well-rounded as fuck. Like, honestly, really high stats, it's just, they're well-rounded. But anyway, uh... Boop. So that's why I was sitting thinking, like, yo, who else are we gonna fight, face off against? It's like, well... Oh no. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, uh... But I must test you. That's where you're to answer only a few questions. Fuck. Here we go. What are Pokemon to you? Ally, junior, friend. Junior? Junior. They're, they're, my, they're my friends. What helps you win battles? Strategy, training, cheating. Hmm. My strategy. Do you wish to battle? The wong. Uh, love violence, violence. <laughs> uh, for raising Pokemon, I mean love. Yeah, you want to be knowledgeable about them, but you want them to care. You want to care about them. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon, which is more important? Both. Yeah, it's not about winning with whoever's the best. It's about winning with your favorites. You know, like. As much as I love Porygon Z, I recognize he's not perfect Pokemon, but he is my favorite Pokemon. Um, yeah. Oh, what? You'll see you throughout the Pokemon League. Claire, bitch, wanna go? Where's my knife? Where, where's where's my knives? Oops, I just messed with this. Hang on. No, hang on. I need this for the bit. Claire! Claire, get back in! <laughs> you did fail. Yeah, suck it. <gasps> that can't be! Even I've been improved. What? Claire, it was so easy. I am impeccable. Let's see. Best dragon trainer in the world to even rival the Elite Four, and you're you're being like, oh god, Lance! Fantastic. You lacking this child has. <laughs> Is that fucking kid? Uh, our Olivine Sea one of our islands called Whirl Islands. There's a huge waterfall deep in the cave there. It said Lukia rests in the deep end of the waterfall basin. You need a silver ring to reach the waterfall. I've heard. <sighs> think. I think we all know what, what needs to happen. I think I think we all know. I think we all know what has to happen next. Lugia's gonna die. We are going to kill Lugia. Well, actually, okay. So next up is going to the Elite Four, but I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna kill Lugia. Hundred percent. This is the way. We're gonna go kill Lugia. My papa repel just for sake of like getting down there in expedient fashion, but we're gonna kill Lugia. <laughs> it's gonna be dope. <laughs> gonna bring it in. I mean, what Lugia is Lugia water psychic? Either water. I want to say water psychic. Yeah, because this is back in the day where psychic was basically like all legendaries. I need to pull it We're all legendaries or psychic types, so it makes sense for him to be that. 
Alright, uh, excuse me. Yeah, so we can we can probably pop down to those caves, down Lugia quick, and well no, we gotta kill the other legendaries first, which is Entei and Have I caught Suicune? Did I cut Suicune or did I beat the shit out of him? I beat the As my pop Wait, hold on, hold on. Claire, that's great. Hang on. Hang on, Bulbapedia. Sweet Suicune. Okay, along with it is one that is the brain of the best as so you can said to represent the brains that crunch the flames is a gay mascot. Okay, but hang on, how do you how do you get him in in Soul Silver? Route 25 Burn Tower. Rematch is so you can faint so the player runs away. We're gonna go to the burn tower too. Wait, hold on shit, where's the burn tower? Where's the burn tower? Yeah, where's the where's the where's the burn tower? Where's where's the burn tower? Uh, E-Critique. E-Critique, fantastic. Let's see, drag. Oh! If you don't want it, you don't have to take it. Uh, go back to New Bark Town and surf along Route 27. No. Thanks, Claire. Appreciate it. Sorry that I made you look bad in front of your your grand gruncle. Ah shit. Professor Elm, I need to kill four legendaries. Sure. Sure, I'll swing by your lab and pick it up after we fucking kill some people. <laughs> oh god. Alright, okay, let's play let's play smart. Alright, so we're going up against um we're gonna be going up against a massive fire powerhouse and a massive lightning powerhouse and a massive water powerhouse. Which, oddly enough, me thinking about it out loud, I think Lantern is the answer for all three. Every time I hear that sound, it freaks me out a little bit more. Yeah, I think, I genuinely think Lantern is gonna be our best bet because hear me out, right? Hear me out. Let's see. Yeah, you know, downing the fire type, Real dang straightforward. Raikou uses electricity. I have Volt Absorb. So you cannot hurt me with electricity. So that's Raikou down. Then we could just use Signal Beam or Surf. Or I don't think Lightning actually resists water. So we could just use Surf. And then Suicune, we have Discharge. So let's, 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 uh, you know, let's kill some gods, shall we? Let's just real quick. No. Let's kill some gods. Starting with the one that doesn't run. That sounds really fucking twisted when I say it that way. Uh, how hurt is our boy? Oh, perfect! Yeah, we're all... We're all full health and wonderful and I can't see... Yeah, if I, if I go to the Poke Gear, I can see what routes the... The legendary doggos are at, but for now I can't. For now I can't, so let's just, just excuse me, excuse me, thank you, excuse me, excuse me, pardon, pardon me, pardon me, thank you, thank you, thank you. Did you see anything? Yeah, it was a trainer back then. Now oh, that's Nito Bugito, isn't it? There's a lot of hours on this game because I think it, I just left it open a lot while I was doing other stuff. And also grinding. Just a lot of grinding. Alright, just say, uh, excuse me. Thank you. Oh, uh, yeah, there's coffins in here, maybe. Did, did I get anything in the burn tower? I want to say I did. Didn't I? Uh, burn tower. Oh, this is where I got Houston. And then Houston fucking died. God damn it. Damn it, there's no I don't there's no Suicune here. Why is there why is there no Suicune? What, what? Need no coughing. Okay. <laughs> it was just the coffee again has like coffee and listen. You're probably the little brother of Houston, who died tragically, and who I mourn. 
Actually, no, yeah, I can't. Oh, okay. I was just thinking, like, wait, hold on. I can't. Yo, know, it's probably not here because Suicune's not at the center. It's like, well, there's no walkway down to the center. So, therefore, how could Suicune be there? Yeah. Must be this. I, I just. I just. I, I, no, no. No, I don't care if he was your second cousin. No, bug, bug, bugger off. Coughing, please just, just bug. Just go, just go, just go away, just go away. What? Oh! That, that just, I, yeah. That's right, uh, our boy, our boy Suda Snoot has strength. Just dumb, just dumb, dumb mechanic. It's so stupid. And I get it. I get why it exists. I think it's interesting as a concept and it's fun. But I just, I, I, I don't. I, I, I just fucking. I just, I just, I just go bite. Okay. We're just looping through to make sure that was the only way down. We're just looping through to make sure, you know, it's the only way down. You know. you just, there, 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 there you go. Just gonna, just gonna, you know. I have to, I have to loop all the way back. You know. This is why shit was driving me nuts with Pokemon. Just in general, this is why shit was driving me nuts with Pokemon right here. This bitch. <laughs> uh, there you go. All right. Oh, wait, no, 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 Thank you. Could I give strength to uh, Wukdin? Yes, I could. But I want him to have a headbutt for the flinching. That's my logic. Just gotta, just gotta, just gotta go, just gotta go in here. Excuse me, excuse me, thank you. Move Pokemon. All right, who is next to be most useless against everything? <gasps> yeah, probably. Yeah, 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 probably. Because Typhlosion, he has, he has, yes, he has to take a turn to set up Sunny Day, but he can Solar Beam. Which is fucking awesome and hilarious. Okay, now I just now I just got to, excuse, excuse, excuse me, sir, excuse me, excuse me. Just, 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 pardon, pardon me. You really should repair this place. It, you know, it's a place of legend and honor. Excuse me. Thank you. Excuse me. I just got. I I just, I I'm just trying. I'm just trying to get my fish to, to just excuse me. <laughs> it's like, uh, what are you doing with that lightning fish? I don't know what you're talking about. Y you have a lightning fish with you. What what do you what do you plan on doing with your lightning fish? Oh, uh, not nothing, nothing. Don't worry about it. Yeah, don't 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 worry about it. I'm I'm not gonna do anything with the lightning fish. I just wanna, I just wanna talk to your god. That's all. I just wanna. Well, apparently I've never been down here before, so that's interesting. Nope. Ooh. Huh. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry if you could if you just, just excuse me. You know, just I can't get through that. I'm sorry if you could just excuse, excuse me. I may have already killed it though. Which, if I did, I'm totally okay with. Like, conceptually, I have no emotional. I'm having some emotional qualms with this shit. I'm, I'm having some emotional qualms with this shit right now. Okay, hold on. I think this is for a quick way back. Yeah, I can't wait. I'm halfway tempted to get a re to turn on a repel. 
you know, I, I, I don't like... There's a lot of reasons I don't like Let's Go Eevee. I get it. It's supposed to be, like, baby's first Pokemon. But, man, the ability just to be, like... The, you know, going like, oh, there's the Pokemon that want to hurt me, and then just, like, walking around them. Just being like, nah, I don't want to fight. And I don't have to, you know, resort to an item or anything. I can just choose. <laughs> okay, hold on. Yeah, straight up when I when I go for the other ones, we're gonna just pop we're gonna pop revives and stuff. Alright, uh Poke Gear Map. What a coinky dang! Actually, wait, hold on, where are you? You're specifically on Route 36, okay, and you're on Route 39. Okay. I forget how often it changes, but but now we have a target. Trying to go around the Pokemon. They're like, no, Max, play the damn game. I'm like, no, I don't want to. You're all under level, okay? If you're all of comparable level, it would be one thing, but you are not. I am not even joking. Triple your level. Actually, hold on. Let me show you real quick. Poke here. No, he's still there. He's still there. Okay. I am triple your damn level. I I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to deal with you. I I just I don't. I don't. I don't. I'm so. Uh, there's a lot of grind. So, um, so last week I was gone because I was, I was taking a trip with my family to the Black Hills. We saw Mount Rushmore, we climbed Harney Peak, we, uh, went on, like, we went to Bear Country and saw a whole bunch of, like, a you know, animals. It was, it was all really good and fun and great. I hiking and I love hiking. In the car ride, all I did was grind. For Pokemon. On the way there. It left. Let's do a theory. Let's, let's try. Let's try a theory real quick. Let's try just a theory really quick. Every, so every time I change location, it changes location. Now, does that include... It does. Son of a bitch. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, it, wait, it. Wait, it. It's not. It's on. It's on the map. It's not. I, this just got notably more frustrating. Yeah, this just got notably more frustrating. Okay, so it's not on the map. So does that mean it's in the same place I'm in? Does 
Is that does that mean it's in the same place that I'm in? Or can they just decide to be gone? And then also does a wild battle also no? He's still there. He's still there. Okay. Rat Tata, please leave. We're, we are trying to find and kill God. I'm not even joking. That is that is what our intentions are. Our intentions are to find and kill God. You're pretty cute. I really like your design, but no, I'm the one that's gonna run. We will find and we will kill God. That is our that is our life. That is our life mission. We're gonna, we are going. Okay, I'm getting the impression it's not here. I'm getting somewhat of an impression that it's not here. Okay, so city limits, come back. I think like I think I can it sense they sense my intention. Yeah, they sense my intention. They're like, we fucking know what you're gonna do. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna fly to Equitique. This feels like Undertale, where when you do the genocide run, and like people eventually stop trying to, like they just straight up run away from you. That's what this feels like. Oh my goodness. You, oh. Nope. Look, here's the deal. Here's the deal. Here's the deal. I'm gonna kill you. And then I'm going to kill... I think that means Raikou's in the same area that I'm in. I forgot it paralyzed him! Hey, buddy. Exert- Oh, exert your pressure, bitch. There you go. We're here to kill you. It's like, ah, yes, you're here to catch the mythical and legendary- Nope! We're here to kill you. Now, here's a question. Okay, so it did fully leave. Alright, so this is a valid strat- No? We'll give it three. Yeah, we'll give it three, and then we'll- And then we'll, um, we'll call it. Because, you know, maybe it's a- Maybe it's like a percentile, you know? Maybe like the first is 100% and the others are like, you know, 20 or whatever. Say nope. It is not the special theme song, so nope, don't care. Even if it was a shiny, I, I don't, I'm not, I'm not going to use whatever the Pokemon is, so fuck it. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. That Raikou is like, holy shit, this kid just like... You know, I appeared before this kid and I, ex I expected... Damn. You know, I, I, I appear before this kid and normally whenever I appear, they're like, Oh, hell, blah, 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 spirit of the fire and the lightning. And it's like, oh shit, yeah, I am pretty cool to be worshipped. But no, this kid, he just pulled out a Glock. I really would love to know. Okay, wait, hold on. I think I think I know the way we can test this. Hang on. You fucking kidding me? Like, okay, is is Entei not here? Is it? I I just I I just I just I just I just want to get shut the. Shut the 
Frack, I'm standing there. I want to kill gods. Yeah, congratulations. You discover I've never melt ice. It's not going to do you any good. Bye. I just, I, I just, I just, I just, I just want to, I just want to kill. I just want to kill God. It turns out the more damaged Raikou is, the less likely it'll want to stick around. It's like, really? Bulbapedia. Right. Uh, I spelled right too wrong. I know how to spell Ente. Alright. The, the, the flame that burns. Okay, I'm getting the impression he's not here. Alright, uh, Roaming Johto. Fantastic. What? How do roaming mechanics work? Starting Platinum, if the player defeats a roaming Pokemon, it'll appear when the player next enters the Hall of Fame, but the player must retrigger its roaming. For example, the player defeats Mesprit and then enters the... What? Uh, but what do you mean, Mesprit? Like, uh, uh. yeah, fucking. Actually, hold on. Take careful note of the shapes. So, if it appears over me, I should see Raikou's fangs. And notice that I don't have white around me. That I feel like is an important detail. Alright, when a counter report with their HP and DBs are initialized, those stats bring straight once generated. This so this means that shiny Pokemon will remain shiny and damage to inflict will remain across have their power point stats boost to reset each time they flee. That's jokes on you. That one is still paralyzed, bitch. Alright. And just move around each time the player changes map, all currently roaming Pokemon will also move out to each battle. The one sixteenth chance always the player just counter Pokemon, not merely one they just encountered. Okay, just gotta. See, there's little bits of white around me, so that's why I'm like, oh, that must mean. That must mean he's here, right? Uh, there's a one in chance that a Rowan Pokemon will move to a completely random map other than the one the player is on, where N is the amount of possible connections to where the Rowan Pokemon is at the moment. Otherwise, the Rowan Pokemon will move to an adjacent route. A Rowan Pokemon will never move past Olivine, meaning that if it's currently Route 39, it will always move to Route 38. Wait, what? Wait, really? Wait, hold on. Really? Wait, oops. Uh, there's a 1 in 8 N chance that a Rome Pokemon moved to a completely random map other than the one the player's on, where N is the amount of possible connections to where the Rome Pokemon is at the moment. So if there's multiple connections, it becomes less likely. Otherwise, one will move to an adjacent route. So I moved here. So theoretically, hold on. I moved to there. So doesn't that mean... If I then move to here? Okay. Uh... Let's see. Uh... Also from playing. If we got any turn, let's see... It's a use of your once this Rome Pokemon Gen 2 also know the no moves to different priorities behind the move they appear to use the player's place to happen for a fleece. Wait, hold on. okay, so I move I move to here. <gasps> he's right there, 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 he's right there. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Really hope this doesn't count. If it does, I'm gonna be miffed. That looks like he's on the same route. Hold on. Enhance. <gasps> He's on the same route as me. This motherfucker's about to get it. There's no grass. This motherfucker's about to get it. Son of a bitch. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? Fucking. Hang on. No, 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 no,
Yes. Yeah, sure. Just have it. Yeah, fine. Just replace the headbutt. There you go. Son of a bitch. There you go, Lupton. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff, Lupton. Okay, yeah, it's good stuff. Good stuff. Okay. Yes. And then when and then when we're and then when we're done, we'll we'll go to Mahogany Town. Go to the move. Food. Fight me, bitch! Don't fight me. Uh, as I need to find a patch of grass. That is incredibly important. I need to find. I, we're doing this, damn it. We are killing. We are killing all three of them, and then we're killing Lu Lugia. And then we're killing Lugia. And just. Okay, good. Okay, okay. I'm dropping your ass. Hi, a Raiko. Raik Raiku. Right. Hi. Hi. I'm sure you remember me. Hi. There is no god but me. Oh no. Oh no. I killed a god. One down. One down. Three to go. Max, this is incredibly foolish. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. Let me just fly down there. I'll move. Well, okay, so it's supposed to move. Oops. It's supposed to move adjacently. Yeah, so hopefully. What if Suicune now shows up? That'd be amazing. If Suicune's now at the burn tower. Doesn't that path have a lot of shit? It does. Fuck. Alright, um. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay. Um, take me there. We'll check in the basement. If not, I'm gonna Google the Suicune location so we can, like, hunt him down kind of a thing. You know, Suicune has the ability to just sense intentions. Especially the kind that have to do with bloodlust and murder. I'm like, oh, really? That, that's an odd coincidence. He's like, yeah, it is. Maybe you shouldn't have that. We just got over how you're, like, pure-hearted and shit. Hmm. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not seeing... I'm not, I'm not seeing a... Oh, sick. Do some Magmar. Dope. I don't know. I don't like Magmar in terms of design. Well, okay, I like him in general, but there's like a few, there's a few design irks I have with him. But like, as in terms of mechanics, Magmars are dope. So we're now gonna have to Google. Gonna have to go Pokemon Suicune location Soul Silver, because we're doing this. Damn it. Okay, there. Okay, so. Okay. Suicune is also is released into Johto when you access the base of the Burnt Tower. Suicune is seen the following places you must follow it. If you wish to capture it, it will be first found in the north of Seawood City. After you encounter there, you will find it outside the entrance of Mount Mortar, which I think we were just at. Uh, once you will head to Kanto. Once you find it here, it will leave Johto and head to Kanto, where you'll see it in Vermilion City soon after you arrive. Next, you will see it in Route 14, where it will escape from the found time to be found outside Bill's house. Route 25 with their master's turn to a gym. This is where you battle Suicune. Alright, Suicune, I guess you get to live. You bastard. <laughs> I guess you get to escape my wrath because I'm too lazy. I'm just, I'm just too, I'm, I just cannot be bothered. Like, he, he did the right thing. He just skipped country. He's like, fuck, uh, yo. What's, what's the one thing they always say? Like, in, um, one Batman movie. We're like, I'm just gonna leave America's jurisdiction. 
<sighs> yeah, I'm just gonna leave America's jurisdiction. And then fuck are they gonna do about it? <laughs> and then I go, the Batman has no jurisdiction. <sighs> oh, I'm gonna clean the fucking floor with you. Hey, hold on, I see not here. It's supposed to be the first one. What the? It's supposed to be the first one. There we go. Batman has no jurisdiction. Oh, Dente, every time it roars, a volcano goes off. Oh, hoobity dee, surf, bitch. There's no god but me. All right. Congrat congratulations, Licky Lick's new name is now God Slayer. I can I can just feel people screaming at me. I can feel it and I love it. Being like, oh my goodness. Yep, we're Lions. Oh my goodness, you're not supposed to kill them. What is wrong with you? I'm serious, like I don't care. I don't care. And now we're gonna kill Lugia. Which oh my goodness, I just realized. I just realized something. Hold on. Lugia, if we, if since I can't remember exactly, if Lugia is part psychic, I have signal beam. If Lugia is part air, I have discharge. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be selfish, okay? Uh, These aren't repels. Uh, yep. Need to keep all you weak ass Pokemon away from me. Yep. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Blah 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 blah. I just cannot be bothered with all you weak ass Pokemon. I just can't. Have I been to the World Islands yet? Because World Islands is where I, I caught, um. Wait a second, have I not been to the World Islands? World. I've not been to the World Islands. I must have just went around it because we didn't have Whirlpool. Because we didn't have Whirlpool, I never went back. Alright, cool. World Islands. Hey, maybe we'll find something cool. Oops. Except I just realized I have an extra repel active, so it's fine. I have a max repel active, and I cannot see shit. At max, you could get a Pokemon that has Flash. You're right. I might need a Pokemon that has Flash. Aren't I? And now's the part of the adventure where I'm gonna hate. Hey! I really should just. Oh my! Oh my goodness! Can you imagine being in the middle of a dark ass cave, and then all of a sudden your phone just goes off, and like all the creatures of the night. I've uh, uh I haven't caught a seal yet, but you're also level. You're Gen 1, so I don't care. Although you will add nicely to my water team. I will say that. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is such a bad decision. Um... Heck. I have Pokemon with... 
could I um Let's wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Flash. Who can learn flash? Yes. Uh, fuck, okay, so I could replace Surf, but that would kinda kill the point. I can't do I can't replace Surf remotely, so. So there goes that idea. But Hey you you cutie you just you cutie look at you you just so cute there you go just there you go bugger off Alright um I think I need to go Yeah go one up <laughs> I was like you just go one over so I can go south <gasps> Oh my god it's Horsey Horsey Okay so once again this is a gen one Pokemon so you know we have bias against Gen 1 Pokemons, but if, if I don't get anything else, I might I might take that horsey up on its offer, you know? I might I might I might grab a horsey. Well you know I've never seen one of these before, so that's good. That's good. That's good. Just get just get rid of that thing. Keep thank you. Yeah, there you go. Alright, okay. This is this is the power of my own stubbornness at play. There's probably like a shit ton of good, like, D, uh, not DM. <laughs> There's a shit, cut of, shit ton of good DMs here. There's probably like, you know, or TMs, you know, There's probably all sorts of good stuff. And I'm being an ignorant asshole that's being stubborn because I don't like the HM mechanic, even though I love Pokemon. I'm literally just, can you imagine like someone else with like night vision goggles or whatever, seeing this kid and this giant lightning fish just ram his head into every wall and then keep moving determinately. It's like, ooh, I don't think I want to mess with this kid. He's, he's clearly built to some stern stuff if he's able just to beat his head against every wall. <laughs> and he's just going strong as a result, like, holy shit. <gasps> Got an Ultra Ball. That'll be great when I decide to catch Lugia. Wink. That'll become completely necessary. The fact. Okay, we're gonna have to get some of Flash. Which I uh, I think I, I think I know where to go. I, I, I think I know the Pokemon has Flash. The Pokemon doesn't know Flash, it'll be real easy to make it learn Flash. Can't believe I have to fucking. Can't believe I have to fucking do this. Itch my nose, because it itches. Alright. Yeah, I can't believe I have to fuck. What was the point of that? Alright. Yeah, fucking. Yeah, here we go, piece of shit. I just want to, I just want to, I just want to kill God. What are you going to do when you win the lottery? I'm going to go to Disney World. Nah, I just can't. I'm going to kill God. Okay, okay. It's just going to go out here. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, just, thank you. I'm just going to take this. I'm going to Pokemon. Gonna go to party Pokemon and just do this, and then I'm gonna grab this, and then I'm gonna go here, and then I'm gonna. Do you, do you not? Can you can you learn Flash? Can you? Sure, I'll bring the omelet. And then um. Can you just bring it? Just bring it. Um, can't believe the team is composed of three slaves at this point. Yep. Okay, I'm just gonna, just gonna just go over here. Just gonna bag. Just gonna go to Flash. Which one of you motherfuckers can learn Flash? I knew it. Let's see. Yes. 
Yes, so we'll get rid of Growl. But he knows extra sensory, it's special! Eh, fucking laugh. He's a dick laugh, he's a piece of shit. Yeah, just, uh, who here can learn cut? It's just, uh, okay, fine, we'll get to ask to hold on to it. That's okay, it's fine. How about strength? Strong. How about big strong? Okay, who here can learn strength? Okay. Yes, as we should be replaced with strength. I'm gonna replace attack with it. Well, you're a uh, you're a uh, tribute. You're uh, honor to us all. You have brought you have brought honor to this family. Thank you. Like, will I be able to go out and fight in battle? And eh, maybe someday. Maybe someday. Is it gonna be today? Nope. Didn't you say today was gonna be the last episode of this series? Yep. You're just gonna just go over here, just gonna say, yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. It's my nose, blah, 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 blah. All right, perfect. Okay, hang on, excuse me, excuse me, thank you, thank you. All right, now allow me just to, let me just, uh. Sorry, I was looking at, I was looking for the, um, there's always a Pokemon, each one of those pictures. I think even with the one that I have down here, I think it's a Paris. All right, so that's step one. Step two. Eh, 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 eh. Yeah. Just put some Axe Body Spray on him. I'm good to go. All right. Fantastic, I was just thinking about that. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. Okay. Clearly this place is an ingenious maze. Yeah. I was kind of hoping it would just be like... You go down one hallway, and there's the waterfall, and that's, like, literally the end of it, and you're just like, all right. Okay, so that's the way back. I probably should have this on. Oh, shit. Um, uh, we're going to try to ride this for a little bit longer. Because all the Pokemon here are low level. It's in those rocks over there. Damn it. Right. Yep, it is. Alright, fine. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay. What the heck? Alright, cool. I only just wasted most of my repel to do that. Well, that's fine. Uh, da, da, da. Ah, no. Fired. Wait, oops, cancel. Super repel. 200 steps, let's go. Alright. Yeah, okay, go, go, go. Okay. Alright, so there's nothing over there. Hold on. Of course. This is not bad, it's not bad, right? Rare candy, all right, um. What the fuck? What? But, oh wait, maybe it, maybe it connects to the other island. Maybe, yeah, that could be it. Maybe I gotta. 
I gotta do this. I... Um... This is a day, a day of googly max, isn't it? It is! Okay, okay. So first off, it's not a water type whatsoever. It is a psychic flying eye. That complicates things a little bit, but it should be fine. Uh, this is uh, Soul Silver. Title belt? The fuck is a title? What? Uh, do I, do I have a do I have a title belt? I, I don't have a title belt. What? Gee, title title belt. Uh, wait, hold on, what? Wait, hold on. Uh, main appearance of the remakes. Hard gold instead of being restricted to their dance scene in New York City, however, they'll appear elsewhere, such as the Violet Silly, Elix Forest, Ice Path, and a Team Rock Grand appearance in the theater in New York City. Now, Jira has Miki. Miki's briefly met during the radio tyrants in the Golden Tunnel in order to encounter Ho and Lugia, which is required before. Uh, wait, okay, okay. Uh, players must earn all eight badges and after receiving the Master Ball from Professor Elm, battle all five Kona girls consecutively in the dance theater to obtain the clear bell or title bell. Uh, the girls' respective evolutions were swapped. I can't believe I fucking have to... And honestly, this is completely reasonable. I'm just butthurt. That's all. Okay, so... Where is... In the dance theater. Okay, where is the dance? Where is the dance theater? Oh, any critique. Perfect. Aw, uh, yeah. Aw, uh, yeah. I'm gonna fuck, I'm gonna fuck up. Oh, no. <laughs> He's like, oh, wait. Um, don't, don't, uh, don't, 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 don't try to fight me. Please don't. Uh, thanks to your researchers to take this token of my appreciation. Deals in Pokemon, I'll catch any Pokemon. You know, you know, Pokemon. I think you can make the trade. You said I can, by the way. We just had a group of beautiful Pokemon girls looking for you. <sighs> yes. Yes. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
Oh, what? Schlapper! How? How is this possible? How can I lose to mere Oh, I'm sorry, you bitch! Oh, you were watching me. Oh, uh, yeah. You must have come here for the same reason. Don't get cocky just because you defeated an entire criminal organization. Bitch. Yeah, you run, bitch. Hi! Here we go! How's it going? We need someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked this Pokemon to give this mystery to whoever showed true potential. Oh, you mean the one that I used as flashlight? Uh. Are you ready? Yeah! Alright. That's really cool. I like that. Alright. Here we go. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Guess I'm just like looks back like, oh no! Guess I'm just look back to me like, bitch, you know what's gonna happen. <laughs> like, you know, you know the magnitude of which this Pokemon here fucked up. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I'm suddenly genuinely concerned. Bitch. Flange. Oh, wow. Please don't have pursuit. 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 Please don't. Okay, good. Okay, good. Ooh. Okay, I forgot how tanky Umbreon was. God, that's right. He is the tanky one. Bitch. There you go. Alright, wait. I have strength instead of headbutt, so it's not like I have a bad move. I'm just... Ooh. So that's your strat. Oh, no. Alright, here we go. Damn it. Eh. It's a countdown timer if I ever saw one. That's taking a risk. Alright, um. Literally anyone can do it. No, what worries me is that we're gonna start the next fight. Yeah, we're gonna start the next fight. And they're gonna be like, come on, it's consecutive, let's go. So, I'm gonna have to... Yeah, I'm gonna have to, um... Throw someone forward, and then heal everyone, and then get him back in the game. That's gonna be tricky. Okay, how about you... Right? You're gonna throw me right into the next one? Yep. I'm the one that's not so good at directions. Why is way to see you defeat when Kurt was in trouble? Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. This is bad because... Gisop's hurt. Espeon, Psychic. Alright. <laughs> Bitch, you know I'm about to run. Alright, um... Liddy Lakes will do perfect. Liddy Lakes will do just fine. Yep. Swift. Uh, uh, Alright. Uh, signal beam, bitch. I'm tanky. Bitch! Now the math doesn't quite work out right. You're gonna get in there. Oh, God. Okay, and then we're going to be dealing with the fire, lightning, and uh, water. Nope, that ain't going to work on me. That is not going to work on me. Jeez. Alright, uh, just surf. Oh, you're fast. You're freaking fast. There you go. Just done. Oh. 
All right, this is a little scarier than I thought it was gonna be. Okay. Hmm. I'm here to whoop your ass next. It's like, oh god. Although I'm actually, it's an issue you know the most speaks least. I'm Miki the Kono girl. Let me challenge you in your Pokemon. Oh, oh. See, the problem here is that because I'm in the front with a Pokemon that's really hurt, I can't really, like, I'm always going to take at least one hit. That's the problem here. I'm always going to take one hit. Garnet. Get Garnet in. Get Garnet in. All right, there you go. That's fine. Surf. Okay, there you go. Boom. See, you, the flaring, if I remember correctly, is like pure physical, which in like Gen 1 and 2, until they introduced the concept of like special versus um, special versus physical kind of thing, Flareon really suffered because Flareon was ground based. But the but with the split, they got some fire based, like, I think, I think it's called Fire Charge, because Wild Charge is the electric one. I forget. Let's see, I'm the one who states, skates in sandals. I was listening to Dragon 7, you passed the test the other. Let me to challenge in your Pokemon. Five Dragonites. <laughs> Just like, oh, fuck! Oh, god! Oh, god, five Dragonites! Okay, Jolteon. I know exactly what to do with you. I know exactly what to do with you. Get Lee licked in. Because if you don't use an electric type move, I will be very confused. Yep. Thank you. Love you. Appreciate it. Oh shit. So that's what that's how you're gonna play. I will right, we'll try to evade the entire ocean. There you go. I say might not be enough for one hit, but yep. Yep. Eh. Yep. In Jolteon's defense, I have put him in a really weird situation where it's like, I'm all about electricity. And it's like, here's someone that's immune to electricity and heals from it. Well, shit, now I can't attack your electricity. It's like, yep. So I guess the AI solution was to um, double team and then maybe start quick attacking. I don't know. Oh, there's one more. Fuck. I'm Kooning it. I looked at you. wonder when you throw a Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio. You must show your strength to me now. Let me to challenge you to your Pokemon. Okay, so Vaporeon, right? I would send in Tangrowth, but I will bet just about anything that you have Aurora Beam. Let's take that bet. There you go. Okay, Nipora. <laughs> that was so gross sounding like <laughs> Okay, I'm pretty dang beefy. So how about a mega drain for your troubles? This will probably kill you in one shot. It didn't kill you in one shot. I'm gonna leave. Bye. B bye bye. Oh god, that's fine. Lady Lux can take a hit like this, no problem. Yep. Uh, uh, fine. Yep. That that was a critical hit. Too fantastic. Discharge your ass. Oh. 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 Yeah, that's right. Vaporeon has like a, just a crazy amount of hit points. Whew. Oh, all right. Oh dear. Let's see, please take it. Fantastic. Um, big sisters, I just saw the big shadow Pokemon in the World Islands waters. <sighs> Good job, Gasak. I Jack, I was fighting some hot girls. Like, all right. 
I'll show you how to fight logically. It's like, yeah, 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 whatever, whatever. That got a little... <laughs> that, mm, that got a little rough. Oh, geez, that got kind of rough. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, all right. All right. Let's now we gotta switch around our Pokemon a little bit. Okay, Max. Move Pokemon. All right. Unfortunately, I'm gonna need Fly. I'm gonna need whatever the fuck that move is. I'm gonna need a Light Bulb. So who is of the three best to take on Lugia? Who is a Flying Psychic for the record, but I think has access to Water type moves. Not you. You. Um, yeah. Yeah. Because you'll electrify, you'll blizzard, and you'll ancient power. Yep, sounds good. Sounds good to me, team. Yep, sounds, sounds good. Look how big he is. Or cute. Stretches out its body and its vines is just like <laughs> over the entire room. I uh, real quick, I need to go to the bathroom because of my patriotic soda that I was drinking. So I'm gonna be as they're flying, I'm gonna be right back. Bloop. Oops, wrong one. There we are. Force of habit. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. We. We are gonna fuck ourselves up. A god. That is. That is my goal. We are gonna just absolutely destroy a god. What gets me though is the guy said a waterfall. I think there was a waterfall, was there? Mm -hmm. Yep, bind the reliance of the seal. Alright, um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Flash. Flash. 
Alright. Da, da, da. Wait, this is the path that doesn't have anything. Shit, I need to leave. Yeah, I need to leave. My bad. My bad. Alright, I just gotta... Yep. It's so weird watching Tangrowth just trundle around with me. Alright, cool. Yeah, I don't know where in the world islands this is, but I'm completely sure we can find it. I think I'll catch the horsey. Because I don't think we have a seal yet, so horsey will be just another fine water type. Although, if I get seal, then I'll have an actual ice type with shelter. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Let's do that instead. So, we'll catch seal. Which, yeah, I know. It's like, is it, they're Gen 1 Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah, I know. And no, I'm not going to say Lugia or Lugia. Is it Lugia or Lugia? I, I honestly don't know. I'm not going to say, like, well, that's the first Gen 2, so I'm going to catch it. Blah, blah, blah. No, we're killing him. All right, how the fuck do I get in? Bulbapedia, Lukia, Whirl, 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 Whirl Islands. All right. There's a lot of cool shit in here. Golbat, Seal, Krabby, Tentacool, Tentacruel, Horsey. Uh, yeah, there's literally nothing unique. It's seal or horsey. That's, that's, that's it. There it is. Special Pokemon. Oh, Gen 4. Uh, special Pokemon when you get the Hoenn and Sinnoh sounds. Lugia in the World Islands. Uh, okay. Soul Silver. Alright. Um. Hmm. Here's why I'm getting a little confused in the map, guys. Alright, so... See, this doesn't actually help me that much. Because, like, if I go back in, right? If I go back in, I'm at... Oh, I'm Pokemon. Tortilla. Flash. See, the map doesn't actually tell me where they connect. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm here. Here, which led to... Actually, hold on. Yeah, so I'm here. So I go down one. And I'm... Here. Basement floor one. So I just gotta find... The way down. Which, if I'm here, right, that means I need to find there. Okay, that's fine, because then floor one. I might just have to approach from a different island. Because if I go, if I'm here, right, I just go there and there. Okay, I'm giving up hope too quick. I'll admit, in my own impatience, I'm just kind of like, let's fucking go. I should not be impatient. I should also not keep this up on the map so I can look at it whenever I want. Uh... Hmm. Well, if there's four islands total... Right. Uh, um, we don't have an overview map, so... Route 41. If I go to a map of Route 41, there are four islands. So I've been on the bottom two. I should try the top left and the top right. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. I'm just an idiot. Uh... 
<sighs> there, okay. It's just that sound every time just says <laughs> So gross. Oh my god, I don't care. Yeah, it's a second, there we go. Eh, eh. Yeah, so this, yeah, so we just gotta we just gotta kick it to the north island stuff. It's weird. Okay, I think the big reason that I got really burnt out from this game, and probably the reason that I'm getting really burned out from Heroes of the Storm, which this Friday will be the last stream of that one, um, is because of how much I just had to play this in my free time. You know, like with Final Fantasy and stuff, it was I play it on stream and then I don't play it at all. But with these games, I had to play them in my free time so that I can like grind up the grind for the Pokemon I needed, or grind for the level I needed rather, I should say. And like in Heroes of the Storm, I'm trying to do the daily quest so I can get gold, so I can play more characters, because I don't want to pay more money, because I've already plunked too much money into Blizzard. And Yeah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. But um I think that's what drove me nuts about it so quickly. You know, I mean, it wasn't, it, it's like, a, it was all I was doing. So I, so I got kind of frustrated with it. And that's why, if anyone's wondering, like, why is Max so, why is Max in such a complete, I don't give a shit mode about this game? And it, and that's why, because it's like, okay, I think, okay, I think this is a great game. I think it's fun. Uh, I like the challenge of a Nuzlocke, but also, oh my goodness, I want to die. <laughs> You know, it's like I don't, I don't want to do this. I, I don't, I don't want. <laughs> well, I don't want to do this because I've had to grind so much on my own, and after a while, it just becomes a bit much. Which is why I am. Um, I do want to play Sword and Shield at some time. I think I, even though I heard a lot of people really didn't like Sword and Shield, like I'm, I'm fine with that. I, I'd, I'd love to play the game on my own, bake my. Sorry. Make my own decision and judgment on that. But um, if I do that game, I don't think I'm going to do a Nuzlocke. But instead, I will just say that um, I won't do a Nuzlocke, but it'll be my goal to um, only use the new Pokemon. Or just Pokemon that I rarely use ever. So that way I can like you know play with the new guys and like figure out what they're all about. Um... Uh, back there. There you go, Tortilla. Let's go. Fantastic. Alright, so I don't know if this will get us all the way there, but... Why do you do this, Max? Just be like, okay. All right, there you go. This will be our chance to catch Seal. This right here. This will be our chance to catch Seal. And I know the perfect way to do it. There we go. Get our big boy in. Uh, I was hoping we would still fall asleep, though. I was going to be like, nope. Alright, I'm pretty physically powerful. You know, you're pretty tanky. You can survive one more. What if I just threw a Pokeball right now? What if I just threw a Pokeball right now? Um. Oh, I have Quick Balls! Damn it. I have Quick Balls, son of a bitch. I should have I just thrown a Quick Ball. Hey! All right, now I gotta look up in different languages. In different languages. Let's see. Sorry, I'm giggling. In daytime, is often found asleep on the sea bed. Shallow waters, its nostrils close. Well, closes. A uh, close. Its nostrils close while it swims. Okay. Would you like to give it a nickname? Yes, I would.
I like that word. I'm a horrible person. I admit it. Oh, God. The jokes are just too funny. It's dark. <laughs> okay, I see an item there. I want that item. Oh, wait, now I can, now I can just store a pals. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. It's only level 23, though, so I don't, I don't care. I straight up just don't care. Uh, big... Yes. Alright, there we go. Nice! We're gonna pour all these into into Garnid. So I don't mind. Oh god. Okay, there there was that one path back there though that had an item, so I wanna Just wanna yep, just that real quick. Oh, shit. Why can't you just let me uh, I think that happened in later games too, that like, if you use repels, if it runs out there, like, hey, you wanna use another one? Okay. Not bad, not bad. God, that's a big, oh wait, no, 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 that'll, that'll shunt me down or whatever the word is. We only got nine more of these suckers. Nuggets. Nuggets are good. Right, hang on. Cheating. All right, hold on. Da, 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 big four map. If I go that way. Oh, oh wait, that's not a way. Oh, okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. All right, good. I was going to say, like, is there an item in that direction? Of which there is not. Unless it's hidden, which is fine. Wait, no. Hang on. There you go. Okay, good. Shit. Uh, these things run out so quickly. Alright, this doesn't get old. Max, are you just... Yes. Alright, oh, perfect. Alright, perfect. Who, who the fuck are you? Oh shit! Oh god! Damn it! I've been foiled! I don't think this is the path that I need. So, it's probably the top right. It's probably the top right island then. There we go. Okay. So now we can. Wait, now I gotta go this way. There we go. Yeah, I've been, I've been down to play Pokemon Sword or Shield. I don't know which one to choose. My first instinct is to say Sword. But I'd have to look at, like, what Pokemon are unique to each game, if you will. And then from there, make a decision. Yeah, you know, like who I'd want to use. Because maybe there's like some new Pokemon in one that isn't in the other that I'm like really interested in. Or maybe there's some Pokemon from like, you know, older generations that's like, okay, so my goal would be to not play with any Pokemon that I normally play with. And just in general, that'd be my goal. So like, hey, if something came up that was in Gen 2, 3, 4, whatever, who cares? I'd do it. Yeah, as long as it was interesting. Kind of a deal. Kind of like here with Slowbro. Of like, I genuinely like Slowbro. And it's fun and interesting. So, let's use him. Kind of a thing. 
Let's see. Uh, perfect. Uh, da -da. I just made a realization that if he's a flying type, he might blow Tangrowth out of the sky with a flying type move. I might not want Tangrowth to lead the charge. Might not want Tangrowth to lead the charge. I know it depends. Lantern just seems like a safe bet. Yeah. Nope. Alright, hold on. Uh, yeah, let's get Lantern in. Because Napora, is, Napora is amazing. Okay, so here's the here's the interesting thing with Tangrowth. Like Tangrowth is, uh, I think I chose wrong. Did I choose wrong? Well, no, no, I think I chose right actually. Yeah, because. But, um, I chose wrong. I understand the purpose of rooms and puzzles that work. I understand the purpose of rooms and puzzles that work like this to make it a maze, but sometimes it gets a little frustrating when you're like, now I gotta go all the way back around and... Oh, shit. Yeah, because now I have to... Now I have to leave the cave. Go to the north... Uh, go to the northeast island. On. Now I gotta leave, go to the northeast island. And then go the other way. Yeah, there you go. Let's see, yes, I like these roll put, thank you. Leave the fight. Bye. This and bye. Yeah. I'm trying to think. So I haven't. I've done a little digging into the newer Pokemon, but not very much digging. So I don't know who I'd pick. Of the starters, I'm probably biased towards Inteleon. I think he's called. The, okay, so you have the giant monkey, you have the giant rabbit, you have the giant um, lizard. Something in my heart strikes me wrong. Or, sorry. What should I say? There's something about um, Cinderace, or whatever the fire rabbit is called, that kind of messes with me a little bit. And I think it's that it looks too human. It looks way too much like a human that happens to be a furry. You know what I mean? Like, that bugs me. And then I'm, I remember when I was looking at their designs, Inteleon was the same way of, like, that's a dude. Just straight up. That's a dude. <laughs> this is not an animal. This is a dude. <laughs> Which I know is kind of like a weird critique of it. Just be like, what's wrong with it being a dude? It's like, I don't know, it's just a dude. It's, it's like sock and throw. Like, I genuinely don't like them because they're Dudes. And there are a bunch of Pokemon that look like dudes that I'm fine with, like Lucario. But, you know, it's like... Nice. 
Yeah, like it's it's straight up it's just a oh, it's straight up just a dude. And I get it, so inevitably you're gonna have Pokemon that kinda look like humans, especially if when they take like strong inspirations from human things, but also I don't wanna play a soccer player. I don't wanna play a secret agent. I might just dump the <laughs> I might just dump the starter. It would be the first time that I've done that. Just to be like, yeah, I'm I'm not gonna use the starter. In fact, I think I will do that. I just There we go. I get it. Yeah. Perfect. Ah, I'm perfect. I'll talk to the old man. He'll let me through. Fuck you. Here's a Krabby. It's like, ah, shit. Grab it, grab it by his claw. Like, throw it over the ravine. He's like, I don't care. That thing you have. That thing that you do. It's just to bribe this one old man. Or monk. Or whatever the fuck. Uh, is this it? Is this the cave? Ooh. Ooh. Damn it. I was just thinking, like, man, like, a, a wild Pokemon fight here would really, like, ruin the vibe. You know? <laughs> be a little, be a little, like... You know, this is meant to be, like, sanctified and holy. And yeah, I know it's our intention to kill this bastard, but... Oh, look at all those whirlpools. Uh, ooh, all, these, all, these, all these whirlpools. Time to meet the mascot of the game. Even though, like, the mascot had nothing to do with anything. It was just rehashing an old villain from Team Rathom. <laughs> oh no. Exit. <sighs> Alright, let's go. This is where we welcome Lugia. When the dance, we practice many days because one with the sign of the title, but we entrust with you. Then Lugia shall come out from deep within the waterfall basin once again. This thing just flew out of my pocket. I don't appreciate it. This is really cool. Like, that's a really fun water effect. It's not quite. Oh, it's a giant bell. Oh, oh, it's a bell. See, it's not quite perfectly in sync, though, because you're not... Never, shut, shut, Max. She, she is turning at different rates than they are, Max. It's fine. Oh, shit, man. I'm trying to sleep. You woke me up with your special dance. And, like, really, the prophecy, it could be any dance. Oh, shit. You ready for some 3D? Bitch! Oh my goodness. It's beautiful. It is here to destroy this world and its cataclysmic wind. The guardian of these islands from ancient times. So many have tried again and again only to fail. Max, your heart in complete harmony with the Bible has finally allowed it to appear. I don't know why. I mean, why are we wake? Okay, real talk. Why are we waking it up? Besides my desire to kill it, why are we waking it up? Why are you waking it up? Wait, hold on. What you do now is entirely up to you. Fantastic. <laughs> Just straight up like, alright. I mean, what? what 
what options do I have? Real talk. What are, what are what are my options here? Oh god, it's, it's big and scary. Real talk though, like okay, so either you're gonna let this child kill it or capture it and put it in a box. Like why why are we waking it up? Why does it need to be woken up? What's gonna happen as it be as a result of it being woke up? What's gonna happen? Are you just gonna let a kid walk away with your god? Hang on, I have to surf. I gotta surf to get to you. Now hang on just a moment. You sure you don't want to switch our teams or anything? Or? Then Garnet lead or Napora? We got anti. What are your moves again? Any moves again? No, actually, no. Let's lead with Napora. Let's lead with Napora. Because I'm willing to bet anything Napora is able to tank a hit. And then you can stun Spore. Yeah, that's a good plan. Okay. Hey, big boy. How you doing? How you doing this fine day? Oh shit, the music. Oh god, it's beautiful. Oh, it's a sight to behold for all. I'm lower level than you. Oh shit. Stun spy. Oh my goodness, okay, so a new hydro pump. For some, some ass reason, a new hydro pump. Oh. Oh, ancient power. Ancient power. Napora, you're good at everything except speed and special defense. You can do this. Oh, if only I knew thunder. If only I knew thunder. If only I knew thunder. Just keep, just keep lining it up. Oh yeah, it's right pressure. I was gonna say like, why do I have less PP than I should? Yeah, like, why do I have less PP than I thought I should? And it's like, well, you see. Cuts, cuts of pressure. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Yep, just. Ooh. That's the fun of ancient power. Oh my goodness, I've cheesed this so hard. Oh god, Napora. Slam the shit. Just slam the shit. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, here's the bad juju. Here's the bad juju. That's with rain. Something shit. <laughs> hey! Objectively, that would have been the perfect chance to catch it, but we don't care. We're here to kill God, ladies and gentlemen, and we have done so. I'm gonna go touch this. Hey, I made your guy go back to sleep. That's what you wanted, right? And they're like, oh, oh, you, 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 you killed our god. You killed him. All right, kids. So you're kind of an asshole. <laughs> you're kind of an asshole. If that's what you want to do, I guess, but maybe he'll come back once everything is settled. Go fucking kill the Elite Four, and probably the next set of Elite Four, and maybe if you're a good boy, and you tithe the church, and you, you know, do all the right things, maybe he'll come back if you're not an asshole by the time you leave. Oh god. Oh, that was great. That was good stuff. Good stuff. Screw you, Todd. Good stuff. Oh, gal. I'm a horrible person. Just straight up. I'm a horrible person. Okay, now is there a reason I should get rid of Cut? Yeah, let's get, ri I, let's get rid of Cut. Are we going to need Cut on the trail? God, I hope not. Um, Wait, no, no, no. That's right. That's right. I still can't believe it's like what we what you do now is up to you. Wait, no, no. No, none of them, none of them, none of them, none of them, none of them. No, 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 no. There you go, I need to forget her. Uh you forget some moves. Yes. I would like you to make uh uh I don't have him with me. 
I am in, I am a I am a fuel. Just in general, I am a fuel. Hang on just a second. Said I have to swim up a route to get to the Elite Four or something. I don't actually freaking remember. I just realized I'm gonna actually need to go somewhere else after this. I just killed their sacred deity. <laughs> yes, force my Pokemon to forget. Suck its brain out. Uh, we'll get Just absolutely suck its brain out. Cut. Should that move? Yes. That was a weird sound. All right, cool. Now we need to go to Ilix Forest. Why? That's another thing I will never understand with Pokemon. Like, why in the world? Why in the world? Well, okay. I bet what they were worried about by making HMs permanent and make it so you can't release Pokemon unless you have Pokemon Center is because they don't want you to like soft lock yourself somehow. You know what I mean? Like, if I had to make a bet, that's what it was. Um. Oh, God. Which one do you come and cut? Um, hang on. Who here among you can learn cut? Actually, wait, hold on. Don't you have cut? You have cut. Yeah, that's right. Okay, that's fine. Okay, uh, I gotta go here. Switch in you for you. All right, cool. I would want to replace Cut with another move, but I, I don't quite know what, but I would want to. I mean, he has Poison Jab and Surf. That That's basic coverage. And then Toxic Spikes for a little, for a little Razzle Dazzle, you know what I mean? Gotta have that Razzle Dazzle. Razzle Dazzle, incredibly important. But, um... It's, 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 it's mine. Anyway. I'm about to be accosted. So much, so hard. Oh my goodness, they're level six. I am, I am what, seven times your level? And I have to spend repels to get you little bastards away from me? Because I just don't want to deal with you anymore? Yes. Yes. There you go. Fantastic. Where's the dude? Where's the dude? There's the dude. Damn it. There's the dude. Oh my goodness. I think the other problem that might be with me and Pokemon is that Pokemon is one of those games that like, you know, maybe I shouldn't be streaming it because then I lose patience with, um, yes. Uh, give it to Wickton. Yeah, like, because I'm on... Because I'm essentially doing a show, there might be that, like, inherent, like, impatience. Well, if I was on my own, I'd be a little frustrated, but I can't do... <sighs> yeah, there might be that inherent impatience because I can't do that here. Or, sorry, that, that um... That I want to do fun and interesting stuff. And that's heightened when I'm on stream as opposed to when I'm on my own and I'll sit there and I'll do stupid stuff. It's fine. Yeah, we escaped. Fuck you, Butterfree. You know what I mean? So that that is, I think it's something on me, essentially. Uh, set Route 28. Right oh. Let's 
this is this where I'm supposed to, is this where I'm supposed to go? I don't I, I don't actually know where I'm supposed to. Claire mentioned it, and then I forgot. There's not a Pokemon Center here, is there? There's not a Pokemon Center here, is there? Son of a bitch. Well, Route 27! Wait, hold on, we haven't been on Route 27. <gasps> I already have you, so I don't care. Oh, I, I didn't write down the... I didn't write down the Pokemon I got. I don't, I don't care about you, okay? I need, I need someone new and exciting to save my incri- slowly goes insane <laughs> because I know we have a ways to go like we gotta we gotta like freaking get through all of victory road and then the elite four like that is Silver, Victory Road, there it is, the Indigo Plateau. Oh god. Oh god, thank you for interrupting me. Thank you for. Should I investigate? Maybe. I, I don't know, do I even want to? Tojo Falls, Tojo Falls. You'd have to be, you have to be absolutely insane to think you can do this. Hang on, number blue. Alright, okay, repeat after me. Someone new. It's pretty, it's pretty damn cute. It's, it's pretty, it's pretty cute. It's pretty cute. Like, I, it's, it, it's, what? Don't I have... Oh my god! <laughs> oh my goodness! But Max, this is the main gameplay loop. It's not the part that I'm interested in. Damn it! It's not. This is a lot, okay? This is a lot. I think I remember why I stopped playing Pokemon. Because this was just getting to me. I know I'm a big whiner. I know it's like Max, you're being you're being overly dramatic for sake of whatever. Maybe a little, but like I want to get to the interesting stuff, you know. If anything, I probably should be killing things because the champion's level 50. I would like to remind everyone, the champion's level 50. But okay, I less want to I less want to fight these guys because I don't have my full team with me. So it's like, am I gonna have to be giving experience to guys I don't care about? Fantastic, I guess. It's a rare candy, sure, okay. We're gonna have to go through Tojo Falls, which is how they make it in the game, so that we have to, you know, do the shit. Uh, the Pokemon, and then we just go to Scrikey's, and then we're just gonna we're just gonna fly way the fuck up. Are you serious? Are you serious? Why? Why? Why would you do this? I'm 
why would you make it so I can't fly back? That makes no sense. Just why? Why why would you why why? Why would you do this? What's What's the logic? What's the I feel like that adds more work in programming than it would just to let it be a normal, like, you can fly- Why? 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 Why would you- Can I use it now? No, I can't. Why? Just in gen- Just in general. Just in general. Why? There had to be a reason, right? You know, it like, trying to think of like what different programming teams and stuff would do. I'm not gonna pretend that I'm as smart as them. I'm sure there's some good reason, but I would love to hear it. Just in general, I would love to hear it. All right, hold on. Uh, okay, sweet lady freedom. All right, okay, so strikies, fly, fuck up there, go. Go, you bitch, we need to grab our fucking Gyarados, I guess. I guess. Which is gonna become really awkward when I have to have a full team of HM slaves. Move the Pokemon, okay, great. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, cool. Okay, so, 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 we put you back. We're gonna need a fly boy because for some ass reason, main town doesn't have a computer to switch. Might be worth it to fly back to that one spot. All right, so, we're gonna need Gyarados. And then we're gonna switch in Sudo Snoot. Good. All right, good, great stuff. Wait, no, hold on. We need someone that knows cut. I'm gonna switch on you. All right. We have a surfer. We have a cutter. We're gonna have whirlwinder. We have a whirlpooler. We have a strengther. We got a rock smasher. We're all good. I just had to butcher my, you know, awesome team just to make sure that I have all the HMs. Gonna have to, gonna have to run our way through. <sighs> okay, so I give, I gave Sun and Moon, and I give Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu a lot of shit, because in many ways it does feel kind of silly, or it does feel, oops. In, in some ways it does feel very silly. That like. Wherever you are in the world, random ass Pokemon just appear. And it's just like, oh shit, witch, look, it's the Pokemon. And they help you do the thing. But man, was that mess convenient? You know, just to just to walk over and be like, oh yes, I think I will. Oh yeah, oh, I actually forgot. Oh, hold on. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Do 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 Zipella. Shoes. <laughs> Fantastic. And he has the ability Thick Fat, which is not really the most useful for a water type in terms of type coverage, but it's still pretty nice. Like, Thick, thick Fat is honestly a pretty dope ability. If I remember correctly, it essentially gives you resistance to, um... Ah, this music. Son of a bitch. There we go. Where's my mom? No. I should visit my mom. Hey mom, I killed God. Mom, you proud of me? No, mom, it's not about money. Maybe just do what you can. Maybe I love you and I just want to visit you. 
Now that I have killed God. It's like, uh, you came here for your money, right? No! What kind of selfish bastard do you think I am? Like, holy shit! I didn't buy any repels. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. We don't need it. We don't need it because I arbitrarily decide that we don't need it. Whatever. It's fine. Okay, there we go. That is really pretty, though. In terms of art. Like, that's very well done. Alright, um... There you go. I yep. <sighs> um I don't have a gold ink. But it's not a gen one. It's not a gen one. Or sorry, it is gen one. I don't wanna you know, I don't wanna deal with it. Yeah, now I'm gonna start killing things. We are we are in fully new and wonderful territory. So I'm just gonna start murdering. Because we do need to get everyone leveled up. Good work. We go to the side. Nope. All right. Nope. All right. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Hey, we don't have a Goldeen. What does Goldeen do? Uh, it's a water type. And I think they're mostly... They're at least they're either well-rounded or mostly physical base and they're interesting because they learn moves like peck and mega horn and drill horn And I think a few other like solid normal type moves and like some bug and some flying just because just they do and Goldeen's all pretty and feminine and sea king is kind of ugly honestly Just in general is kind of ugly And, um, yeah, that's about it. Alright. And for some ass reason, of which escapes me to this day, Super Smash Bros. was like, we need to have a fun Pokemon that, like, sometimes when you throw the Pokeball, it comes out and it does nothing. You know, just to kind of, like, add to that extra little... Just to kind of, like, add to that extra little, like, sense of weird randomness, you know? Which is good, and I'm not opposed to that. And they're like, you know, you know who, what, who, who we should, you know who we should use to uh, as a Pokemon that like splashes uselessly around. We should use Goldine, who actually is useful and viable in its own right, instead of you know the Pokemon that's known as the one that's useless and splashes around. I think I have any Pokemon that evolve from Moonstone, do I? I don't think so. It's a big deal in general, but I I don't I don't think I have anyone that's like necessarily you know. It's fine. Alright, uh This is why people buy repels. It's for shit like this. It's just for shit like this. This. They're so lower leveled. And like, you know, I'm not saying all the Pokemon should be level 40, but are they, are they trying to boost your ego? I think I'm gonna catch this one. This is gonna be the one. Alright, alright, Tojo Falls. We catching us a Goldeen today, bitches. Alright, uh, Strappy, go. Also, everyone support Williamsburg. It's in Virginia. It's dope. They basically try to, like, recreate a lot of, like, the tools of the trade that were in, like, Colonial America and stuff. It's a real good time. They have different people who, um... They have different people who, uh... Also are actors that, like... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right. I don't even know how to describe it. It's like, um, it's like, uh, it's like they're re they're reenactors, but they also do like the founding fathers and stuff to like reenact scenes from their, um, 
like their debates and their like talks that they would have. It was really fun. It was a really great experience. I highly recommend it because I think America's pretty cool. Honestly, uh, it's almost weird to say that it's a political statement nowadays, but oh shit. I got fuzzies on my eyes because of the Sprite, which has not sponsored me, but um, is capable of swimming non-stop at fast streams at a steady speed of five knots per hour. So you can't use do waterfall, can you? All right. In different languages, dress. Sharp. This is how I name things. Hold on. Uh -huh. dip, dip. There we go. Uh -huh. Bosnian? Hmm. Irish. Guna gear. I kind of like that. All right. Um. Let's see. All right. So, uh. Guna. Guna gear. Guna gear. The beautiful lady. Beautiful name for a beautiful lady. They're like, that is an awful name. Yushush. Guna gear. Sharp dress. <laughs> But, um, yeah, it's weird that it's, like, it's a political statement just to say that you think America is pretty cool. But just that you think America is pretty cool as a concept. Because it's, like, you know, all these different things about, you know, all the founding fathers were horrible people. And da, 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 da. Oh, my goodness, you have a Bulbasaur! I don't have any move but slam, so slap that shit. <laughs> Oh my goodness, you just slapped my Bulbasaur to death. I'm like, damn straight I did. Damn straight. Shit. I'm gonna slap your Ivy Sword to death, too. Oh no, it lived. Oh no. This is kind of bad. Also, my coffee lid is... There you go. All right, and slam, and welcome to the jam. There you go. What was I saying? I know it's popular to bash on America and its founding history and stuff like that nowadays, but I would just like to say uh, this is, you know, how dare I say something so incredibly political in its nature? I think America's pretty cool. Yeah, I think it's. I think it's pretty nice. I think it's a great country. And yeah. There you go. And if this is what I am quoted as to say that I'm a horrible racist, so be it. I think America is pretty cool. Go support Williamsburg, you can. It's a wonderful time. Highly recommend it. I just realized I just took a weird stand all of a sudden out of nowhere. Brent, how can I help you? Uh. Normal people don't call people and tell them things like that. What the fuck? Sandstorm? Wasn't expecting that. And now it is nighttime, bitches, because it just turned to 7 o'clock. But we're not done today. We're not done. This is the only... This is... Shit. This is only the start of our shenanigans. We're going to beat Victory Road. We're going to beat the Elite Four tonight. Right. Now I'm honestly sitting here wondering if people are going to try to, like, take me down and shit for saying that. Well... To put it politely, I'm not a big enough streamer that, like, a million people are going to see this immediately and be like, bleh, 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 but that's an odd thought. I don't, I tend not to get political very much on stream because I don't feel like it is my place to do so. Because it's like when, it's like when people really, sorry, hold on, take my finger out. Um, it's like when people really fixate on the political or social opinions of different celebrities when it's like, you know, they're people just like you, right? 
They just happen to be in a position where more people notice them. You know, they're not special. So, you know, you shouldn't hold their views any stronger than your own. Or use it as an excuse not to think of your own. I don't have a ground type. I don't got a ground type move. I didn't mean to hit run. Here we go. Bitch! Oh no. Oh no, this could actually hurt. This could actually hurt. Mm, oof. Oof. There you go. Yeah, I, I ain't gonna play around with trying to... No, I'm just... I'm just putting you down. Sudasnu, it's been so long since you've been in the field. Alright, we're getting Napur back in! Yeah, Napur, Napur! Napur, get back in! Get back in, Napur! Get back in! <laughs> Their teams are starting to become... Oh no. Dare I say it... More well thought out. This is scary for us. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, that, you know, the opinions of celebrities aren't any more than your own, and it should not be... There should never be a moment where anyone says my political opinion is X because someone's. I want to avoid using Swashle. Yeah, I want to avoid using Swashle because he's not my main team. Alright, stands to reason you're gonna attack first. Yep, I don't like Sucker Punch because it is very... You know, if they know you're gonna Sucker Punch, they're just gonna... Like, what if they decide to just, like... Whatchamacallit, you know? Um, just sit there and use Sword Stance over and over again or whatever. But... When it works, it works great. Whew. Good stuff. Sorry, I just wanted to say something cool. Nah, man, I get it. It's all good. What's east to Route 26? All right, let's go kick the shit out of one guy. Um, do I have a... Do I have a... Don't I have an item that's like a flute? Don't I... Don't I have an item that's like a flute? I swear I do. Like, right? Like, I feel, I feel like I do. I feel like I do. Okay, um, don't I have a red flute? Stamps a single Pokemon out of infatuation. Not, yeah, out of infatuation, out of sleep. It's different. But, um... Yeah, that's 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 basically just the reason why like I never want to push. I never want to push any opinion or thoughts that I have. If someone asks me about it or if whatever litany of thought that I come upon leads me to talking about that, sure I'll talk about it. But I don't want to force on people because there's already so much of that nowadays, you know. Of like everyone on like different social media just screaming their opinion and expecting people to listen and. Da, 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 you know. Rank concluded. Second, Brian. Let's see. Thank you, I guess. That's a suspicious ass spot right there. That is so suspicious. Why why is that there? What is it? Um. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Ah. Let's see. Focus with a sharp gaze at his googly eyes. Damn straight, Max the trainer says. All right. Um. Hmm. 
but uh, if the holder becomes infatuated, the foe does too. Man, that is situational as shit. I was thinking of Destiny Bond with that. That's why I was like, what? You're level 30, I see. You're becoming a bigger boy. You know what I do to that, that, no, I'm not going to say, you know, I know what I do to big boys. It's like, I, I could say literally anything and it would feel wrong. Assurance only works if you're slower than the opponent, bitch, slap, all right, you're done. Imagine a poor is just like karate chopping people. Oh, there's totally something there. Nice. I can't use revives, but nice. <gasps> Alright, so it is a Gen 1. It is a... Hang on. This is Route... Uh, 27? Right? This is Route 27? Required for navigation and whirlpool. I should, I should, hold on. Route 27, eradicate, uh, hold on, eradicate Arbok. I think we've already had an Ecans though. No, I saw Ecans and I rejected it. Uh, there's nothing unique. No, unless I feel like, no, no, there's, no, this, this is it. This is it. All right, Route 26. It connects a Pokemon League reception gate to Route 27. Uh, location south of Victory Road. Okay, so this one, you only need Surf. This is cheating a little bit, but Victory Road. What is required for navigation? Uh, surf? No, uh, Rock Smash? Rock Smash? Uh, no, but there are heart scales here. Um, strength? Uh, victory has three foes to reach the other end of the tunnel and generates one, three, four, and seven. A uh, uh, series of puzzles involving these strength or strong push to move boulders needs to be solved. So someone needs strength. That's it. Sick. All right. Uh, yeah, this guy, this guy's the nearest thing to something new and exciting, so it's not for if I do a Mega Drain, it might be able to take it, but I should have thrown a Quick Ball. Why do I always forget that the Quick Ball is a thing? I always forget that Quick Ball is a thing. Just in general. Why? I should just, I should just use Quick Ball. I should just use Quick Ball. I just, I, I just, I should just use Quick Hey, it worked out. Alright, let's Google in different languages the words split and the word mind it races through grassy plains with powerful strides leaving footprints up to four inches deep jeez all right what would you like to nickname it um geese that that is the first thing that popped up in my head right there like the frisian I'm like frisian geese spout perfect and just like that, a name has been made. <laughs> They'll spell like geese, like goose. Yeah, so it'll be like geese. It'll be geese spelt. Spelt, yep. Spelt. Spelt day. Geese spelt day. Perfect. Wait, no, no, I forgot the L. I forgot the L. Gispiotte. Gispiotte. Perfect. Do duo. Which I think I don't think I've ever actually used a do duo. I know they get access to a drill pick, don't they? Don't they get access to drill pick? Right? Because it's a ground type move, which is why it's so cool. I forget. I know they're like they're fast attack. And I think they can learn fly. For no reason, which is funny, but no. even though they're meant to be, even though they're meant to be like running Pokemon, you know, I think they can still learn, which is funny. All right, what you got? Oh, you fucked up! 
<laughs> just straight up like, okay, you're gonna fight me with you're gonna fight me with psychic types. That's great. Oh, ooh, you may be faster than me, but are you going to survive? Oh no. What if I just? Damn it. What if I just? Oh, that's what you're going to do. I see. Oh no, what am I going to- Son of a bitch! Okay, this is getting a little concerning. Come on, Apora. There you go! Just- And done. <laughs> Napora has consumed. Yep, and all that health comes back. Please have another water type. I'd really appreciate it. I'd probably just slam the shit out of you, let's be honest. I'd probably just... just... Shit. I'm less cool with this now. I am less... I am less cool with this than I was previously. I think I could still win it. But... If you confuse me and paralyze me, I'm gonna leave. Yep, cause that's a, that's essentially two quarter flips that I have to pass to be able to do anything useful. So nope, Napora's out. Nope. Oh no, oh no, Blech. oh no. Oh no. And done. I should have sunny dayed. Well, no, you already sent a water type and a grass type, so. If I had to make a bet. Alright, cool. Uh, yeah, I forgot. You are a psychic. You gotta light the drafts on fire. You're too much. Blah, blah, blah. That's what my premonition says. Thank you. I'm gonna give you your lunch money. <laughs> All right. Uh, da -da. All right. Sup. So you came from new. You must be exhausted. Nah, it's just right over there. Really, it was just fighting all the dumb things in, on the way, you know. It's so cute. I'm gonna do something stupid. Oh shit. Whatever. I'm not worried. Uh, Sunny day. It's like, but why? Now my flamethrower is more powerful. It's like we both have flamethrower, you idiot. It's not. It's yeah. It's not very. The sunlight is strong. It's not very effective. Yeah, I was gonna say with um with that intimidate I'm not gonna be as strong, but I should be able just to uh, I'm starting not to like I'm starting not to like the situation. Yeah, I'm starting to hmm. Hmm. I mean, I'm likely to outspeed, so even if you pull a water on me, I am going to outspeed you. Straight up, I will outspeed you. There you go. Have fun! I was gonna say, if you lived, that would have been so much bullshit. <laughs> Be like, no, fuck, no, no, fuck you. I don't heal, though, which is unfortunate. Knit arena. Does the dance I can just power through you? Just no, no more of that. No, no. Sunny day stab. No, you're now. Now you're not. Nope. You're, you're not. You're not gonna. No. All right. Yeah. You're doing something right if you can be even by another. I like you. Give me your number. You can be my practice partner. Sure. 
just at least let me fly between. It was a fluke. Whatever. Fuck. Oh wait, hang on. Okay. Route 26. Oh shit. <laughs> Alright, Route 26. This is somewhere new. Route 26. We just gotta fight through this and then fight through Victory Road. Alright, I'm gonna switch to... Actually, no. I'm gonna switch to... Wookden. Yep. Wookden is gonna just headbutt the shit out of you. Here we go. Mm. Don't you have an ability called Poison Point? Yeah, we'll flag it. Let's go! Ooh. Ooh, still alive. Whew. Okay, I, I couldn't remember if Revenge worked like Assurance or not, but I think it's like... I think it's if it's the first move you use when an ally faints. I think that's what that move is. I'm suddenly scared. It has to be the first move he uses. I think it's gonna go fine. I think it's gonna go just fine, especially with, yeah, especially with the amount that I'm gonna heal. It's all good. You're a stockpile. Stockpile is such a cool idea for an ability, but like, when matches can go so quickly, like stockpile is a long-term game kind of a thing because it raises your defense and special offense and you can either use it to like heal or use it to do like a mega attack. And it's fun, but it's also kind of like, eh, you know. There you are, you big ugly thing. Thing is, you're not even that ugly. It's just when you look at Goldie and you're like this beautiful, elegant thing and it turns into you and it's kind of weird, you know. Oh, you flinched. Oh, that's a pity. Shoop, shoop. And done. Bye bye. Flinching is bullshit. All right, there you go. Whew. Okay. Yeah, with your two quill fishes. All right. Uh. All right. Oh no. Same. Actually, I am I am satisfied, but I I just wanna I just wanna put them on my mantle and just leave leave it at that. Oh shit! Oh, I know what to do. Bitch! Oh. Oh no. Those are the moments that sucker punch is really useful. Now I'd obviously like crunch more. But, you know, you didn't see that one coming, did you? All right, uh, bye. If I go there, I'm going to have to. Thought it's not an item. <gasps> oh, pff, oh, pff, ah, thick. Is an item down there. Hang on. <laughs> He's like, um, what are you doing? It's like, you're psychic, you can divine it. It's here. That's it. I'm doing it. What the fuck? It did me good. Oh. He's like, you here to run more laps? No, 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 I'm good now. I'm all good. Got out of my system, you know. It's all. It's all fine. Uh. Dope! Will you let me switch out my team? 
No? That's fair. Honestly, it's fair. The, I, I wish I could switch, you know, get my two other guys back in. You know. Oh my goodness, it's a Pikachu. There's only one thing to do in this world. Headbutt the shit out of me. It's a girl, too. It's all cute and shit. Please don't static me. Nope. Oh, God! Oh, God! It's a big boy. Uh, headbutt. Go the ass man, that's all I got. <laughs> Just this eyes. Yeah, now. Uh, yeah. This is, this is, I'm going for the flinch. Going for the flinch. Flinch. Never. Ah, that works. That perfect. Yep. Nailed it. Just heal up real quick and. Yep. Call it a day. I'm okay. This is something I complained about before. I'm simultaneously, I simultaneously wish they would do it, but I'm also thankful that they don't, is, um, I'm sil- I kind of wish more, more trainers had more developed teams. You know, on one side, I really want that. On the other side, I'm so glad that they don't, because that would make every battle, like, a harrowing experience. But I kind of want that, you know? Oh my goodness. Um... Look at him, freaking beast! <laughs> like, jeez. All right. What? No, oh, come on. Really? Thought for sure there'd be something back here. Yeah, I thought. Yeah. There. I'm so freaking cute. Fuck you. Ah, oh, I lived. Lived. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, we're good. And eh, quick attack. Extreme speed would be dope. But I'll sell for quick attack. Alright, there we go. Yeah, Wookdin's all leveling up. Really? Oh, it's, oh shit, house. Dope. Uh, who lives here? Yeah, sure. Uh, we take pride in serving Pokemon trainers. When trainers talk to you, give them something useful. Love, Monica. Keep reading. Oh shit, it's these guys. Yeah, so this is this is the answer to those people that just appear everywhere and they give you free stuff. Yeah. So if you're ever like, you know, why are these people showing up? It makes no sense. There's the answer. You sure you're not doing laps? So shut up, shut up, lady. I know exactly what I'm doing. Do you now? I'm like flipping into um. There's a D and D character that I played, or I'm actively playing that I really enjoy. And her name is Saya Shabda, and she talks. It's me attempting a female German accent. It strikes me as kind of loud. Did the volume increase? It did. There you go. Sorry about that. But, um, it's me trying to do a female German accent, because she's a girl. And she's also kind of a cynical and sarcastic asshole. Like, she ultimately will still try to help people, but there's definitely this air of, like, really now, is this what we're doing? You know, like, that kind of. Very incredulous. So, me as a psychic, it's kind of, like, drifting into Saya. All right, um, dope. We are kind of beaten up though, so. Mm, eh, nah, I don't like that. I, mm, I don't like this. Gonna flip into Napora. Yep, gonna flip into Napora. Yeah, that doesn't give me the good feeling. I can't believe, I can't believe Kingler doesn't learn a physical something. Just something. It doesn't even need to be that good. Just something. Physical and water. Because that's all it is. Kingler is a powerhouse physical fighter. He's not necessarily the fastest. He is 
but his special defense and attacks suck, but he's pretty tanky, all things considered, and he's just really fucking strong. <laughs> and he doesn't learn. Oh, shit. <sighs> Wanna make a bet? Wanna make a bet? My special attack's pretty high. You're defend- you're physically focused, not specially focused. Shit. I'll take that bet. There you go. Whew. All right, Tangrowth, you're starting to... Okay, Tangrowth, you're starting to keep your weight a little bit. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that's all right. That's all right. Can I get your phone? Yes! Sure! I'm tormented by these thoughts all the time. It's like, we, we fought not even five minutes. Not even a minute. Like, literally, less, like, tw tw 20, 20 seconds. Dude, 20, 20 seconds we fought. Just tw 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 20 seconds. He's like, ah, oh, it torments me. Endlessly, I will lay awake sleeping at night. To be fair, he does get crap here, much like Froggy Aqua Ted isn't until way later. Yeah, that that's what bugs me. Like, it takes so long. Cause like, okay, I think they release it in later later, I think it was Gen 5. They got Razor Shell. And somewhere along the line they had Clamp or something like that. Just those. Just earlier on, because otherwise it feels like Kingler is just wait, FX4. That's it's fine. It's fine. There you go. But um I just wish he got it earlier because otherwise as a water type, he is not very effective, which is a big shame because Kingler is a cool Pokemon. You might as well use water. yeah, exactly. Alright, um We're good to still use Headbutt, yeah. Man, it, I want everyone to know that I really like Pokemon, okay? I think Pokemon's a really cool game. I love the world. I love the concept. I have a lot of issues with these games. It's just small things that I'm like, that shouldn't be the way it is. <laughs> Alright, that should be enough. Okay, and then depending on what we fight next, I'll decide on whether or not to keep Wookton in or not. Alright, uh, Gold Duck? Yeah, I'll be fine. You're you're just a water type. You're super well-rounded, if I remember right. Some special focus, but not really. Uh, it access to spe psychic moves. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine, right? I am less okay with this situation. I should have switched out. I, I shouldn't have I shouldn't have played that game. Whatever, it's fine. I I had I had faith in Wookton. Blew it. Alright, uh, okay, first things first. Switch out Wookton for Mother Levin Pseudosnoot. Uh hold on. Uh-huh. Freaking knew it! No, I, no, no. It does nothing. They're literally worthless. Well, I think someone buys them, but, you know, whatever. He was really, oh. Oh, I feel sorry for his Pokemon. As a result, I'm going to fucking fight you. Let's go. All right, wrap it. I'm gonna make a bet. I'm gonna make a bet. All right. All right, good. So, here's my bet. I bet I can kill you. Yep, now we're just gonna both throw normal physical attacks at each other. If 
by the time, before the sunlight goes away, I'm willing to bet I can kill you. And then even if they drop a water type or ground type on me, I'll be able to light them up. That is the bet that I am making. Skidoo. There you go. Alright. Flappy? Oh, he's so freaking cute, Flamethrower! Just... Just light it up! Oh, Joe, oh, no! Oh, there it goes. Oh, no. Oh, it's so sad. There we go. Pokemon aren't tools of war. You, you, you just destroy. Uh, yes. Yes, take my phone number. There you go. Little battle again. Never. All right, fantastic. All right. Let's see. Oh. Say, uh, please go right uh, through. Thank you. Are you gonna stop me? I just wanna see if you'd stop me. Okay. Hey, do you got like Pokemon Center? Right? Is there like a, is there like a Pokemon Center? Nope. Nope. All right, let's write it down. Victory Road. No Pokemon Center, nothing. Not that ad too, just has Lieutenant Surge. I really wish they fleshed that out more. Cause he was in the military and they were, were they using Pokemon? Did he just happen to become a Pokemon trainer afterwards? Like, what, 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 what happened in his past? How many Pokemon died? What was the war about? Wait, no, hold on. It's, uh, yep. All right. Okay. It, it, it. There you go. All right. Ma'am, can I sleep at your house for the third time today? Thank you. I would love it, though, if in some game, sometime, somewhere in the future, like, you could play in whatever the Pokemon War is. And I get it. That's too dark. You know, it's like, oh, it's not friendly for the kitties if you do that. I get it, but also, it'd be really fun. <laughs> I like to know what regions Kanto is in war with and what were the conflicts, such a, such a waste of chance for deep lore. Like, Pokemon is a weird habit of doing that, I think, of like, okay, I saw from the image there was a uh, Mother Eleven. Graveler, so I'm gonna want. I'm gonna have Lady Lick up top. Um, yeah, Pokemon has a weird habit of doing that. That it's almost like they will hint that great lore exists, and then they will never touch on it again. There we go. Uh, okay. Uh, uh oh. Ah, this is gonna be bad. And I get it on the grounds of, hey, Max, this is a kid's game. It's meant for small children. You know, it's designed in such a way that's enjoyable for adults, but it is also meant to be accessible towards children. Let's maybe not talk about how someone used a Charizard to light up, like, civilians and women and children in a school district as part of the Kanto Jodo War or whatever. Whatever region is was in war with Kanto. Like, I get it. Oh my, I don't care, Tully. I, do, I don't. I don't. I, I'm ghosting you. I'm straight up ghosting. <laughs> Which is also like... It's also why I kind of... I complain about the difficulty of these games, even though I don't truly expect a fix. Because it's expected for children, you probably don't want them to have super in-depth and hard strategies. You're here to have fun. You know what I mean? I should put the experience share on. Nah, it's fine. Okay. This is gonna be a long victory road. This is gonna be a long ass victory road. 
Please. Please don't have sturdy. Please don't have sturdy. Okay, good. Because if he had sturdy and then did magnitude or earthquake, I could super easily lose Liddy Licked. I really don't want to lose Liddy Licked because Liddy Licked is super good. Alright. Uh -huh. Up, 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 up. Hey, That's why I'm glad Nuzlocke's became a thing. I honestly lost my interest in Pokemon back in Gen 3 and then Nuzlocke comics pulled me back in. I never actually sat down and read the comics. I just love the concept of a Nuzlocke. The only thing that um, really gets me about Nuzlocke and... Um, so, j just so you know, I started this series a while ago and then stopped because I got so sick of grinding off camera to get everyone to a respectable level. And... Today was essentially me being like, alright, I got everyone to a high level, let's finish this. Let's, let's do this. But, um, I like Nuzlocke's in all those regards, except for having to grind a lot. Like, that, that just drives me nuts. Uh, yeah, there we go. So I'm thinking if and when I do another Pokemon series, I'm just gonna... I want to treat it with the... I have not caught an Ursa I have not caught an Ursa Ring. Oh, holy shit. It's a bear. It's a, it's a big ass... It's a big ass bear. Oh, fuck. How does it work? Um... It's a normal high physical like that has access to an odd amount of dark and maybe psychic moves. I could be wrong. Some plant related things. Uh... I, I don't... I don't remember how you work. Uh, I don't remember how you work. But I know that trick works on you. I mean, that trick works on you. Alright, uh. If I send in Strappy, Strappy will be able to intimidate it. And even though he's 13 levels lower, he should be able to chunk enough damage out of it. Hopefully. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not emotionally worried about it. Am I losing Strappy? Yeah. So Strappy's dead, but I'm gonna be honest. Okay, I'm gonna write in my notes because I do have notes for the names of the, uh, all the Pokemon and stuff, you know. There it is, Strappy Splash. So, dead by Ursaring, but reincarnated. <laughs> That is to basically say, I never intended on using Stroppy in combat. I definitely don't intend to now. I'm going to use him as a HM slave. Oh, perfect. Oh, that is absolutely... Ursaring can have guts? Ooh. That's bad. All right, you can survive one more cut, right? Good stuff. Good stuff. Alright. Uh, big. Uh, bookable. And uh, great ball. And I gotta look up a name. Let's look up in different languages. Shit. Why didn't you. Why didn't you. Why did I'm gonna switch out just for safety. Uh, Napora, you have really high physical defense, right? You have high physical defense. You'll be fine. All right, uh, big. Go. Let's see. Yeah, I'm going to name Guts because you brought up that shit. Or something. Okay, we're gonna. I'm just gonna keep doing this. I don't want to. I don't want to hurt you anymore. So, because you're fully evolved, motherfucker. All right. Uh, eh. I had a thought, and then I lost it. I'm not. I'm not too worried about it. Faint attack. 
At least it's not faint or whatever that one attack is <laughs> called. The one that like doubles in power. I forget if it doubles in power if the enemy has a status condition or if you have a status condition. This guy is just not just getting the fucking ball. They drink my American coffee. It's not a coffee, it's Sprite. You're getting the fucking ball. <laughs> this is this is not a debate. You're getting the fucking ball. You're getting the fucking ball. Alright. Sick. Alright. Ursa Ring. With its ability to distinguish any aroma, it's unfailingly finds all food buried deep underground. Tight. That thing is... Actually, I'm taller. Facade. Or fa facade, yeah. That'd be crazy if Ursa Ring could learn that outside of TM. It'd be scary, yeah. Um, whatchamacallit. Uh, I am taller than that thing, but it weighs... Almost, well, let's see, yes. He's like 80 more pounds than I do. All right, switch to desktop. Let's see, words for guts. Guts. Um, let's see, Ursa. Ursa in itself means bear, right? In different languages. You know, if we go to the etymology or whatever it's called. Yeah, Ursa is Latin for bear. So if we can find... There's one I saw, Imsar. Imsar, so if we change that to, if we change that to, so Ursa, Imsar, Ursa, Imsa, Ursa, Erms, Er, Erm, 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 Ermsa, and done. <laughs> Ermsa. Oh, I didn't. I didn't look to see what abilities it had, because you said guts. Yep. And guts is it when you're burned? Its attack is increased by fifty percent. Does not lose attack due to burn. Yep. So yeah, that that could have been bad. Uh, hang on, just a second. Oh, jeez. All right. Yeah, we're not... I'm not too worried about Swashul because as much as Swashul is a viable mem... As much as Swashul is a vi viable member of the team, I do not plan on... Oh, God. We're going to have to deal with a lot of these guys, aren't we? All right, Surf. Let's see how well Surf works. Pretty well. You're pretty physically based, right? You're a tanky boy. You are a tanky boy. I don't know if I appreciate that. I don't have very many healing items. Oh. Oh. That gives rise to concern. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. All right. Uh. Da, da, da. Oh. 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 All right, uh, uh. I just really hope I don't run into one with Sturdy because, all right, what's gonna happen, I'm really not gonna be happy when this does, is one of those things is gonna have Sturdy. I'm gonna drop it to one hit point and it's gonna use self-destruct. And I'm not gonna be a happy camper when it does that because that could potentially kill any and all of my Pokemon. Right now. Yeah, th th yeah, it's not, it's not puzzle. Okay. Ian, I don't care. Yeah, I was, I was just looking at it like maybe this is like you know a trick question, or a trick that like I can only choose one path or the other, and it's like nah, no, nah, this is pretty, pretty straightforward. Just push it. It's, it's, uh, yeah, just, just. Oh, oh. Drop three deaths. 
yeah, just kind of push it, but all right. This is fine. Yep, this is fine. All right. All right. Uh, so really nothing. Really nothing. It's just this. I just realized something. I just I just realized something out of nowhere. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, never mind, never mind. So, um, earlier in the stream, earlier in the stream, as part of the Nuzlocke, I also had the fun goal of kill all the legendaries that I could find. And, um, Suicune jumps into Johto, or Kanto, or whatever, whatever Gen 1 region is called. I always get confused. But, um... Okay. So, I wanted to see if I could hunt down Suicune, and we Googled it, and it said can't go that way and it can't it's probably that rock but um nope 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 but um I was just thinking like wait a second with us kind of going into with us kind of going into this Johto region are we going to be able to hunt down and kill Suicune, and I don't think we are going to be able to. Because it said Vermilion City, so... We don't... I'm not I'm not planning on doing that. So... <gasps> it lived. Oh my goodness, it lived. What a bitch. Blip. See, I'm not, I'm not gonna worry. I'm not gonna worry too hard about that. Oop. There we go. All right, um, I want to keep Liddy Licked into, in the game, or in the game, rather. So let's just do that. We'll do that. We'll do this. We'll go this way because we know there's an item right there. This, this is fine. This is fine. I'm okay with this. All right, and discharge. Alright, and done. Dee. Hold on. Up. Were you just waiting in line with your buddy? Was that it? You're just waiting in line, you're like, yes, now's the time to freaking there you go. Just there you go. And done. <gasps> yeah. I feel like this is gonna become the powerhouse of the team. I can already feel it. Nice. We're not using revives, but nice. Oh, and now Molly, my sister's dog wants to leave the office. And, uh, oh, pff, I, oops. This will probably be fine. Stab, right? I'm 14 levels ahead. I'm pretty buff. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Not worried about it at all. <laughs> Jeez. Just. Ow. See, should I put experience share? Maybe. Maybe I'm not sure. Alright. Uh, oh. Down there. Got it. This is literally every few steps. On the upside, I'm happy that we found that we found the Earth Ring. Earth, like that's pretty cool. I don't think I've ever used an Earth Ring. I remember a friend of mine saying that he really liked them, but I don't know. There wasn't anything there that was like particularly on. Oh, good stuff. 
But um, there wasn't anything particularly awe-inspiring about Earthstring to me, so I was like, yeah, whatever. And surf. Yeah, because the champion has the high. If we saw on the one Reddit thing that the highest level guy that champion has level 50. It's not like we're not able to kill level 50, but I'd really prefer if we, you know, had the artillery. Victory Road. Alright. Uh, hip. Uh, hip. Uh, Dope. And down the hole we go. Ow. Uh. Yep. Yep, it's okay. It's okay, big guy. There you go. I think if in the cave Lee like gets level 47, then I'll start throwing around the experience share just to like catch everyone else up. I think is what I'll do. Yeah, because he he's getting there pretty quick. Oh, it's down there? Nope. Probably fell in my pocket. Wait. Oh, okay, I, I get it, I get it. Dude, Ry oh my goodness, Rhyhorn. Dude, Rhyhorns are awesome. Like, they're so good. And there you go. Could we could give him right Rhyperior in this game, theoretically. But no, they're just great in general. And down you go. Hey. Okay, so if I do this right. Yes. Yep, there you go. Alright, so I do this once. Damn it. Um. 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 Freaking. Uh, just, I'm gonna run out of pee pee. I'm going to run out of pee pee. And just so you know, no one has made any jokes that you're thinking of before. If any of us make a joke about me running out of pee pee, it's completely original. Alright. Uh, nice! It's really good. Alright. We can use that to cheese the Elite Four when we discover we're woefully underleveled. Oh, shit. Uh, yep, there we go. Alright, so... Not that hole! Yeah. yeah, not that hole. Not that hole. We don't, we don't want, we don't want anything to do with that one. Okay, uh, discharge. Zip, alright. I really wish they did have a computer that I could use to switch out my guys to, oh, so I could get the other, the other two here. Cause who are we missing? Looking at my cheat sheet on my computer. Uh, Noctowl and um, Garnid. We don't have Garnid with us. It's a real shame. Sake of my PP, I'm gonna use a different move on you and really hope it kills you in one shot. I don't think it will. <laughs> what was that noise? That noise of like. <laughs> and done. Um. Uh... Nope. 
I bet if I was grinding for um, Hooch McCallots, uh heart scales, that spot would be really dope. Just go in, smash them, and then come out, and come back in. Alright, uh, discharge. But are we really almost at the end? I thought I thought Victory Road had a lot of trainers in it. Well, or that, maybe I'm thinking of different games because I played Crystal though. Did Crystal have a lot of Aqua Ring? That's a healing over time move, right? Mmm, tempting, but I got some really good coverage. Tempting, yeah, but I got really good coverage right now. And I don't know if it'd be worth it, you know, to do that. I think it's really cool that it's an option, but, yeah. You know. Alright. Oh, yeah, that's right. I was going to put an experience share on someone else. Uh, doop, doop. I might want to actually grind, to just a little bit. Get everyone to, like, level 47, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, hold on. So let's go to big and go to XP share. Give. Um, give to Suda Snoot. Yes. And then we'll go to cancel. Not this one. Oh, this is definitely a low with trainers. This one, not so much. Huh. Okay. I mean, I'm not pose. I'm not. I'm not sitting here like mad or anything. It's just more like, oh, what? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. If I choose wrong, if I choose wrong, the whole world plummets into darkness. Uh, what do I do? I was gonna say, if that, if that doesn't instant kill you, I'd be shocked. What do I do? Oh, gal. Hey. Hey. Nice. Both answers were the right answer. Except this one, I got HP up. I thought they were gonna like, put me back to the beginning. I was gonna be like, kind of miffed. Just be like, you sons of bitches. <laughs> Why did you do this to me? But no, we're good. We're raw, we're good. Nice. Let's see, oh, and yep. There we go. All right, so, yeah, dope. All right, um, oh yeah, hold on. No? Oh. That's the exit. Oh shit. That was the exit. Well, maybe there's more Victory Road still to go, but. Alright, uh, just uh, slow welcome to the jam, son of a bitch. That's not too bad. Alright, uh, welcome to the jam. I really, I just realized this, I really, 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 really hope they let me fly, like, back to anywhere else. Or they have a shop. If they have a shop with a Pokemon Center and a computer, I would really appreciate that. Because I need to buy healing items for in between the fights because I don't think we have very many. Mm. There's a whole... Mm. Mm. Mm, that hole. I bet it has something really good. Bet it does. You'll be able to fly, but you also have access to a center shop at the end. Okay, good. Good. Thank you for telling me that. Oh god. If 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 that wasn't a thing, I would be sorely disappointed and sad. Alright. 
Yeah, we're getting. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's gonna be the end of the game, so we might we're gonna be popping all sorts of shit. Um. All right, so that's the exit. That's the exit, but that's a hole in the ground. On one side, if I go down this hole, I will inevitably get lost and probably have to redo a lot of fighting with wild Pokemon. I just had an idea. I just had a brilliant idea. The big smart. I got the big smart. All right, here's my theory. Here's my theory. If I leave through that exit and then come back in and then go down the hole, I'll be able to escape rope and then go back to where I entered from. I think that's how it works, right? Pretty sure that's how it works, right? It takes you back to wherever you entered from. Dang it. Napora, I know that thing has two different stats on you, but Napora, if you if you take one shot Okay, here we go. Here we go. This is where you actually start dying, Napora. Napora, just thank you. Thank you. Clean the floor with it. Son of a bitch. This thing has its own little strategy, its own little whatever. Naporo, I need you to slam. Just, just, just. There you go. Just. Bah. All right. All right. Okay. Now we just gotta bust through this. Yeah. That. That is my logic. That is my logic. Yep, I was gonna say we're got that's gonna be like three fights, pretty much guaranteed. Oh my goodness! It's a baby! I broke a baby out of its incubation chamber! Oh I feel a little bad for it. Just just a little bad. Just small amounts of bad. I don't feel bad. Not at all. There you go. And shkadi shkadoo. Alright, another one. Yep. Yep. Oh! This one is clearly the mom. Of the one I just killed. And I'm just gonna suck out your life force. Just gonna keep doing this. Because I can. All right, uh, perfect. But okay, so if we're about to be at the elite level, right? I'm pretty sure, okay. I keep saying pretty sure. I don't actually know. It's just that if this is Victory Road and that's the cave to the outside, it stands to reason that's the end, right? We need to stop and think about all the carbos, all the HP ups, all the PP ups, all the, all the different items and things. We need to ask ourselves, what can we give to our team? I remember when I had Steelix. That pillow swine killed it. I remember that. Good times. Oh, mic pop. You're so fat. You're so fast. You're just so fat. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Let's see. You... Oh, hey again, Red Wrist. Uh, n well, okay, so I played. Yeah, it's good to see you too. Um, I had a. I had a break last week, so that's why I was gone. But, um, well, I was on a trip with my family. But, um, I played Crystal, but I've never played Soul Silver. Nope. Uh, I never played Soul Silver or, um. Shit. 
Oh, God. All right. Ancient power. Yep, you're going to be faster than me, but that's fine. I could tank a hit. Oh, God. But yeah, I, I never played, um, I never played, uh, the original silver or gold, but I did play, uh, crystal. Or, right? I, I think that's what it was. Sounds right. I use ancient power in the desperate hopes of me getting that boost. That boosts all stats. But, um, yeah, and I, I started the series before I did Final Fantasy VII, but because, um, frankly, I didn't want to grind. Just be 100% honest, I was sick of grinding. Yeah, Crystal. Alright, cool. So I make sure. And, um... Oh. Should be able to be... Come on. But, yeah, I never actually fully played it. So I was like, let's do a Nuzlocke. And I got sick of grinding. And shh. That is what I wanted. Where you had the Battle Tower and could only catch Suicune, right? Yes. Yes, if I remember correctly. Wait, when you say battle tower, do you mean at the end? Because if it's at the end, I have no clue. But, um... Yes, generally speaking, that, that is the one. You could only catch Suicune. I remember playing that one a few times. I forget. Alright. Perfect. Now, here's my theory. I have a speed boost, a defense boost, an attack boost, and everything. I'm five levels bigger than you. I'm going to mega drain your ass, and I'm going to suck your soul out. I'm just... You are the big, scary one of the team, and I'm going to suck your soul out. Oh, my goodness. It lived. Oh, it lived. Oh, no. This is fine. This is fine. Yep, this is fine. I'm okay with this. I'm, I was waiting for him to do a full restore. Let's see. Dexter is in this one then. Oh! Yeah, so, so about, so about that. So about that, Red Rust. Uh, um, we're not doing them. <laughs> Straight up. Uh, we're, we're not, we're not doing them. Also, son of a bitch. I can't hurt you. So I'm just gonna stun, how? That I, I do know because, you know, if this is supposed to be similar to Crystal. Oh, no. I'm gonna take a risk. Um, I, if this is like Crystal, and tell me if I'm wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. In Crystal, you could go into the Gen 1 area and take on all the Gen 1 gym leaders and stuff, right? Which, objectively... Yeah, we're gonna fuck out. Um... Suda Snoot will do just fine. But, um... You could go to the Gen 1 area and fight all the Gen 1 gym leaders. And eventually you could take on Red and you could do all sorts of cool stuff. And objectively, that's really cool and really fun. Yeah, and then fight Red on Mount Silver. That's really cool and really fun. I'm totally down for that, right? I don't feel like doing it. Like, I... When I, when I looked up what the levels of the gym leaders were, just to make sure I wasn't, like, over-leveling... Uh, I think it's like 75 or something. It's some insane high level. And sure, I could do that for funsies. I think it would be a great time. Yeah, I'm, I'm not down for the grinding. I would like to move on to another game series. Which, we already finished Final Fantasy VII. We're about to finish Here's the Storm, so I wanted to tie up this loose end. Not to say that I don't like Pokemon, but you know, after a certain point, you just get sick of the grinding. quite the ground one or two is probably yeah it's like could I do it yes but you know how much it's gonna break my heart when I get a Pokemon to like level 60 or 70 and then it dies and I have to grind I have to train another Pokemon to level 60 or 70 it is going to crush my soul if that happens which is why I'm just like nope we're not going to we're no you gave it everything you had Shlapa. I wasn't even paying attention yeah, great. Good stuff. Uh, I have to do my, my Russian accent. Any games currently in the air for your next playthrough? Uh, pff, there is 
I do, there is a Pokemon series for Let's Go Eevee and um, Sword and Shield, but that's far future. Uh, I haven't fully nailed down any yet. Um, I remember I talked to you about it with uh, Final Fan at the end of Final Fantasy VII that I want to do the remake sometime, but I want to take a break. I haven't fully sat down and decided it yet. That's what um, this week was going to be for. I have a few ideas, but I'm not. You know what I mean? Basically, let's see. What were some of them? I was thinking about Horizon Zero Dawn, Red Dead Redemption, starring the Silent Hill franchise series. Um, there is one that a friend of mine challenged me to do, and I think it'll be pretty short. It's Skyrim. And I've ranted a lot about Skyrim in the past of, like, while I think it's a great game, I have a lot of issues with it. But um, just to do a small playthrough of Skyrim to see if it is my own biases due to overexposure or if I actually don't like the game. Parasite Eve, if you haven't played it before, especially with Halloween coming up. I'm really bad at doing things on time and for seasonally. But Parasite Eve, I can definitely look into that. But, um, actually, hold on. Because you guys aren't actually seeing my screen perfectly, I can just write sticky notes whenever I want and not have to worry about it. Parasite Eve. All right. Skyrim is fun, but it's pretty damn shallow. I, I won't rant. I'm going to hold off the rant. But um, I think for the time it came out and for all that it tried to do, it did a very good job. But I also think taking a step back and looking at it, there are so many issues with that game, and it's so repetitive, and it's so... Uh, it's just... See, it's a classic from the PS1 era. Noted! I'll write that down. I need to play um, Eternal Darkness Sandy's Rec Realm. That'd be a good, that'd be a good Halloween game, too. But, um... I had a thought, and then I lost it. Damn it. Oh, I completely lost my train of thought. Uh, it, that's it. That's it. That's it. Hyper Light Drifter. That was it. The reason Hyper Light Drifter got me so frustrated was because all I ever heard about it was praise and how it's a perfect game and how it's, you know, can do no wrong and it's lovely in every way and da da da. And I walked in with very high expectations and then I... And then I was like, wait a second, this is, like, sure, the art style is beautiful and the gameplay is good, but there's no story here. This sucks. And it got me really, I was really frustrated. That was the other thing. That was the other thing. So, like, um, so with Skyrim, the, the reason I bring up Hyperlight Drifter is because with Skyrim, all you ever hear about it is that it's the best thing ever and it's released for every console. And people always buy it and it's one of the best RPGs ever made. Yes, it did a lot of good things for what it was worth. It's not perfect. It's not I don't think deserving of its infinite praise. And yeah, I feel like a lot of people, I think the modding community is a beautiful thing. I love that people are willing to put their own time into making mods and like doing wonderful and great things with them. But I feel like, especially with Skyrim, so many people attribute it being such a great game because of mods, not because of the base game, but because of mods, the, any praise and stuff should go to the mods then and not the main game. But no, it's always the main game. So that's why I'm like, Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I am thinking about doing a Skyrim playthrough. If I did a Skyrim playthrough, it would only be going through, like, the main, some of the bigger main quests or whatever I felt like doing on the side. It would not be me doing 100% everything. I probably wouldn't do the Vampire DLC. I probably wouldn't, I probably wouldn't do the, um, yeah, I wouldn't do the Vampire DLC. I wouldn't do that one DLC where you go to the island where you have to repeatedly fight the one Cthulhu monsters just like over and over and over again because of the first dragon or whatever because that thing is whole bullshit. Um, yeah, I would, I would be very picky choosy. I probably wouldn't do the Assassins. I probably wouldn't do the Thieves Guild. I probably wouldn't do, you know, down the line, I won't do most things. I will stick to doing the basic things. If anything, just as a refresher to go, well, Max, do you still believe the way that you do? And I will do my best. To be objective, I will do my best to be like, all right, put aside the biases. Now that I'm playing it, let's have a fresh start. Let's have a fresh everything. But dolls to donuts, I won't. That's the next one. That is, in terms of like what ones I want to do next, that one's the closest. But I also expect that stream only to last. I, I expect that series only to last like two or three streams at most. Like it, actually, yeah, probably two to four 
streams. So that's why I don't really count it as a real series, if you will. Uh, there's a huge mod for T T or for the Elder Scrolls 3 Marwan called Tamriel Rebuilt. Huge project that's been going since 2008. I mean, the Marwan just surrounds the island with the game. Thankfully, there's so much more mods to done. That game is so crazy. I think it's how easy it is to mod that makes this game so appealing, perhaps. And that, like, I love that the modding community exists. I never played. I've only played Skyrim. I have Oblivion and Morrowind. I have. I've thought about doing those as a series, but I didn't want to. I didn't want to hundred percent them, and I felt like that would feel like I'd be like obligated to. But um, what do you want to call it? I like. I think the modding community is a great thing. I think it's really good that people are willing to put their time and soul into making these wonderful mods who, you know, play the game more. And if heaven forbid, if you have mods and have fun, you should have fun and have mods is proceed Ooh. cool but um it's not that i'm trying to hate on people well it's not that i'm trying to hate on people for having mods and stuff i think it's a really great and wonderful thing but i don't know that that aspect of it drives me nuts. anyway we should finish up with this <laughs> all right uh russian accent i start i start to talk like stuka from starcraft 2 yes very good the most generic russian accent I'm going to find out why I can't win and become stronger. I shall chan I'll beat you with all my power. That's what you get for fucking trying to kick my ass at the middle of Victory Road. Like a bitch. I like to imagine that Schlappa... There you go, Molly. I like to imagine that Schlappa heard me, like... Like, I just got on the phone and just started ranting about Skyrim. He's like, who, who, are you talk, who are you talking to? I don't understand. <laughs> I'm just like, shut up, just shut just shut, just shut, man. Okay, okay look, look. Um, where am I? Oh, shit. Oh, that's what it is. I guess you're trying to say that mods shouldn't be what makes the game. The devs should be relying on mods to make the game good. Yes. That is a good, succinct. Thank you for saying that. That is a good, succinct. Words. Oh shit! Oh god. Uh, uh. Let's see. Uh, let's switch in. Uh, Wook Den. There we go. I'm not good at words. Oh my goodness! Earthquake. Earthquake. But um. Oh hey, nice. Yeah, that that is basically the gist of it. That like, if you if anyone goes a, like X game is only good if you download Y Z A B C mods, right? I'm just gonna run from this battle. Like, if the game's only good because you have these mods, then that doesn't mean the game is good with the mods. It means the modders did a good job, and the game has inherent issues that need to be fixed. No game developer should ever be able, or should be allowed to. I, when I say allowed to, it, it starts to feel like I'm making like a political law about it, and I, that's not what I'm trying to say. It should not be accepted by the community that a, that anyone who makes a game is like, the modders will fix it. And they just don't care, because what the fuck? You should care. It's your game. Why? It feels lazy. It feels not well quality tested, you know? That's my issues with it. No, I'm burping. Okay, if you lose, you have to start all over. All right, let's see what we can buy. Uh, I am so I have so much money. So I'm just gonna buy just gonna buy shit ton of these. That being said, I love mods and stuff that um. I know because I had I was having this discussion with my friend who challenged me to play Skyrim. Uh, I got five of those. It's fine. I got five of those. That's fine. Um, I agree as well that that's a vibe I got from Bethesda after. Oh, Mars will just do the work, and I think that's one of the biggest things. Paul agrees. Yeah, definitely. But um, let's see. Yes, I had another thought, and then I lost it. Oh, I know because I had this discussion with my friend Ethan, which is why I'm like, okay, let's do a Skyrim playthrough. Um, that he was, he was trying to get me on that 
I must also disapprove of mods that allow people to like play games on different systems or to play older games that can't handle like Windows 10 or whatever, to, but to, like, to be able to play it on that. And I love those mods. Any mod that lets people from all ages and times or whatever enjoy games that they wouldn't normally be able to, that's awesome. I love that because, you know, more people get to enjoy it. And, you know, if they add little things like, hey, this is just to make it so you can use a controller, which I think you're talking about with um, Seventh Heaven for Final Fantasy VII. I think Seventh Heaven was the one you were talking about that did that. But, um, like, that stuff is great. Yeah, DOSBox. DOSBox is great. It's perfect for that kind of thing. Like, um, the other thing, this, is, this isn't this is quite mods, but it's kind of along the same vein. Emulators. So just so you guys know, I am playing this on a 3DS, which is green here, so it kind of see-through is a little weird. I oh shit. Um, I'm little more. Had one. I maybe they're working on it. But I don't know. But um, I am playing this on a legit system. But there are so many games that are like you know from the NES and Sega Genesis and even Nintendo 64 that most people are not going to be able to have access to without either paying an exorbitant amount of money, a la the Mario 35th whatever anniversary thing, or, you know, like, nickel and diming you with you pay five bucks for every NES game, which maybe it's worth it, but that adds up really quick. I understand why companies do that, but also anything to let people play older games is amazing. It's why I love backwards compatibility so much, which I really wish people... What is this place I just walked into? Um, no, uh, no, no, I no longer want to be here. I uh, no, 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 mm -mm. no, I have no friends. No, I ate them. Would you like to know more? Uh, no, understood. Yeah, okay, bye. Bye. Super Mario RPG is going for 154 cards on eBay. Yeah, it's things like that. Or like, there are these games that are genuinely good and really interesting and da, 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 da. But you don't have access to them anymore. And as a result, it's like, well, either you have to pay out the, you know, you have to pay, what's the phrase? Out the nose, out the ear, you have to, yeah. Uh? They fly home. Oh, yeah, that's right, okay. Um, just, what was I trying to think of? Um... Yeah, they have to pay a lot of money to play these games that have already been made and just really good, which is why as much as some people will look at emulators and say, Max, that's illegal, I'm kind of in support of them. Because after a certain point, if a company is no longer releasing a game, then they're not going to make money either way. So who cares? You know? If someone cares enough to have the original, they can buy out the nose for the original. But if people just want to play the game because they love the game... Let them, you know, like, all right, there, there's my second political opinion for the day. All right, so, 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 this is our main team. Mm. Mm. <sighs> you know how I said I hate grinding? You know how I said I really hated grinding? We're going to have to grind for a little bit. Hello, Astro. It's good to see you. And I don't know. I don't know if that's about educating. As of general practice, it's just me. It is an opinion I have with emulators, which is why I have an emulator that I have no qualms with using and showing anything like that. I also have no qualms with. Um... Hang on, just a second. I have no qualms with showing a certain kind of website called DownloadRoms.io that has a bunch of amazing ROMs for tons of people. I have no qualms with sharing that information. <laughs> I say as someone with an original Game Boy. Like, those things are expensive. Right, okay, hold on. Um, hold on. Okay, okay. So me and my endlessly getting distracted, we need to look at our current team and we need to ask ourselves... Is there any move anyone else should have instead of what they currently have that will help them in the current situation? Sorry, we 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 just were on this huge tangent that went from why Sky why I have uh, why I have issues with Skyrim to modding to emulating. 
we have an elite four to beat down. And unfortunately, I think we may need a grind. So we need to look through all the moves we have and all the things and ask ourselves, is there a move that we should give to someone to help cover... Oh, okay, okay, okay. So we gotta we gotta think strategics for a second. Um, fire blast. I'd rather keep flamethrower. Thief. Thief is a good. Thief is a good dark type move. Thief is a good dark type move. Whoa. To be honest, with the three major consoles being as big as they are, how hard would it be for them to have a small manufacturing department dedicated to printing old games? It would be extremely profitable, but the anti-emulation point they would make would be more useful had they met the price. Of the they guess. If you have to try to acquire with with exuberant methods that probably don't have uh, make them much money away. Right, but I digress. Now that, that that probably is what it comes down to. That like, at the end of the day, how much money? Because okay, video games as an art, video games as like a joy that we can share with others and all sorts of good stuff. That's wonderful. That's great. I'm all for that. People have to eat. The end of the day, people have to eat. So it's why I don't have a job with Twitch yet because people have to eat. But um, that that's that's a terrible joke. Um, so I get it. They have to make a business. That's fine. But like, if they had a small team just working on like, hey, it's our goal to make every old style game available for as cheap as possible. That'd be amazing. That would create so much love for the community. And da -da 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 -da. Even though I have the physical card for Soul Silver, it's not possible to stream it even with custom firmware, which I have, unless I spend hundreds on physically modeling console capture card. And like, I could literally put a webcam point at my deals. It's funny that you say that. Back in the day on my YouTube channel, don't look it up. That is exactly what I did. I got it so that I can't. Oh, my dog up. Or is this dog? I got it so that a camera was pointing down the 3DS, and it was the shittiest quality. It was so unbelievably bad. And then when I was um when I was in the Japan when I was in Japan because I was in the Navy. Okay, you said spend hundreds on a physical modded console, the capture card in it. I think it cost me. 150 bucks it was it was some over 100 maybe 200 dollars and it was really expensive but i was like you know what this will be worth it i think this will be a good investment because then i'll be able to use this forever i think now it's like 200 300 it's expensive as shit i'm not gonna oh whew. i do not encourage well okay it's not that i don't encourage it it's that i warn against it you know what i mean that's just like whew, be be really sure you want to do this because, oof. <laughs> um, Shadow Claw? Okay. Shadow Claw. Uh, 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 pluck? I can't fault people for Emily if that's what's in their budget. Oh, definitely. And it's just easier. Like, okay, so, some of my friends, like, um,. Well, he's just barking again. Um, a lot of the friends that I play with in my free time, they are all about consoles. Just in general. Like, just in general. They like, they like their PS4. They play on their PS4 most of the time. You know, sometimes it's like pulling teeth when I want to play something on PC with them. And they're like, Max, why are you so much about PC more than consoles? Just not that they're like trying to get me into a cult, but they're just like, why are you PC Master Race so much? Because it's easy. <laughs> It's easy to record, it's easy to stream, it's easy to play, it's da, da, da. just ease of use. Which I get it, consoles are really easy to use too, but sometimes you just have to go through some nonsense. Um, okay, so I don't know if you guys were following along with me when I was doing, I was looking through all the different Pokemon and all the different things we have. Okay, uh, let's just stop and think about this. Think about our move sets. think about our movesets we have with everyone. Earthquake, who can we hand Earthquake to? Typhlosion, he already has a fire and solar beam up there, or he has uh, strength, which his strength is just good overall, good stuff, and then that if we have that, okay. Um, Ferret, we could get, we can replace a Sucker Punch with Shadow Claw, uh, he'd have Headbutt, Rock Smash, and Quick Attack, we could probably remove Quick Attack with Earthquake, we probably could do that. Um, no one really needs Fire Blasts. Iron Tail. I could put Iron Tail on him as well. 
but because this is Gen 4, iron isn't really good against anything except for rock and ice, which really we just have fighting type moves for, so we can keep rock smash on there. We don't want to put focus blast on him or focus punch because focus punch would be interrupted and focus blast is special, which is physical focus. Uh, so we don't really need iron tail there. We can stick with quick attack, just get that for a kill. Um, yeah, sounds good. Not to break from our current topic. You know. Um, yeah. I feel good. I feel good about that. Okay, yeah, so we'll go to Wukden. Yeah, yes. We're going to replace Sucker Punch with it because, not going to lie, I don't like Sucker Punch as a move. I will, I will give up that 10 power, you know... I'll give that 10 power and that priority in favor of making sure when I blast a move, it works. Kind of a deal. Um... Okay, who gets Earthquake? Because Earthquake is too good of a move not to give to someone. Um... Napora. If I give it to Napora, I'd be giving up... What would I be giving up? To... What, would I... what would I be giving up if I gave it to Napora? Uh, Gurnid's already loaded out. Sudi Snoot's already loaded out, so it is Napora. If I give up... Stun Spore is really useful, especially if we're going up against big boys. I'm thinking if I give up Slam. If I give up Slam. Right. Okay. Um... Yeah, now it's just a matter of just throwing the items on people. Anyway, sorry. I, di I didn't mean to kind of leave the one conversation. I, I'll admit, I just personally didn't know what more to say. Um, Give it to Wookton. Oh, it won't have any effect. Oh, jeez. But, um... Jeez. Everyone's too buff. I, I wasn't trying to get away from that so much as... I wanted to make sure I keep my like my train of thought because I'm beginning to think, huh? Proteins add EVs, right? So if none of them will have any effect, that means straight up everyone is as full level as I can get. Okay, so I have okay. So here's the deal: I have five rare candies. I have five rare candies. If I immediately give them to everyone I have, trying to even us out, it'll take four just for Gisop. At a certain point, the illegal option becomes easier. I have so many game cards, it's like two totes full of game cases. I can't possibly carry all those games. So I bought 200 gigabyte micro SD card, ripped all my cards, put them in the SD card. I carry them that way for my 3DS DS games. I completely understand that. Um, who do you call it? Once again, while I was in the Navy, um, you know, you're expected to pack light kind of a thing, right? In case you need to be deployed or whatever. So I couldn't, I could never dream of carrying all my games and stuff with me. It's just too much weight. So yeah, just the ability to be like, here it is. <laughs> you know, send all your, send all those valuable things home somewhere safe so that, you know, there's no worry about them in case something happens. But um, yeah, just being able to go like, so much easier. All right. All right. I know. I know. I said we were going to be done today, and I hate grinding, and I want everyone to know I do. We're going to try to grind a little bit. We're going to try to make this as quick and painless as possible. Once we actually hold on. Once we get to a point where where our five Hujima call it's okay. Once we get to a point where our five Hujima call it's is enough to get us through kind of a thing, then we'll um, then we'll attack the Elite Four. But for right now, we just got to grind a little bit. Um, if I had to look at the levels... Oh, shit. That's a problem. That's a problem. Oh, this is a, this is a bad risk. This is a bad risk. Why am I doing this? Oh, this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Uh, I don't want... Guys, I'm going to be honest. I don't want to. 
I just really don't want to. It, it, it stinks because I know for a fact the highest one's going to be level 50. None of the guys are level 50. Granted, we're humans. We're smart. We can work through this. But man, I don't want to. Oh, God. What do you normally play on stream? Typically Pokemon Nintendo stuff or PC games? I play everything. Kind of a deal. Um, Let's see. If I just had to rattle off series that I've done recently. um, I just realized I may have never changed the thing in the description. My Twitch thing. I forgot to do that. Um, The last games I played were Heroes of the Storm. We're finishing up that series. You can grin off. You can grind off Tauros and Miltank. Will it be faster? Will it will it be really really fast? Because I'm impatient as fuck. Will it be really fast? Because if so, I will take you up on that. There's a spot near the safari zone. So it's near the safari zone. But um, battle frontier. You could take for safari zone. Safari zone. Route 48, 47, 48, 48. Wait, let me just, yeah, I'll, I'll give you time on that. But, um, just to list off some of the games I've done, like, rec recently or in the past, uh, Xenophobic. What? What? Autocorrect, what the fuck? <laughs> it was like, um, what? <laughs> Question mark? <laughs> but, um, for Astral Descent, a uh, series that I've done in the past was we just we're finishing up Heroes of the Storm right now. Noted. Too small. If it is, that's if it is. I really appreciate you telling me that, because I was under the impression you could click it and zoom it in. So, you telling me that is a great thing. I can work on making it bigger. We're all, we're all about we're all about learning and improving here, but um, yeah, I can totally fix that. Thank you for telling me that. It'll take me maybe a few minutes. I'll do it off stream. Um, Final Fantasy VII, Heroes of the Storm. Not too long ago, we were playing uh, Last of Us Two. We played Doom. We played um, yeah, it's small on my main screen. That's I can work on that. I am not above admitting that things are broken. Um. What else? StarCraft 2. We were on StarCraft 2 for a long while. I did uh, Metroid Prime as a franchise series, which is basically where I want to play games just like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, one right after the other. Even through the good or the bad, just to see how it grows. We started that one, but we didn't finish it. Uh, I was thinking about doing Silent Hills, a franchise series, because I loaned out my Wii U to my girlfriend. Um, Ghost of Tsushima. We were on Ghost of Tsushima for a hot minute. Generally speaking, I like Dark Souls games. I like difficult games, but I'll play just about anything. You know, it's just kind of whatever takes my fancy. I'm still wondering what you meant, Red Wrist, when you said xenophobic. <laughs> oh. Thank you so much for following. I really appreciate it. I just want you to know that. <laughs> I hope me making weird noises and being an idiot is entertaining. But, um... Yeah, generally speaking, I, I just try to play anything, whatever takes my fancy. I'm not very good at playing whatever is popular. You know what I mean? Like, un oh, I just realized my mouse is on screen. Um, unless it's something I'm, like, super interested in right off the bat, which was, like, Doom and Ghost of Tsushima and Last of Us 2, because I did, like, Last of Us 1. Uh, generally speaking, so generally speaking, I don't really follow trends, which is why you will not catch me playing things like um, Among Us or Baldur's Gate 3 or um, Fall Guys. I'm just, I'm not really into those kinds of games. I really value single player experiences and a big goal of this channel is to share that single player experience with others. And kind of like what we were just talking about then, just having discussions and just talking about like, we like this aspect, we don't like this aspect. I think this is cool. I think they can improve on this. Bop, 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 bop. Ta -da. <laughs> I have this long ass list on my computer that I could show of games that I was thinking, yeah, fuck it, I'll show it. Can I zoom it in? I cannot zoom it in. All right, it may be a little small. Hold on. Hold on. There. 
That might not be perfect for you guys seeing it. Uh, 20. There we go. These are the kinds of games that I'm considering, whether as like a franchise series or just things in general. They're on my list. I don't mind showing my hand and showing like these are the kinds of things I think about. Just as a general note, just because they're on this list does not mean I'm confirmed to do them. It's just these are the kind of games that I think about playing. Um, yeah. yeah. That was the goal of this week was to, while doing college and other stuff, to just sit down and be like, what do I want to play? Oh, Tales of Thief. Thief's on there twice. kind of leaning towards these but we just played Ghost of Tsushima and Final Fantasy 7 which is nice big open world so you know it's kind of mm, kind of like mm, mm. was thinking about doing Dragon Age Inquisition and stuff like that Soulsies yes Dark Souls I am I really like Dark Souls games so um when it says revisit Soulsies so I have played one two three uh basically all of them Tales of the Abyss is interesting dated compared to the popular ones though I've just I've heard good things about that series in general. I've I've never played any of them, so I'd be like, yeah, let's let's fucking go, let's have some fun. Prize Zero Dawn interests me a lot. I played it for a little bit and I loved it, but then I never picked it up again. Um, but yeah, there's there's just well, okay, I played all the Soulsy games except for Demon Souls, which I played for I think I got like a third of the way through it or halfway through it on my own, and then I just never picked it up again. The original on the PS3. And then um, the King's Field or whatever it's called, the games before the Souls games. But otherwise, I played them all, loved them. So I was thinking sometime maybe play them again. But I don't like playing games that I've already played. I, I want to I wanna play new things. I want to share new things. Uh, I made that mistake on my YouTube that, like, I played games. I played a bunch of games that I already played. And I was just like, no, no, I want to I wanna do something fun. I want to, you know, do something exciting. I should add to Battlefront. Battlefront 2, I mean the new one on the PS4. Because we played the one on the PS2, loved it to bits, even though it was incredibly difficult. So we'd be going back to the new one. Also, I'm going to be honest. Ex hashtag exposed for having left the line taskbar. But I like, I like having him. I like having him. I don't see a problem in the world having this. I don't know what you're talking about. I think it's nice. But, um... I'm gonna be honest, Freak Show. Or is that how you pronounce? I, 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 I is that Freak, 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 Free, Fritook Show? I'm gonna be honest. I, I kind of, I'm kind of stalling a little bit, just as, just if you found the experience rates with the, with the Hujima calls it, because as I said, I really don't want to, I really don't want to grind. Do I think we can do it? Yes, but there's gonna be casualties. <laughs> oh God, there's gonna be casualties. I could have an ex- okay. Mine's the same to be honest, I have two displays, my set makes it easier to keep over there. Yeah, exactly. But, um, here's what I'm thinking. We have five, we have five rare candies, right? We get as many- Route 47, using Surf and Waterfall to get to a small patch of graphics that has Mill Tank and Ditto. The Mill Tank gives it a thousand XP, while the Ditto gives more when it transforms. Route 47. Route 47. Ratchet and Clank's like who reject the X for all great series. Yeah, I've I've heard only good things about those games. And but I I have them. I have like little PS3 collections, but I've never sat down and fully played them. So that's why that's on that list as a franchise series. I think it would just be a good time. It I mean it was how I um if I could think. Thank you so much for telling me that freak show. I just want you to know I really appreciate it. But um it's how I got introduced to the Witcher series. Like, um, yeah, I think with the Witcher series is one of the last ones. Thank you so much for telling me this. I really appreciate it. You are doing a great service to the cause. I can say words. Route 47. That's Route 48. That's Route 47. Now you said we need a waterfall. So we need a surf and waterfall. We got a lot of people with surf already, so I'm fine with that. It's more sort of waterfall. We'll have to have one slot be dedicated to... we we'll to have one slot dedicated to the Gyarados that has it, because we're trying to avoid 
as many TMs as possible, or as many HMs as possible on our people. So that should be fine. We're gonna, as quickly as possible, um, shit. Did I lose someone? Who did I lose? Lantern! There, got it. Let's see, um, see who, see. We were saying words. Words are the best. We were saying words. Um. Oh, it was how is it was how I got introduced to the um, the Witcher series, the like just the Witcher series in general because I never played them and I was like let's do the franchise, and the first one I was like I'm gonna be honest I don't really like this, but it has a good story. Second one I loved it and then third was just a masterpiece. So, with the Ratchet and Clank series, right? We would play one, two, three. That'd be the goal, and then I assume that's the waterfall. Assume that's the waterfall. Ah, oh, this is quite a trek. Gross. They go down. But, um... Yeah, so we would play 1, 2, 3, and then we would play the remake. Even if the remake isn't good, it would still be part of the goal of the remake series. Um, I was talking about... Actually, no, I, I, I was talking with this to you, right, Redress? That, um... With Silent Hill, right? That'd be like one, two, three, four, downpour. Well, you told me about four. I wasn't aware that four existed. But, um, oh, yep, yep, here it is. I wasn't aware that four existed until you said it. But it would be the same idea of like, hey, even if, you know, the IP changed hands, even if. Whatchamacallit? Even if the IP changed hands, even if it's like, oh, you know, it's not as good as the others, there's homecoming too. See, there you go. You said you'll get more experience when it transformed, but I also don't want to let it transform because what if it turns into me and then uses hyper beam? That's what I'm afraid of. Well, shit, I didn't think that would kill it. I didn't think that would kill it. Oh, well, we're here for the mill tanks anyway. But, um. Yeah, we, we would focus on the mainline games just to. Play them and see how they are because sure maybe they suck maybe they're horrible or maybe they're wonderful and maybe they're gems or if nothing else okay so air slash kills you immediately so don't know if i should like use that turn to yeah there you go there you go that's what i wanted all right so now go to air slash so, last time you gave about 300 experience, so this time you should give about... Really? That's intriguing. Alright, but, um... If nothing else, we can either make our own fun, or it'll be... Essentially, discussion points. To be like, hey, what do we think could have made this game better? And just stopping, taking a step back, and asking ourselves that question. Because I think that's a good question to ask about any media. Any, just anything in general. And in asking that question, many times people, you know, sometimes we stumble. Sometimes we say, I bet people will enjoy this, and we're wrong. And that's okay. And if anything, it should be encouraged. Because, you know, that's growth. It's... Yep, that's fine. Your stats don't change, so I can still do this. I'm gonna be honest. My, I'm I'm just gonna grind until I can get within. Oh shit! I'm gonna grind until I can get within five. Ah. Oh. Yeah. The goal is to grind until we can get five within five levels of just using rare candy for everyone. That is the goal. Straight up, that is the goal. Transform doesn't change abilities too, does it? Hope it doesn't. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Actually, wait, hold on. Do we really need to get to 50, level 50? We're going to get a lot of experience just by fighting the Elite Four normally. 48? 48? 
probably. I got a good feeling about 48. 48 sounds like a good number. Hyper Beam. I'm going to be very impressed if this doesn't kill you in one shot. Wow. I mean, I knew you were a poor man's blissy, but... Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh, hmm, 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 hmm. Noted. Noted, I cannot kill you in one shot. Hmm. Yeah, straight up, we're just gonna... I should look, okay, so, jeez. God, I wish I knew about this earlier. All right, okay, so if our goal is to get to level 48, uh, Lantern is at like 47, right? So that's one, three, three, so that's seven, 11, 13, 17, fuck. That's a lot, that's a lot. I want to get everyone to be a higher level, but I really don't want to grind. I, I want to be done with this series. I just want to be done. Not because I don't like Pokemon, but because I'm ready to move on. Ah, uh, God, it's a lot of levels. We save one. We save one. One whatever special candy for Lantern to get level 48. We could okay if I if I was a big old fat cheater, if I was a big old fat cheater, what we could do is we could look up what specialties each of the gym each of the elite four have, and then build to accommodate. But that would be something a big old cheater would do. You know what I mean? That that wouldn't that wouldn't sit right with me. Oh, I'm hyper beaming you. I am I am hyper beaming your ass. There you go. Have fun. Yeah. Okay. Could we? Because we're gonna get a lot of experience just by being in there. We could also theoretically just give someone an experience share. And then have them in the back. Just have them in the back and just get all the experience from everyone else. If if we're not perfectly level as a team, I think it'll be fine. Yeah, I think just doing this one run of getting experience should be good. Okay, guess up. Not killing everything in one shot. is a little, um, a little concerning, not gonna lie. It's a little, it's a little worrying. Should be able to take everything on in one shot. Okay, I'm gonna stop. I'm, I'm, okay, I'm pulling him out. I'm pulling him out. Because he's pretty banged up and I don't want to use any whatevers. All right, Garenid's up next. I'm gonna give you the shell belt. Yeah, this is my theory. And hopefully... Hopefully, 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 we'll be able to divine what type they are as we walk into the room in terms of uh, the Elite Four. You know, hopefully, to use a... Burp. Oh, shit. You're faster than me. To use um, Gen 1 as an example, hopefully... Oh, fuck. Hopefully, the Ice-type Gen lady has, you know... Hopefully the ice type the ice type elite four has a room full of ice, you know, so that we can be like, huh, ice. Maybe I should use a fire type here. Or maybe just at minimum I shouldn't use anyone that's weak to ice. This is so weird that you're faster than me. You shouldn't be faster than me. That's not right. That is not right at all. This 
This is somewhat worrying. Anyway, I guess I should also ask is how everyone's doing at home because we're stuck here, so this is discussion time. This is discussion and bullshitting time. So, wonder how everyone's doing at home. Yeah, just in life, in general. Nope. I don't know. Captivate? Really? You have Captivate? The worst status effect in this entire game series? Captivate? Okay, okay. Fuck it. When I get Gurney to level five, or 45, he's good. He's good to go as far as I'm concerned. Looks like a BDSM cow. Okay, now hang on. No, 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 you need to... I feel like you need to unpack that a little bit. Uh, uh, no, hang on. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. No, 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 I'm not letting you walk away with that. A BDSM cow. How? How? God, I get, God, I really hope another a, another mill tank pops up because I I would I would like to. I think we all need to take a good long hard look and shut and no one cares. And back off. We we all I think we all need to just take a look see and just be like, huh. Okay, last time I used headbutt and it did not do very much to you. So let's just too many furry comics. <laughs> if you're into that, God bless you. I hope it makes you happy. But like, no, not, now I'm actually now I'm actually trying to think about this. No, hang on. And for the record, this isn't me trying to like everyone point and laugh. That is not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to go like, okay, you have come to this conclusion. I would love to know how. I don't know why you think said maybe the black hood. I'll take that. I, I will take that as a reason. Let's try headbutt again. Maybe that one ditto we fought was super weird. We're gonna, we're gonna find a mill tank and we're gonna dissect this. <laughs> Damn it. We're gonna, we're, we're gonna figure this out one way or another. <laughs> I am also kind of getting beat up by these guys here, and I, I'm not a big fan of it. And also, why the fuck is why is the fuck is that ditto faster than me? I know I'm a slow bro, it's in the name, but also, why the fuck is that ditto faster than me? Ooh. Also. To your to your boyfriend's credit, I don't know anything about BDSM. <laughs> oh, I now that we're talking about it, it's like no, we're not we're not gonna. I'm not gonna send you any mill tanks. I'm not gonna feed in your kink. And I'm like no, we're gonna dissect this. We are going to learn about this. Damn it. This is an open space. This is a safe space. I guess. I I guess. Just, just fracking it's hiding like now it's hiding because now we think now it thinks we're king shaming it no mill tanks left they all went away they all just went away <laughs> why can a skinny make an egg with a whale or pokemon makes no damn yeah, yeah, because they're mammals therefore <laughs> they're mammals so therefore you shouldn't expect a skitty to be able to fuck a whale also shit this guy this guy is buff why is this guy buff well okay no ditto 
ditto we can work with. A ditto, you know, changes its structure to become whatever, right? So I feel like a ditto we can take a step back and be like, all right, you turn into whatever it is and you're able to like, you know, fully grow to its size. And then, okay, here's another, here's another question for you. That's a lot of stretching though. It's, it's, it's a molecular blessing from God. <laughs> But okay, so here's the next question I have. This is gonna get a little, I'm gonna get into detail a little bit here. Okay, so as we all know, birds and the bees, semen goes in the egg, makes the egg, right? The mom has the baby and the baby's all good and stuff and lays an egg, right? See, why can they make an egg? Because they're mammals, mammals don't lay eggs, bro. No, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's, yeah, but everything in this world lays eggs, so I'm kind of ignoring that part. It's whale. I'm making shit up. But, okay, so, you know, birds and the bees, semen goes to the egg, egg, bloop, makes an egg, right? All good there, all good there. So, you can breed a ditto with a female, right? With a female of the species. So, theoretically, does that mean he's copying... He's turning into whatever he sees, but changing the gender, so that way you're essentially having your own cells fertilize themselves, and thus would cause inbreeding, or what would happen there? <laughs> All right, the first generation to talk about Pokemon living together with humans in a book summer, which makes me wonder about Mr. Mime. Oh god, I don't want to think about that. You get that cursed shit out of here. I right, no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You're not making me think about that. Are we high enough level? Let's be honest. 46, 46, 46. So we'll get, we can get one guy to 47. I bet if we just dance around the experience here, that'd be. Fuck it. We're high enough level. Fuck it. I have hereby decided that we are that we are high enough level. We can take on the Elite Four. Ditto inbreed. But no, we're like, oh, really? Like, okay. I. I ask about this question because in D&D there's a creature called a changeling and a changeling can change its gender, right? So does that mean if, okay, if there's me, I'm a human male, right? If a changeling turns into me and then turns into the female version, is that why I'm gonna say ditto's what happened when a man mixes genes one too many times? <laughs> like, okay, if a changeling turns into me and then and then, you know, we have, we do the deed. What, what's going to happen to the baby? Will the baby be a changeling or will it be this? And to a much greater and more concerning, actually, wait, can that guy heal me? What does that guy do here exactly? Yeah, whatever. Fuck that guy. But, um, it, like, that question is, I think, exponential when you bring in a ditto. Because a ditto turns into whatever it sees. But you're able to breed. Rock climb? What? Will. If I breed a Pokemon, let's just say an Eevee, right? Just for sake of example. With a, okay, so with a male Eevee and a Ditto, right? Makes sense. So, like, you know, the sperm goes into the Eevee. It's able to make an egg. It lays the egg. But does that mean because it copied itself into an Eevee that's essentially like having sex with yourself and then inbreeding? Or, like, I get it in terms of a game mechanic. In terms of game mechanics, it's fun. It's simple. It's a way just to get a bunch of different eggs. You can shiny hunt and do things so it's repetitive so you don't have to worry about freaking um, breeding moves and, like, Eevees and Eevees. I get it from a mechanical perspective. But from a lore but from a lore perspective, I have so many more questions. Questions that no one wants the answer to, but I'm arbitrarily deciding that I do want the answer to. The, the, this, is, this is what keeps me up at night. That's not true. I keep myself up at night because I barely sleep. I think the base DNA that did it, if you want to get on the level, is probably fundamentally different. Okay, cool. So, let, let's go with that logic, right? Like, um, like, like my example I had with the change thing, right? Which is why the negative effects of even due to how genes would work doesn't affect things? Has Professor Oak. 
<laughs> Busts into his office. How to dare us fuck? I want to know. And not for pervy reasons, for science. Yeah, Temtem tried to limit breeding based on a familiar relationship agent. The amount of times they bred, to be honest, it makes it so much more of a pain. Temtem? -tem? What's, what, what's Temtem? Temtem. -tem. Temtem -tem on Steam. Oh, I heard about this. I heard about this game. It's like someone was essentially making Pokemon, right? Cool. But it, it makes it, right, like from a mechanics step point, a standpoint, we can look at it and we could be like, this is made simpler and life is good because da da da, right? It's why, you know, a Cuborn when it's born, has its mom's skull. It's why Kangaskhan has a baby right from the beginning. It's why Blissey has an egg right from the beginning. It's simple. It keeps it as simple as possible, right? But to go back to the changeling thing and the Ditto thing, right? So Ditto's DNA is fundamentally different, even if it copies exactly what it is. So, you know, theoretically, if we take an Eevee and we take a Ditto turn into an Eevee, we take both their DNA and we put them in the machine, we'll be able to go like, oh, this is clearly an Eevee and this is clearly a Ditto turned into this Eevee. Ah, yes, we can see, right? So what happens to the kid? Does the kid forever have ditto genes in it? Or does the ditto genes perfectly turn into the kid, making a perfect clone? With the example of me and the changeling, right? If a changeling is, it turns into me but a female and I have sex with it and it has a baby, will it have me genes on both sides? Will it have the changeling genes on it? And if the changeling genes just decides to stay as me? There's a lot of questions. <laughs> Just in general, there's so many questions. <laughs> I've heard good things about Temtem, though. Just kind of in general. I know, I, di I didn't really look too hard into it. It just, I saw it, and I was like, oh, that's neat. I think I wishlisted it on Steam. But, okay, okay. So, 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 so. Okay, so. Here's my plan. Here's my plan, because I'm already sick of grinding. Because <laughs> I'm already sick of grinding. Here's my plan. Here's my plan, okay? We have five... We have five... Rare candies. How much experience does Gisop have? Halfway through, so we don't want to waste it. I could go one, two, three, one, two. Get everyone to 46 and seven. You have to consider you have a higher state of awareness compared to Pokemon, so genetics could affect your composition in more ways. Oh. Let's go biblical for a second. So you know like, so you know like in the Bible, if you don't believe in the Bible, you know, it's fair, like it's fair, but like in the Bible, how like the inbreeding used to be a thing that was just necessary to make like the population go, but eventually God is like, stop that shit. And then like inbreeding starts to mess with us. What if just due to like, okay, let's bring let's bring a weird example in, right? Uh, whatever creatures produce asexually, right? But they do not need a mate, right? They produce asexually, right? There's no such thing as inbreeding with a creature that produces asexually. So what if we just apply that to a creature that does produce sexually? That like DNA is still combined, but just whatever would make inbreeding happen doesn't happen. It's just. You know what I mean? Like, what if it was just not a factor? We thinking up in here. <laughs> this is such a dumb. This is such a silly and ridiculous line of questioning, but I love it. I can just imagine someone like. All I'm imagining is someone like in a trench coat. Baton pass? Uh, now nah, we don't. Now we, we we don't have a good enough. We don't have a strategy to use baton pass with. But um, I'm just imagining someone. Well, actually, okay, I have, I have two different pictures in my head. The first picture. Roll out. Uh, nah, let's not. Let's not. Let's not do roll out. The first is someone like, like a scientist at a computer desk with like different eggs in different jars and like a ditto being scanned. He's just sweating furiously like. How, how does it work? What, like he's just, he's like foaming at the mouth trying to figure out how something works. Let's see, uh, no, yes. And then I have 
then I just had the mental picture of like, you know, Game Freak or whoever is having like a, oh, you want to ask questions of the developers? And once again, someone is just like, just standing there sweating, like absolutely like a hundred percent in just being like, how does this work? And the game developers just being like, fucking leave me alone. Jeez. Those are the two mental images that just went into my head. Okay, let's see. While other factors affect your DNA that are out of your control, like causal radiation, cell mutation from, vir from virial infection, and other things like, like that you know mosquitoes permanently imbibe a portion of the genetic energy by when they. Really? I mean, I'm guessing it's on such a small level, it doesn't affect anything, but. Really? That's kind of. That's kind of freaky. Honestly, like, I'm not entirely sure how I feel about that. <laughs> Who should get more health? Suda Snoop. It won't have any effect. Damn it. Um. <sighs> That's really cool, though. Today we learn. We, ha we have learned something today. <laughs> if you have learned nothing else from my inane stupidity, we have learned. Thanks to Redwiss. Mosquitoes imbibe DNA. I wonder if that means, like, how much... Assuming a human had an infinite source of blood and were not accounting for morality or pain, how many times would a mosquito have to bite a human before the human body started to have major effects? Like, to start growing fundamentally differently. Yeah, there's many things that are controlled just by your identical twins. Stuff being so identical depends on the environment. Based on the time. And also just by virtue of, like, different people experience different things. On a genetic level. Yeah, I gotcha. Anyways, we're gonna go to the lead four. We're gonna die. So, here's how we're gonna do this. Here's how we're gonna do this. I'm gonna give everyone whatever items I normally would, right? And then, right before the fight, if we get a chance to kind of guesswork on... If we get a chance to guesswork on what type the enemy is. Um, whoever is the least likely to. Wait a second, did I just get the. Did I just get the. Yeah. My bad, Napora, you should have the Miracle Seed. Yeah, we'll we'll try to make a guess on whoever we think will be the least likely to be effective in the next fight. And we'll give that person the experience share. See what I'm thinking? Uh don't I have a don't I have a beak? I thought I had a beak. Dragon nut, smoke, poison bar, bright powder. Claw. Why did I speak? Oh well. Yeah, so we're gonna go we're gonna go into the fight. We're gonna go into the fight with this team that we have right now. Gonna save the game. And yeah, when we figure out for example, just to make something up, if we figure out that it's a fire type gym, we're gonna give Tangrowth the experience share. Take a step back, you know, have them take a step back while everyone else gets to work, kind of thing. <sighs> everyone ready? Uh, I'll lead with Garnet. Um, oh, I just realized I almost have the order perfect. There you go. With how it is on the screen. Real quick, though, I don't want to lose, guys, but real quick, I think it, we're about to go into something real tough. I think it's a good time for a bathroom break. So, everyone. One minute, two minutes or so, we'll be right back, okay? And then we'll keep talking about how dittos are weird as shit and how 90% of the things in the Pokemon world don't make sense. Good luck on the four, bro. Thank you. Yeah, just real quick, we'll be right back. Less than a minute, okay? Bloop.
directed. Oh, there we go. Microphone over here. Do the thing that we do when we um when I play D and D with or when I play D and D with my friends. So just like, all right, give me a head count. Everyone here, how we doing? I do not expect you guys to do that because maybe you're. I don't know. Maybe you're you know doing something on your side, but. <gasps> <sighs> oh, I just tapped Molly on the forehead. This is Molly. She's adorable as all get. All right, anyway. We're all ready. We're all good. <sighs> we all fine. We're all fine. Eating but here. Sorry, I, did, I didn't actually expect, uh, like, I demand a head count. That was more... Molly, do you want to leave that? Go, yeah, I don't actually demand a head count. That was more of a joke than anything else. <laughs> so, no worries there. But, you all ready? This is gonna go, this is gonna go real bad. You'll be facing one of the Elite Four. <sighs> Are you ready? Be courageous and go for it. Thanks, man. All right, what kind of gym? Oh, this feels psychic. Oh, this feels psychic. Ah, uh, this feels psychic or ghost. Ah, uh, this feels psychic or ghost. Okay. Alright, so psychic or ghost. Who will be the least effective here if it is psychic or ghost? Really, everyone, everyone's gonna do fine. Honestly, like, um... Uh... Probably guess up. Probably Gisop would do the worst if it's Psychic or Ghost. But no, Gisop, if it's a ghost, this is the generation where the main ghost was still the Ghastly family, so... Really, everyone's gonna do fine. Prob Probably Tangrowth is gonna be the least effective. Probably. So I'm gonna give him the experience share. With the hopes of power leveling him. <laughs> and then, okay, if we're going up against Psychic or Ghost, I want to lead with Wukden. I think Wukden is going to just just power through with Shadow Claw. Because, correct me if I'm wrong here. Correct me if I'm wrong here. Ghost is effective against Ghost. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm Googling it right now. Pokemon Ghost are weak to Ghost. Fantastic. So, here we go. Welcome to the Pokemon League, bitch! You're gonna regret this! I'm Will! I've trained all around the world, making my psychic type... Yes! I'm powerful, and at least I've been accepted. It, oh, and at least I've been accept... At la, at le, sh, 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 shut up, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill my fucking ghost. Psychic. Shut up, you shit. Fuck you. <laughs> he just immediately devolves. I'm just sitting there like, oh, okay. Now, the problem is there are a lot of psychic types. Now there's, there's nothing to stop me from just shadow clawing your ass. Except you might be tanky. Hmm. Don't you know Future Sight? Yeah, I was gonna say if you used Future Sight, I would have switched into um, Slowbro because Slowbro is tanky as shit. Jinx, fuck. Okay. Shadow Claw still works. Shadow, the Shadow Claw. Shit. Shit. I'm pretty big and beefy. I'm pretty beefy. Nope. You're in it. You're up. Ah, uh, fuck. Fuck. I really don't want to be cheesy. I really don't want to be cheesy here. I might have to... I... Woohoo! I don't know what that attack does, but it probably causes infatuation, which is a good thing that... It's a good thing that Garenid's here! I don't think you understand how genders work. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, God. That's a very long cry you have going there. 
Alright, good stuff, Wookton. Good stuff, Garnet. Poor, you're doing just great. Just Zatu. Ah, perfect. Perfect, Blizzard. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Is that a ghost type move? I no longer want to be here. I no longer want to be here. I no longer want to be here. But that's that should kill you. I'm going to be very impressed if that doesn't kill you. Just confused this, but it's inaccurate, so it's fine. Okay, good. I, I couldn't remember. I'm trying to think of them all. Executor. Dolls to don't, so you're gonna use a grass type move. So let's light your ass up. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I think I'll I think I'll wake up before you can That's fine. That's fine. Yep, sit there and raise your defense. Come on, I need you to wake up. 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 Bon, you're tanky. Your special defense is so high. Perfect. Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck. Mm. Yeah, we're going to take at least one Psychic to the chin. I'm pretty tanky, though. Let's better fucking kill him. Let's better fucking kill him. Come on. Yes, thank you, God. Okay. And I'm... Pseudosnoo is really fast. Really fast, really buff. Good stuff. That's what makes us so formidable. <laughs> I'm gonna mega drain you to death, you piece of shit. <laughs> oh, here we go. Uh, mega drain, please. Because I don't have Giga Drain for some reason. Oh, that's right. Your tanky is all good. Oh, oh no. But I heal. That was smart. That was smart. Uh, that was clever of you. Yeah. Watch him have, like, recover or something. If he has recover, that's going to be really bad. Question is, what are you gonna do with that? What are you gonna do with that? You have one turn left in the world. Okay. Okay. You're a really you're you're super buff. You're a piece of shit. Hey, Sky. Good to have you here. Um, I'm yelling at the Elite Four. Okay, so hold on. He's got plus two attack, plus two defense, plus two special defense. So no matter who I switch in, no matter who I switch in, we're going to be sitting here and playing this game. So the question is... So the question is... I don't think you know what to do. I'm calling your bluff. I'm, I'm, call I'm calling your bluff. I am. I'm calling your bluff. I don't think you know what to do. I think you only have water pulse and either psychic or confusion, and you are sitting there. That hurt a lot. You really should have led with that. You really should. Oh. 
Thank you so much for following Skyher. I really appreciate it. I almost died. <laughs> but thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I hope I I hope I could be entertaining in some way. <sighs> okay. One down. One down. Uh too bad until I stay on no now move on and experience the true ferocity. Is the point okay. I need someone to I need someone to 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 to, to fill me in. I need someone to fill me in on something. This is gonna sound like a dumb question, but I still I still stand by it, okay? Is the point of the Elite Four as I look for my passions? I might as well just uh, why I use curse but has no physical moves. Exactly. I think curses are actually a really fun idea for a move, but yeah, it definitely has that issue of being like you don't actually do anything, you know? Alright, okay, so we're just gonna... Can I heal mul Nope, I cannot heal multiple people. I have to go through this whole room. I should have bought more hyper potions. Should have bought more hyper potions. Why didn't I? Okay. Okay, sorry. So, here's the dumb question I have. Is the... Do you have a Discord server? I do not. Just straight up, I, I, do, I do not have a Discord server. Because... Okay. Whenever I say this, I, I always feel like I'm being a whiner, and that's not what I'm trying to convey. I don't have a Discord server because I'm not a big enough channel. I have no moderators. I don't even know what I would do with a Discord server if I had one. I'm, I'm just a guy doing this for funsies. So, I, I apologize for that. Just because that's just... That's, that's where we're at as a team. But, um, anyway, sorry. The stupid question I have about Pokemon... Is the goal of really gym leaders in general, but primarily the elite four and the champion, is it their goal to never be beat, or is it their goal to test us as people and trainers to earn a badge of honor? Because I legit don't know the answer. Uh, I'm going to give you the Miracle Seed back. There you go both because like they get real like butt hurt when they lose i mean claire as an example that we just saw today um uh, claire that we just saw today was like furious that she lost that guy looks like a ninja bet he uses poison types Betty uses poison types. Betty's a... Betty's a fucking ninja. Play Heart Gold too, by the way. Uh, for all of them, that's more difficult. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it was Koga. This little piece of shit. Wasn't Koga a gym leader in the first game? But, um... That was something that always got me. Because, like, different people got really butthurt. Even... What was it? Like, Whitney and Claire didn't even want to give you the badge until they're basically forced to. And like the elite four are like, I'm going to be the strongest ever. And I, then I beat them and they're like, well, I'm still going to be the strongest ever. It's like, so is this like a, is this like an organization where there's a rank where it's like your Pokemon will be X amount of strength. Obviously levels aren't a real thing in the real world, but like generally speaking, this is the amount that you're expected to be at. Or yep. He died. His daughter runs a gym now by the close of fire. Ah, nice. But, um, yeah, like, is it supposed to be that, or is it supposed to be something unbeatable? Because I don't get that. Also, you're playing Heart Gold too? Nice. Let's see. But you shall see soon enough. He may say Pokemon are not about being brute force, but we're going to brute force the fuck out of this. Everyone just mentally prep yourself for that. We are going to brute force the shit out of this. Oh my goodness, it's an area dose. I can't psychic an area dose. Just kidding, I can. Blizzard. You lived! Oh shit! That's not good! I'm pretty tanky though. Shit. I'm pretty buff. Kind of a big boy. Except Karen is a girl. Karen is kind of a big girl. 
she she's so she's so big and she's so big and stone. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. No 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 no. Oh no 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 no. Oh this sucks. This sucks. I know it's gonna happen. Oh, I know it's gonna happen. Please, please. We need to, we need to kill him before he can do anything. We need to kill him. Fortress, Fortress is known for having spikes and toxic spikes and stealth rock. We need to fucking kill him right now. Please die. Come on, times four effective. Times four. Oh, God. That could have been bad. Like, straight up, if that thing used toxic spikes, we would have been fucked. Gen 2 trainer mechanics. Yeah. Frame for while. Blah, 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 blah. You're phys yeah, you're physical. You're physical, because Weezing is special. Fuck! Yeah, the OG cancer Pokemon. Oh, God. Oh, no. Okay, so... Sudi Snoot has a timer. Black Sludge, you piece of shit. How dare you have items that I've used the entire game? In my opinion, they should always have items. So, okay. We have to be able to try to predict when we need to jump out. Uh, if he has poison types, I'm willing to bet a tentacruel, crowbat. All right. Got the other way around. Weezing is physical. What? Really? Oh, wait. Hold on. Is So, is it Weezing is special attack, physical defense, while Muck is physical attack, special defense? It's one way or the other. I always forget. Anyways, flamethrower. Shit. Shit. Also, you're level 44. We should leave. Yeah. Okay. My bad. Alright. Because I was going to say, like, Weezy does all, like, special attacks, and Muck is all, like, physical attacks. Oh, fuck. Fuck my life. That's not good. I don't have anything that's 100% accurate, so... If I die to this for the record, I just want everyone to know this. If I lose this for the record, I'm going to be so mad. Thank you. That's why Alola Muck ended up being really good. Adding Dark to it was really nice. Okay. I'll admit, I don't, I don't know the stats of it off the top of my head, but I can, I can follow that logic. Yeah, because then he would have things like Crunch and Bite and stuff, right? Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, so like I said. Lady likes MVP. Killed three gods. Or two gods. Killed gods. MVP. Just and just the, be the best. Just high venom off. High. You've been counting on that one from the very beginning. That's wonderful. Shit. Oh no. You need to die. You need to die. You need to die right now. <gasps> Oof. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Oof indeed. Oof. I should have bought more hyper potions. But my efforts failed. I must hone my skills. Go on to the next room and put your abilities to the desk. Thank you. Okay. Uh, okay, 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 okay. It's like the moment he's like, you have done well. And I'm, I'm like trying to make a big show of like, yes, I did do well. Thank you for noticing. But the moment he stops talking, I'm just like, <sighs> oh my God, I'm so you used the top team on me 15 times. Oh my God. I, um, another potion. Yeah, I should have bought more potions. Straight up. That's why I'm trying to be a little sparing with them. Yeah, so they're not fully topped up, but they're mostly topped up, you know. 
I'm not... Now that you mentioned, like, Weezing and, um, Mach, I remember once doing a playthrough of Pokemon where I only used the Team Rocket team. So it was, like, what was it? It was Weezing, it was Weezing, Mach, Arbok, I, I'm Crobat. I may have had a Persian. I don't remember. But yeah, like, those four, th those four were fun to use. I think Arbok was the main MVP. No, Crobat. It was Crobat and Arbok. They are the main MVPs. Um... Bye. Bye. Fighting. He looks like a fighty. He looks like a fighty. Okay. Hey, right. turns out still works. Guardian gets up. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. You take that. You take this. I'm gonna give you this. We wanna keep you in for as long as possible. Actually, hold on. No, 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 no. We're gonna give you. We're gonna give you the shell bell. Yes. And then we're gonna give you the twisted spoon. And then we're gonna give. Yes. And then we're gonna give Wookden because Wookden is not gonna be. The Wookden is not gonna be anywhere near this fight. He is not gonna be involved at all as much as i can help it let's see crobat is so good real common flying type hits with so yeah exactly like even as golbat even as golbat like that line is just solid which is such a shame because like you know there's so many zubats trying to kill you all the time everyone just kind of gets sick of them but like they're still really good even in their own right you know all right i was trained to the extreme because i believe our potential is how you became strong can you extend our power I didn't tell you my name. I did not tell you my name. How do you, how do you, how do you know my name? How, how, how do you, how? I'm scared. I'm so scared. A feck. A feck. You're not gonna stop me from just air slashing the shit out of you. Okay, yeah, that was a quick attack. Okay, that's a little worrying, but it should be fine. See, it's fine. It's fine. You're a buff boy. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hitmontop is the... Uh... What? Ah! Got you. I got, I got, I got you. I got you. Um... I could send in. No doubt you're gonna use a rock type move, right? Shit. Actually, wait, this is fine. This is totally fine, actually. It'll, it'll tickle a little bit. It'll tickle a little bit, but this is fine. Rock smash. Rock, rock smash, boom. If nothing else, I'm gonna lower your defense. Wookton is so buff. Wookton is so fucking buff. Oh my goodness, Wookton. Wookton is so buff. Just, just. You know, you, you see Earthquake and you're like, oh god, it's the end of all things. Wookton says, no, no, it is not the end of all things, my son. You're a piece of shit. Real talk, you're a piece of shit. I am lowering your defense, and that is still all the damage. I- what if I use that? Oh, uh, let's try not to do that until it's needed, alright? Let's try not to... Damn, that for it takes like a champ. Let's- let's try not to heal our own Pokemon until we need to. We have standards here. Okay, we have standards. For a walk through the- for- He's a fucking beast. Alright. We have standards here. We're not gonna, we're gonna do our best not to heal in the middle of battle. Like an asshole. 
through now. You dishonorable piece of shit. Okay, the ninja, I expect it out of the ninja. I don't expect it out of you. Ah, right, yeah, everyone, everyone gets experience. Everyone, everyone gets some love. Man, it's fine. I'm not worried about it. We can pretty much neutral damage our way through. Um, is fire kick, a, is blaze kick a thing yet? Nah, I don't think so. I have Earthquake. No, hang on. No, hang on. Wait. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. All right. Now, hang on. <gasps> I'm no longer okay with this arrangement. But there's something I know. There's something I know. With him paralyzed, I bet I can outspeed him. I'm willing to make a bet. I'm willing to make a bet. I forgot that I was confused. <laughs> Just shit. I'm willing to make a bet. That's right, you're the defense one. Suck it. Just suck it. In general, just suck it. Please. Son of a bitch. Here's my. I forgot. Hitmon Lee is the tanky one, but here's my logic. I really need shit. I might pull out. I pull out. <sighs> no, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. Not worth it. I really wanted to keep Napora in because of the swagger. Fine, it's fine, it works. I really wanted to keep him in so I could use the swagger on the earthquake because earthquake would do normal damage against all the fighting types but plus two to my attack that's a pretty big fucking deal so we're good all right now you probably have fire ice thunder punch but here's my logic called it because you have thunder punch Ow. Son of a bitch. I can't send in my bird against you, but you wanna know who I can send? Someone who resists all of your punches. All of them. Have fun. What are you gonna do? I'm tanky as fuck. Okay. Okay. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. Because that shit never goes away, if I remember correctly, until I'm hit with a fire type move. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. Bullet punch? That's steel, if I remember correctly. The only one he has left is hit on top. Hava does frozen fucking Brock. I think like 10%? I think it's like 10%. Bruno's a cheater. That's what I've learned today. Sometimes first turn as well? Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. All right. Yeah, I don't. We could sit here with Hitmonchan and heal everyone else, but I think the only one left is Hitmon top, so. Screw it, right? We can just we can just kind of waltz our way through, probably. Oh wait, no, this two more. That's that's. You're done. You're done. There you go. Good stuff. If I had to make a bet, another fighting type. I'm thinking the one Polyrath. Oh shit. You're the physical powerhouse of physical powerhouses. You probably likely have a water type move. Fuck it, we're gonna go all in. Surf. 
You are a you are a physical attack wall. Leaving. I am 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 leaving. I resist. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. I resist that. Oh, fuck. Neutral because it's normal flying. You're right. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna loop. I'm gonna loop. I'm gonna loop. I'm gonna loop. What do I do? What do I do? I send in Sudi Snoop. He's gonna take a cross chop. Simple as that. He is going to take a cross chop, and he might die. If I leave Gasop in, his special attack and his attack. If I use Air Slash, I will get my stab. He is a physical powerhouse, but not a special powerhouse. If I remember correctly, his special defense is pretty low. I'll be able to... And I have a 30% chance of flinching. It's the only way I'm seeing winning this. It's the only way I'm... I could have hyper-beamed. You're... You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. I know he has rock slide. Best chance I got. Garen is just looking at the screen like, do you see this shit? Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. Damn it, Garen was good too. Garen was good, or not Garen, Gisop was good. Fuck. GG, yep. He fought well, he fought honorably. <sighs> fuck. This is, okay, I... I said this before, but I'm going to say it again. I love Nuzlocke as a concept. I think Nuzlocke as a concept is really fun. I really like the idea of everything being permanent. Having to grind because of lost Pokemon and then having them die and then knowing that that time... It wasn't wasted, but man, does it feel like it. That's the heartbreaking shit. That's the stuff that's like, I, I, want, I want to die. I... Yes, okay. Yes. I could have ended the episode and I could have grinded and insisted everyone get to level 50 or 55 or whatever, right? I could have, but I didn't want to grind anymore. So if anything, this is the fault of my own impatience and I will own that. Okay, I will own that. But also...
Doesn't mean it doesn't hurt, though. Doesn't mean it doesn't hurt. And no one has gained any levels. Which is understandable! Alright. Who's the next asshole? Rock? Ghost? Ghost? At a certain situation where a black two knows like how to side up all the way from the beginning, it's activate itself during the before stand up a light screen, it hurts, but it's what makes you the best of the Pokemon. Yep. Yep. I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling a I I, I can't I'm I'm feeling some ghost. I'm feeling a ghost I'm feeling a ghost vibe. I'm feeling a Feeling a, feeling uh feeling kind of a, a little ghosty goo here. I'm Karen of the Elite Four. Shit. Well, good thing that we didn't leave with Karen. In. That would have been bad. Okay, dark type. Dark, dark, dark. Oh no, she's hot now. Nah, I, uh, okay, dark, 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 Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. How do I hurt it? Okay, good. Yes, okay, good, good, good. Lower your defense. Okay, that's fine. See, I was kind of hoping that I would keep Lori in its defense, and then Karen would be like, now's the time to use the full restore after I lowered its defense three or four times. So I'd be like, yes, you do that. Okay, it's going to be bad. Oh, well, I said it. Uh, I was hoping I would lower its defense a bit more, and, uh... Wookton is still a fucking champ. Look at that. Just healing right back. Well, rock Smash isn't going to do anything to you. Oh, no. Okay, I'm going to make a bet. Ah, oh, this is a bad bet. This is a bad bet. This is a bad bet. I don't like this bet. I don't like this bet. I'm a special defense tank and I resist. Good stuff. I'm gonna max potion, just for the record. I fully intend on doing this. Just, there you go, fuck you. Come on, you have like no physical defense. You're weak to me. Son of a bitch. You're still alive. Why are you still alive? Whose idea was that? You're a fucking cheat. I'm a fucking cheat. Yeah, at the beginning I was yelling at Bruno for dishonor. Now I'm just like, nope, fuck you, actually. I changed my mind. Fuck you. Ooh. Does that only work if I kill it, though? Whatever, I still got enough. I don't know why you didn't have Shadow Ball. But also... Should I do this or should I do this? I don't know. This feels weird. <sighs> okay. Umbreon, alright. Okay, 
I could send in... Oh, this is going to hurt. Actually, no, you're pure defense. You're pure defense and special defense. Yep, and you're faster than me, so payback won't work either. I could milk you. In fact, I think I will. I can milk you. Uh, I wish I had one that only healed me for 50. Just to, like... I can milk you. <laughs> Just straight up and say to your I can milk you. We're going to asshole tactics. Simple as that. We are go that is what we're doing. We are going to asshole tactics now. I I have I have no I have no qualms with being that guy. Because you killed my boy Gissa. Shut up about that being Bruno. You guys are collective. As a collective, you killed my boy. Guess what? I am gonna take my revenge. I'm gonna get that back in blood. You're gonna use a grass type move. I'm gonna be immensely amazed if you do not use a grass type move. Oh no. And I can't use Sunny Day. Critical hit? Okay, that's fine. Light him up. Light its ass up. Is it a boy or a girl? I want to make sure I say it. Her. Light her ass up. File plumes are somewhat tanky, but not this tanky. Nope. Nope, you're not going to be able to take that. Good stuff. Hey! Nice. Uh, no, 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 no. Keep all moves. Amnesia is cool, but we're more focused on killing people. Yeah, I give a bone. If it was, if it was Swords Dance, I'd reconsider. But these Chris G's, yeah. I do like drop. I do like drop. You can do this. You just, you do this. Look at you. You're so buff. You're so big and buff. You're so just amazingly strong. And you're tanky, too. You're so tanky, and you're just so strong. Son of a bitch. You're just so strong and big. And just look at you. You're just, you're just, you're just so big and, and big. And look at him. He's just he's a weak fire type. He ain't got shit on you. Shit. I'm gonna cheese the shit out of this. <laughs> Just, um, not losing Liddy Licked. I'm not. I actively refuse. I actively refuse. I, um, no. Great. 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 Now we just have to pray that whatever we go up against next is agreeable. Might be a bad idea, but hang on. I'm big and tanky. I bet I can take it. Ow. I bet I can take this. That only works if I have a berry, bitch. Go down, go down, go down, go down, go down, go down. All the way, all the way. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. All right. <sighs> Big Pokemon, that is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with the Pokemon they love best. Porygonzi. 
I like your style. You understand what's important. Go on. The champion is waiting. <sighs> uh, trainer, I said go on. The champion is waiting. Uh, champion, I said go on. The person's waiting. You need to... You need to keep moving because, yo, there's other people in line waiting for you. <gasps> I, like, go full Final Fantasy, just, like, find the checkpoint, take out a tent. I'm sleeping! <laughs> I'm going to sleep and you cannot stop me! Okay. 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 I need to stop slumping in my chair. Okay. Big, tall, confident. Big, tall, okay. In camera. Big, tall, confident. All right, um... Mm. Garenin needs an elixir. Garenin needs an elixir. Right? Elixirs? That, that's what they do? Restores the territory by the target by 10? Yeah. Yeah, okay, gotcha. Yeah, so. Garenin needs it for Blizzard. Everyone else sh sh should be fine. Who is the strongest opener? If we have Swash, I'll be toxic. Garnet. Garnet's the strongest opener. Well, that is unless we can figure out what kind of type this. Oop. How come this guy gets big clockwork bells and shit? I don't want big clockwork bells and shit. Ooh. Fuck my life. Fuck. All right, we're already at disadvantage. Shit! We're already at disadvantage. That's fine. That's fine. It's fine, because I say it's fine. Shit. I'm pretty big and tanky. I'm pretty big and tanky. Oh, sorry. No, you don't understand. I'm a fish. That shit doesn't work on me. You can use tents in battle. <laughs> in the middle of battle. Uh, hang, hang, hang on. Just go take a nap. Okay. Okay. One down. One down. So now, so just so you know, just so you know, just so you know, Lydia Lex was my best chance against literally everything that he had. Now here's the next problem I have. Here's the next problem I have, right? I have to make a bet. If I blizzard and miss, he will kill me if he uses Outrage. If I heal and he uses Outrage, he will drop me down to half again. If I had to make a bet, I'm going to bet that you're going to do something that's going to take you at least one turn. That is my bet. Because right now... Garenid is our only fucking hope because he's the, she's the only one that has an ice type move.
I'm farming you. You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. And I'm farming you. Congratulations. This is your role in life now. This is what's going to happen to you. You're being farmed. That's just how it works. Okay. You technically shouldn't even have a Dragonite. They evolve at level 55. I know this for a fact. And if I'm wrong, please correct me. I can't believe I lost Lady Licked. No, you're still a piece of shit. No. No, we're playing this game. No. No, no. 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 I see you did that to me once. Because you think you're so freaking clever. Do it again. Do it again. With your 50% chance to operate. Do it again. No, I insist. Do it again. And now, I'm going to Ancient Power the fuck out of you. And I'm going to pray that we become nice and big and strong as a result of it. That's fine. That's not going to be enough. There. I'm going to become nice and big and strong, and I'm going to become super fast and super tanky. And we're going to keep Nipora in for as long as we can. No, that's fine. No, that's fine. Because you see, you don't understand. You're stuck in the room with me. I'm not stuck with you. I'm going to... This is probably a waste, but... You know, if there was a time in the world to use it, it's now. Now is the time in the world to use it. I will throw a Master Ball at your Dragonite if I'm allowed to. I'm tanky as shit. Thank you, shit. I'm so big and so strong. Just you and your fucking dragons. You and your fucking son of a bitch. Alright. Okay. So. 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 I know what everyone's thinking. Get. Nipora out, right? And that's a reasonable thought process because I have no special defense. But I'm going to risk it. Here's what I'm going to do. We're going to make a bet that you're going to do something for a turn because you're clever, okay? And you know I'm going to switch out so you think you're safe. I'm going to ancient power your butt and kill you for one-fourth damage. And someone has knocked down the door. Give me just a second. I'll be right back. Oh, oop. Sorry, wrong one. And it's just not letting dollar stand because I just threw a tennis ball. My dog's in the backyard. Oh, what? Oh, no, 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 Temporary loss of internet, son of a gun. Okay, so what's basically gonna happen is I'm gonna lose track, you guys. There's gonna be a huge delay. There's not much I can do about it. We are near the end. So we're just gonna go for it. I have a good feeling in my gut. Okay, this works. Come on.
Oh, good. Oh, good. I'm gonna make the bed again. I'm gonna make the bed again. You're not gonna do something for a turn and I'm gonna light your ass up. All right, so it should be back. Hold on, stream reconnected. You may need to refresh. All right, cool, so we did Fire Fang. It did much less damage. Ancient power. Oh no. Live, live. Son of a bitch. All right. All right, good. Good to know. Good to know. My bet almost worked. If that didn't crit, my bet would have worked. Just for the record. All right, that's one dog inside. We got, two. We got one more to go. Boop, 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 boop. Can you imagine if that worked though? I felt very funny with that. Like, just in general. I felt I felt like I was being smart. So my sister's bulldog. My sister's bulldog loves to be outside. And the cold. <laughs> what damage is that? Seriously, another crit? Did he... Did he full restore? He full restored, didn't he? He full restored. Alright! You! Ah, uh, well, I was doing it too, so fair enough. Yeah, so, just fair warning, there may be a bit more of a delay than before. I'll try my best to, you know, keep on... Keep on top of you guys and, and chat everything. Because... <sighs> Because I value what you say very much, okay? I want that to be for the record. Fuck you. <laughs> but it's a lot colder in this room now. Okay. If it didn't crick, I'm sure it would have. Yep. Garen had leveled up. Oh fuck, there's two more. I whooped in and snooty snoot. He's got two and I got three, but mm, mm. I really hope. I really hope. Oh, thank you, God. Oh, thank you, God. Thank you, God. That's not gonna do very much against me. I'm pretty big and I'm pretty buff. All things considered. Okay, maybe I'm not as buff as I thought I was, but I'm pretty damn buff. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna be completely honest. If Schlappa, if our rival. He did. Sorry, the delay is much larger now. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I could restart the stream, but we're also, like, right at the end. You know what I mean? I'll leave that up to you guys if you want me to restart the stream or not. Heal to be safe. Heal to be safe. Heal to be safe. Heal to be safe. He'll be safe, he'll be safe. You will likely use crunch. If I had to guess, you're gonna use crunch. And I don't know if that's gonna mess me up or not. Come on, come on. Come on, stop, 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 stop. Okay, perfect, good, good. If you crit, I'll die.
Oh, fuck my life. Fuck my life. Fuck my life. Fuck my life. I think we can live. Yeah, sorry. Like, it's, it's, it's unfortunate. It happens sometimes. I, I don't have anything for it. I always feel like an asshole to you guys. It's a pretty large slave, but we can deal. Yeah. Because I do, I really value being able to talk to you, like, you know, back and forth. I think it's really special. I think it's one of the reasons that this kind of format of doing Twitch is awesome. But it, it's, you know, it, it just happens sometimes, right? I wish there was a way I could, like, just expect these GGs to be deleted. Nah, it's all good. I will, I will do my best to wait and watch. That's what I'll do. Go down. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, good. Is that it? Is that it? <sighs> Wooked in. Wooked in. Oh my goodness. Alright, get back up. Get back up with the chair. Get back up with the chair. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna be 100% honest right now. If Rival Schlappa comes back right now, I'm cheating my ass off, okay? Everyone is getting fucking revived. That is, if, if he comes right now, I'm cheating my ass off. Because, holy shit. Oh, God. Oh, my, oh, the music doesn't quite fit the feeling. Oh, God. That plan would have worked with Tangrowth. That plan should have worked with Noctowl. Lydia Licked, I wasn't expecting it. Sno Snooty Suit did nothing, and I'm fine with that. I'm proud of him. Oh, my goodness. I was fully, I was 100% ready to sit there and just keep healing my Furret. And I was fully expecting him to use Full Restore on his, on his Aerodactyl. Like, I, I was expecting it. We were going to go back and forth, and I was going to I was going to do that until I was forced to use Sooty Snoot. I was going to Sunny Day, and then Solar Beam, and just pray to God. Oh! Hi, Kat. Hi, guys. Hi. Thank you. Oh, God. Thank you for saying this. Oh, my goodness. You have become truly powerful. I'm just, like, in the corner crying. She's like, oh, yeah. Your Pokemon responded to your strong. He doesn't. You did. He doesn't? Yes! Okay, God! As a trainer, you continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. Great. No. Okay, for a second, I thought it was the one girl that's our friend. I was gonna be like, you back the fuck up! Just get the fuck away from me! I'm holding my, fr I'm holding Wookton, just like, just holding him in my arms, like, no, we're not going out. Uh, Professor Oak, if your word's so slow, Professor Oak, how does inbreeding with dittos work? How does it work, Professor Oak? <laughs> ah, Max, it's been a long while. I don't know what his voice is. You certainly look more impressive. I'm just crying, snot. I'm ugly crying, like snot and tears. I'm like puking in the corner. Your conquest of the league is just fantastic. That's not like a 1930s. Uh, your dedication, trust, and love for your Pokemon. Oh, they're dead! Made this happen. Your Pokemon rod steady too, I guess. You really could have used anyone, but I guess. Because they believed in you as a trainer, they persevered. Four of them died! Congratulations, Max. Let's interview the brand new champion. This is going to be a bit noisy. Nice, could you come with me? All right, we're just going to blow him off. Just get fucking wrecked. We haven't done the interview. You'll get the interview later after I bury my comrades. Oh, it's been a long time since I last came here. This is where we commemorate the League Champions for all eternity. So am I the new champion? I take a job or are you still the champ? I don't fucking. 
The courageous Pokemon are also inducted. Inducted? Here today we have released the we witnessed the rise of a new league champion, a trainer who feels compassion for and trust towards all Pokemon, especially those who died, so that we could have our Pyrrhic vic Pyrrhic 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 victory. The trainers succeed through perseverance and determination. The new league champion who has all the makings of greatness. Max, allow me to register you and your partners as champions. I really okay objectively I really like this this like showing everyone off and where they met and what level they were and I, I really like this. I think this is really cool and cinematic, and what a great way to, you know. <sighs> it, 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 I, I just really like it. I think, I think it's fun, you know. That sassy look behind. Okay, so not so uh, so Lydia Licht and Gisop, they are kind of a bit um, overshadowed, but fucking oh my goodness, Wookton, Wookton MVP. Just in general, Wookton is the MVP. Oh god. Oh wait, hold on. What's on the what's on the little screen? Oh, okay. We did it. We're done. We did it. We're not gonna do the Gen One area. We're not gonna go against Red or anything like that. We're not. Just as simple as that. Overall, oh god, this is the part of the adventure where I give my final thoughts on the game. And it's gonna sound terrible when I say this. It's kind of hard to give final thoughts on a Pokemon game without comparing them to other Pokemon games. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like I would have a really hard time trying to like, trying to like suss out the individual bits of this game. You know, being like, yo, know, how do I think this game is better than all the others? Blah, blah, blah. I love that um, Pokemon can follow you around. You know, I, I think that's fucking adorable. Um, yeah. The bug guy was cool. Fuck Whitney. Oh, God. I don't, I don't know. Like, I I genuinely love Pokemon. But I would be lying. Fuck you. You used Curse and killed some of my guys. I remember that shit. Fuck you, sweet coon. If I could have killed you. But, um... What am I thinking? As much as I love Pokemon, there definitely is... Fuck you and your polyrath. You were fine, if I remember right. But, um... I do, a lot of the times, really get bummed down. Fuck you, Lance. Claire, not as much, but still, fuck you. The ice guy, he killed me with pillow swines. Fuck you. <laughs> just in general, just, like, going down the line. You guys were fine, I kicked all your asses. But, um... Yeah, I, as much as I really do love Pokemon, I love the world, I love the idea of, like, having these magical creatures with you, and, like, you know, being on the adventure, that childlike joy of exploring the world and everything like that. I love that, do not get me wrong. But, definitely this game, especially when you do a Nuzlocke and you have to, or, well, you could say especially with a Nuzlocke, but it also applies when you, um, it also applies if you just switch Pokemon regularly. Grinding gets painful. It really does. And, yeah, it's super easy just to hit this point of, like, I don't want to grind. It's like, but Max, that's the main gameplay loop. Yeah, but... Jeez. You know, maybe I just... Maybe I don't want to. 
it's okay. I said with Final Fantasy VII as well. That's like you know sometimes I want to get towards the important story bits, but I have to fight all these weird things that don't matter. Pokemon has that to a pretty big extent. A lot of the puzzles. No. But I'm like, a lot of the puzzles, if you really think about it, or like the dungeons, quote unquote, they're really fast if you just remove the wild encounters. You know, like, ah, that's something that I'll, like, I always go back and forth with that with Pokemon games that I love, I love the combat, but man, it is so easy for it just to drone on and on and on and on and on forever. And you're just like, dude, I'm sick and tired of killing all these Golbats and Gravelers and Tentacruels and Raticates, okay? Just fucking leave me alone. <laughs> so, I don't know. I say that in recognition of, I really love Pokemon. I think it's a fantastic series, but I'm also glad that I'm done. And I love that 3D model of the Gia. I think it looks beautiful. But we need to do something real quick. There's a few small things we need to do. Can I... I, um... I need to access my own... I need to access the, the box. I think we need to check in with Professor Elm as well. Hey, Mom, by the way, I love you. Just so you know, Mom... But I agree that the grind is rough, yeah. Until he has something to give you, why don't you- Hey mom, you know, I became champion and stuff like you said. I, I love you. I I just- I, I want- please notice me. God, that gives a really sad air to it when I say that. <laughs> I'm just like, please, please, please notice- Mother, mother, please. <laughs> mother, do you love me now? <laughs> no, that, that's really fucking dark. Alright, I called because I have something for you. See, it's an SS tick, name quote on- Yep. Parts from him, but you knew that already, Max. After all, you venture all over with your Pokemon. Give my regards to Pressure Oak and Kanto. Yep. I, I need to access the computer because we need to go down memory lane. Just real quick. This is going to take a little bit, but we need to go down memory lane. I don't think we have anyone that has cut. So, fair warning, we may have to deal with some scrubs. But like, what am I trying to say? Level two. That's part of the combat animations I had with a lot of old RPGs. They were flashy, which was cool the first few times. After a while, you kind of wish it didn't take half an hour to catch. Yeah, we talked about that with Final Fantasy in the summons. That it's like, this animation literally takes a minute. And you know, the first time you're like, it's a minute. Who cares? No big deal, right? But then after, you know, time five, it's like, I am so sick of this. <laughs> And like, okay, I could I could sit here and be like, I wish, you know, I could get to the fight part faster and in and out faster. It is pretty dang expedient. I love this song. It's a good song. All right. Mom over here, like, go to Elm's house, I'm on Tinder. <laughs> Mom doesn't give a shit. All right, okay. Next way, hold on. Nah, I'll, I'll leave it with their items. So. In order of who died, it was Gisop, Unilick, Tangro, Slowbro. Which I recognize. I recognize that Slowbro. When when we started this year, going to head off. Congratulations again. That's all good, man. Thanks you so much for coming. I really appreciate it and help me out with the grinding spot. I know we didn't use it as much as we probably should have, but I still really appreciate you coming. The rest is just gonna be ranting for a little bit. <laughs> Sephiroth Supernova. Yep. Um. All right. So. Okay. What was I gonna say? Um. I forgot. Um. What was I gonna say? Yeah. Okay. So in the beginning of the series, I really wanted a Slowpoke because I think Slowpoke is a really cool Pokemon. I'm not saying he's the main water type I'd use, but he's kind of one of my favorites, just in general. Um, so, Slowpoke was the mascot, but I feel like Slowpoke dying in that final fight so fur it could live is kind of fitting. So just to go down memory lane real quick, what, you know, like, moments you remember about, uh, moments you remember about, well, 
about each Pokemon. Go. Um, Bolio. I was so excited because grass type, super fast. Chidane, yep, meant demon. He was strong. He was busting through shit. Mapritka, remember being pretty solid. Weeping Bell, I remember dying very quickly. Apom, I was so excited for Apom. Because normally, normally, I hate Apom. But, um, I think it was like technician. I was gonna use technician and double hit, or it was gonna evolve and have technician. Yeah, because it has run away and then technician when it evolves, or it had, um, pick up and pick up. I was gonna have a double hit technician Apom. It was gonna be dope. And then he died. I honestly don't remember anything about Lighthouse. I think I got him and then he died pretty quick. Fortress, I was really excited about Fortress. Like, in general. Because I was like, oh my goodness, I never get to use this guy. And he's all about throwing spikes and stealth rocks and shit. It was gonna be dope. He died. So, Ampharos has a special place in my heart because. Okay, I, I wanna show I'm gonna show the class something. This is something that is really special to me. Um, there's a person that there there is a person that followed the channel and drew something. She okay, so Ampharos' name was Hester because they they uh, they were essentially going through like a transgender thing. A transgender thing and trying to like rediscovery, so I wanted to be very careful about the term I use for their gender. They had always named a Pokemon there's horse, and they were talking about uh, essentially a plush of uh, Flaffy that they have. And I just want to share this because it is near. It, I'm not just saying this; it is near and special and dear to my heart. They drew me a Porygon. At Macroon is here. I just want to. I want to give Mac a shout out because they they drew me a Porygon, and sometime I need to print it out and just put it on the fridge because. This, this is really special to me. I know it's like, it's a very simple drawing, but it, it's near and special to me. And I that that is a memory that naming Ampharos Hester, which is horse in some language, it, it was just it was just very special to me in general. So I just, I just want to give that a shout out. Um, Persian was another one I was really excited about because of Technician, getting that mess to work. Magneton, I just was, you know, Magneton, good, solid, but kind of boring. Steelix, I was really excited about, but I had no ground type moves for it, so it was kind of a little bit of a letdown. Gloom, I don't even remember how Gloom lived or died. Houston, Houston was a baller. Houston was kicking ass and taking names, and he was great. And when he died, I think he died to Bruno's Polyrath, which really bummed me out. <sighs> Noctowl is one of the guys that's been with me since the beginning. And initially, I was not happy with her. She only had Uproar and Peck, and Uproar was just not... I don't like Uproar. I don't like moves that lock you into something. I know Outrage is amazing, and Pedal Dance is amazing and stuff, but I, I didn't like it. But then once she got Air Slash, Extra Sensory, just shit was turned online. Noctowl was a beast. Lantern... I forgot, or Lidilict, I forgot how much I genuinely love this Pokemon. Like, it's a very simple, kind of derpy design. It's obviously an angler fish, but like a little different stuff. But man, in terms of like abilities and moves, just solid. Just incredibly, incredibly solid as a Pokemon. So, yeah, I, I need to use lanterns more often. I think they're dope. Tangrowth, so Tangrowth. Napora, Tangrowth. If I had to lay out my full team of, like, the Pokemon that I would use if I was given anything, which would be Porygon-Z, Metagross, Gliscor, uh, Blaziken, Greninja, and Tangrowth. Tangrowth is actually one of the ones I really wanted to use, but now I actually used it. It made me realize that I never really fully identified what kind of build I'd want Tangrowth to have. Tangrowth is useful because it has, like, Regenerator, which is a hidden move. A lot of Breathing and TM moves are special to it. Power Whip. A lot of ways to heal and stuff, but honestly, I might switch back to who I had before Tangrowth, which was between Leafeon and Torterra, with Breloom being in third place. Probably because of Gliscor being on the team, Leafeon. Because Leafeon is very simple. Leafeon, like she's just a physical wall, but it's just very solid. So I think it was good that I got to use Tangrowth, even though it only having Mega Drain kind of bummed me out a little bit. You know what I mean? I love the Slowpoke family. I think the Slowpoke family is adorable. 
and a lot of fun. I love their move sets. I love the idea. It's kind of weird that like both slow slow bro and slow king both are specially attack orientated, but the like slow bro is like physically attack oriented and slow king is like specially attack oriented. Like they're not actually that different from each other. But um between the two, I always like slow bro. I think I think he's just adorable and derpy and um when I saw the announcement for the Galar region, them having a special slow bro and a special slow king. I got really excited because I was like, oh my goodness, these guys are so cute and I love them. And even though like the weird shelter tail thing, that's its own weird debacle, I still think they're just adorable and Slowbro will always have a special place in my heart. There's a few Pokemon like that. Um, what which one call it? The first one that comes to mind is Nidoking and Abra and Haunter. Because I know everyone in Gen 1 uses Alakazam and Gengar and as I got older, I hated that. But as a kid, I thought Abra and Haunter were the best. I just loved them. And New King too. I thought he was so much, he was so cool. Slowbro's in the same box of I don't know if I'd use him, but he is just he's just one of my favorites. I'm gonna go to I'm gonna I'm gonna do fair last. Suit so new. I am really, really amazed that we kept the starter from the beginning. And we used him regularly. Except if anything, I may have held him back a lot because whenever he fought, he excelled. He destroyed everything just to an absurd degree and i love that but i also was trying to get everyone else to level up so i didn't get to see that very much but yeah wherever he shined he annihilated it was awesome it was so good love slowpoke family identifies with being behind the times yeah i don't i do i do things in my own time kind of thing i don't like following trends i just like doing my own thing Starting to notice a, I get kind of empty headed. I can easily lose my train of thought. I space out a lot. I'm either incredibly lazy or incredibly motivated. Yeah, I'm starting to see a lot of similarities. I don't like it. I identify most with, Porygon, with Porygon Z. Damn it. That is the Pokemon I identify with the most. If I if I had to choose an Animorph and they're like, you could turn to one Pokemon, Porygon Z. 100% Porygon Z. Maybe Metagross and Lucario. Whisker. Second, but Porygon Z. <laughs> but um, yeah, he just did wonderful. So for it, when for when I had for it in the beginning, I think it was Ethan. Ethan said, or it might have been multiple people that said that for it could easily carry me to the end. And I feel bad because I actually replaced for it multiple times. That I was just like, no, you know, I really want to use this Meowth. I really want to use, you know, because I think it'll be a fun build. I really want to use this. Um, I really want to use, uh, you know, just all these different Pokemon. I kept trying to use them. And then Fur just, or Wookton just kept coming back. And every time I used Wookton, it was he, he, sheep, 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 sheep. He was just super reliable every single time he was just an absolute champ oh and i uh, i want to show this just for sake of it um i did catch a meowth with technician i forget exactly why i think that was the original and then i like switched it or something. i forget something weird happened but i just made sure i caught it again i think like i lost save file and then this is just a shiny that i i found while i was grinding so yay it's a weeping bell who gives a shit but i, I just thought it was i just thought it was fun you know uh, yep, they all let's see and then looking back here none of these guys i really use very much i so i only can look at them objectively and say crobat and tentacruel are beasts uh polyworld polyworld is another one i always loved from my childhood but um i never really use them that much so i kind of wish i could turn to a polyrath shelter is one i would actually use as a water type good skill in cloister shell smash go nuts Raticate will always hold a fun place in my heart. I just like Raticate. Even though it's like a rat and gross and disgusting. I like him. And Quagsire too. Like, there's a lot of Pokemon that I just love in general. These Pokemon up top? Not so much. <laughs> nah, it's not true. I just don't like it because cute. Alright. Or Togo. No, I like I like Togekiss. Not Togepi. I like Togekiss though. Anyways. Yep. These... How many? 12, 17. They fought and died with honor. These ones up top either didn't serve or didn't have a purpose. 
those eight below, yeah, they're on the sidelines ready to go. And in the end, yeah, for it. Just for it, did it. God. I love. I really like doing those logs. I I've complained about the grinding a lot, but this, you you guys are right when you say like, when someone dies and you lose it all. And you lose and you lose them. It really builds that emotional attachment and that feeling of accomplishment that yes, we did it. We did it. It was hard. There was many tears. But yeah. We did it. Shell is so weird knowing that's what makes so poke evolve in the anime. Yeah, I don't get it. Uh, if I remember correctly, like apparently there was a Pokemon that was essentially cut. And then like and that Pokemon was Slowpoke's tail, and then they're like, oh, well, it's what's in your shellfish thing? Shelder! Yeah, Shelder did it. Which is kind of weird, but, like, I get it. It's a fun idea for an evolution. You know, it's kind of up there with, like, um, with the Metagross family and the Magnemite family of, like, yeah, it's multiple of them coming together. And then in the games, it's like, now. Now it's not. Don't worry about it. Just, no. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that's the end of the episode. One thing I want to look up, though. One thing I want to look up. And I'll show you guys with it. You guys can still hear the sound, so it's all fine. So, yeah, that's Galarian Slowpoke. I just want to show this off because it sounds silly, but announcements for... So, this one came out more recently, and it's creepy as shit. Like, its eyes are just horrible. But, like, in some ways, when I started the Soul Silver series... Learning about Galarian Slowbro was the reason why I wanted to start. This thing was so cute, and I was like, man, I yeah, you know, I just remembered why I why I like the series. You know what I mean? Like or sorry, not why I like the series. Why I like Slowbro as a Pokemon. You can actually see Galarian Slowbro, so like Oh, so it's just more well rounded. Can I see its moveset? Oh my goodness, we can! So this is more just me being curious now. Shell sidearm? Uh, whether it would be higher as a physical. Oh, dope. That's super good. Uh, so yeah, sort of going first is part of this. Is it part of this? Oh, cool. Sick. All right, but um, the thing I want to look up was the difference of these poke. Oh, wow, that's a big list. Well, I can dissect this later on my own. I can dissect this later on my own. Maybe. I don't know. If I was going to choose between sword and shield. See, this side is Heracross and Tyranitar. High Dragon! This side has High Dragon. This is how I judge which game to play. I hate that thing. I hate Eskew. I think it looks so stupid. Mm. I'll probably get Sword. Because I'm a basic bitch like that. I like Swords. Anyways. Anyways. That will not be in the near future. The Let's Go Eevee playthrough that I was thinking about, that's going to be... I don't know if I'll do Sword and Shield as a Nuzlocke. I might, I might not. If I do, there's going to be a big focus on... Not so much doing Nuzlocke things, but playing as new Pokemon things. Like, I might go with Nuzlocke rules, but instead of it being random, more so going off of, like, I want to use new Pokemon. A lot of the Pokemon we use are Pokemon I'm familiar with. I want to use new Pokemon, but I might, like, still use Nuzlocke rules. You know what I mean? Kind of mix and match a little bit. Um, maybe I'll still choose a mascot Pokemon and be like, this Pokemon's staying forever. Um, let's go Eevee playthrough. Yes, I want to do that in the future. I know I say I hate Gen 1, but there's a fun thing. I sent you want to do a speed run of that game. I think it'll be fun and interesting. But that's going to be in the far future. I do not know what series is going to come up next. To be honest, this Friday is going to be Heroes of the Storm, in which... You know, that'll be the end of that series. I don't know what's going to come up next then. It's going to be on me to figure it out. Uh, Skyrim seems like the best bet because we could just do it nice and fast. Thinking maybe Horizon Zero Dawn. Thinking maybe Silent Hill. Uh, not Harm Center. Maybe Skyrim, then Horizon, and then just do Silent Hill and start on, uh, start on that shit. But, yeah, thank you guys so much for being here and helping me out with this. And, you know, seeing the highs and lows of dealing with this bullshit. Ah, oh, God. It was a good time. Really enjoyed it. Also, thank you for telling me about the things below. Um, I will I will endeavor to fix it because I thought 
if I well now I'm not gonna pull out now. But I thought you could it could be easily expanded and I was wrong. I can definitely work on getting that fixed sometime in the near future, not 100 percent sure when. So I just wanna say, you know, thank you guys so much for being here and you know, I hope I hope you had fun. I I always sound bad I always feel bad when I say I know I did. I'm not trying to be selfish, it's just I hope I can share that fun with you guys because that is the ultimate goal. <sighs> Do I have anything more on my patriotic coffee cup? There's still Sprite in here. Nice. I'm waiting a little bit because I know the delay is bad. I'm so I'm sorry about that. It just happens, you know. Glorious technology, right? Makes our lives wonderful, but also gets really frustrating at times. <sighs> yeah. So. I think I said everything I wanted to say. Yeah. So let's end the episode off here. Like I said, next stream is going to be on Friday. Uh, announcements for which will be on Facebook and Twitter, which is in the description below. I don't use them for anything else other than announcements. It was fun. I'm glad you had fun. I'm, I'm glad you know. I'm really glad you had fun. But, um... Yeah, announcements for it are gonna be on Facebook, Twitter, description below. A lot of this will be put on YouTube someday. Just fair warning how I, when I finally have time to sit down and do it, which really I do have time, it's just getting my lazy ass to do it. Um, it's in big chunks. I'm gonna upload things in big chunks, so be ready to be like, oh shit, every episode of Pokemon all at once. And I'll try to do that and eventually I'll catch up to where we're at today. Um, actually, now's a really good time to do it considering like a lot of different series are ending, so. Maybe I'll nag my girlfriend for the Wii U. Finish off Metroid Prime. That could be a good time. But it's Halloween, Max. Silent Hill. We should do Silent Hill. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So, as I said, thank you all so much for coming. I hope you enjoyed. We will do Pokemon in the future, just like we'll do Final Fantasy VII Remake in the future. We just need a little bit of a break. That's all. And, yeah. I'm going to keep reviewing myself. Thank you so much for coming. I hope you had fun. And I hope to see you then. <sighs> I'm going to go eat food. The stream has been going for six and a half hours. But I had a wonderful time. And I hope you guys did too. Alright. Thank you for coming. Bye. Bloop.